lovely jewellery makers. How are we all? Oh, I can't tell you how glad I am to be here this morning <laughs> for many, many reasons. In particular, because this is my first official show with the lovely Nick here. How are you doing, darling? Oh, I'm really, really good. I it's am. lovely Amazing. to see you. Oh, it's gorgeous I will apologise for coming in and just I'm just complaining. Don't. I don't normally whinge like that. You're still gorgeous <laughs> with it. I've loved it. Adam's like, uh, I don't. I'm not. I don't. I hope I don't. <laughs> Sorry. Just, just any project at home, any any kind of building. Stressful, isn't yes. it? never had to do anything like this before but isn't it stressful it takes over your whole life it yeah does. but you'll soon be through it soon through it uh, as soon as I go home from work it'll be done it will be done yeah. anyway we have got a super I want to say Wednesday see because I should have been here on a Wednesday yeah. but it's not it's a Thursday isn't it, it is. we've got Definitely. a super Thursday show not only because we've got the lovely Nikki with absolutely beautiful jewelry it and is. Didn't you say you turned your hand to something a bit new? A little bit new last night, so I'm going to have a little go of it. What, what better time than to do it why live not? on air? Yeah, why not? Why not? Do you want to talk us through your kits? Because they're amazing. Absolutely. I'm loving the colours. These are the nine o'clock kits. These are the unbelievable Panther Onyx kits. They yeah, they're stunning. Are gorgeous. Um, the colours I just think are so spring-like. They're just giving me so much joy. Oh. And then look 12 o'clock kits very beautiful oh honestly i was saying these are the perfect kits if you've either never picked up a pair of pliers before okay and you want to have a go or you know if you've lost your mojo a little bit and yeah you're, you're just thinking i don't know what to do i don't know what to make these both of these projects will be great for that yeah, right. and of course we've got you to inspire us as well Hopefully. and i remember going back to sort of i think the beginning of the competition nikki yeah. and you were saying that you're really inspired by the sea is Absolutely. that right Absolutely. I, I, I live it. right by the sea lucky very you lucky live right right by a gorgeous beach and so it's in my blood Definitely. It's in your blood. Yeah, completely. And we can definitely see some of that inspiration, I yeah, think, absolutely. in your beautiful jewellery. Well, I can't wait for that. It's going to be amazing, yeah, all your lovely it. pieces. So your Cartier, Cartier de Panther um, inspiration kits um, at nine o'clock. Well, they are going to fly, yeah. without doubt. They will fly. Yeah. And the most amazing colours and gemstone kits um, at 12 o'clock as well. Your early bird, and it's funny because Nikki said, is it, is, it, is it sad that I'm really <sighs> excited about the early bird? I was like, no, not okay. at all. Honestly, I'm so excited about it. I actually <laughs> sent an email last night about it, literally wringing my hands with excitement. <laughs> and that's because you've got closed jump rings, but not as we would maybe originally think. They're like, they're not as you know it. Um, they are more like connectors, I think they, they could be. They are. They're, they're, they're so versatile. There's so many things you can do with them. Don't even get me started. Honestly. Yeah. Oh, well, that's, isn't it? As jewellery makers, especially established jewellery makers, you know, we might overlook, you know, what these can actually do, but they transform pieces of jewellery, don't they? Absolutely. And, and when they're as beautiful as that, they actually, and I'll show you later on, they are pieces of jewellery. Yeah, too, totally. Which is you know magic totally well these are in the hour right now jewelry makers so if you have a look at the website all the w's at jewelrymaker.com um, click watch live in the right hand side of the screen and then if you scroll down scroll down like this ross is showing you amazing um you see an item number one and two <laughs> <laughs> there they are your early birds now do ignore those prices because they're your early birds so they will be going lower um, but by shopping ahead you are guarantee your success um, and keep an eye out because there's lots of these some of these might be quite low in quantity so if there's something you've been desperate for my advice would be pounce on it now um, because if they go lower then of course you will get that price reduction as well um, so and items do tend to sell out super fast in the eight o'clock hour also jewelry makers your deal of the day oh there's items selling out already look yeah not surprised um your deal of the day there it is sold out there's a couple more i saw as well um i love these so you get excited about jump rings i get excited about spaces oh we that, that too that too yeah because these you could just literally put them on elastic couldn't you and make a most beautiful piece of jewelry 
I can see them from over here, how sparkly are they? I know, they're I know, gorgeous. they're five millimetres in their size. Um, in 925 sterling silver, of course, lovely jewellery makers. So these are coming up at 10 o'clock. We've done spacer beads for many moons, haven't we? Yeah. However, um, the bigger size is, I think, really is very much a new addition. Absolutely. Um, in fact, this is bundled, says Ross. Wow. So you're getting the two packs. Um, we've got, <clears throat> say that again, what do you say? Get them for a low price, absolutely, because they're bundled. So not only is it a deal of the day, it's a bundled deal of the day. Yes, there's 40 925 sterling silver spacers. So we've previously brought them to air in a pack of 20. Today, you get 40 um, and a better price. So make sure you're with us for 10 o'clock hour. For example, I mean, if I just bring these over, which are coming up, the most amazing Amazonite. I mean, look how perfect they are together. These are coming up at 10 o'clock as well. So yeah, just putting your, whichever size, these are brand new. And I have to tell you, there's lovely translucency to it as well. These would look incredible with your deal of the day, don't you think? Just literally re-stranded, just like so. They're just Job job done um, we've got lots of other strands as well but this is a brand new parcel of Amazonite night that's coming up uh, in the 10 o'clock hour so <clears throat> and of course the early bird they would go lovely with these too wouldn't completely. they completely yep perfect. so much you could do with them perfect um, also I want to show you these amazing pearls that are we're going to do a massive deal on these everybody they are huge in their size they are perfect um, in their virtues of course um, you've got fireballs oh they're amazing you've got from the peach to the purple to the almost silver and they're totally and utterly natural now there's 38 available of those jewelry makers so that's not that many however when we consider the fact that these are <coughs> these are natural pearls and we know what's going on in the pearl world um, that's actually a really good quantity so um, make sure you're with me for that also as we mentioned the brand new parcel of your amazonite let's show you the brand new parcel of natural aquamarine if you're inspired by the sea nikki i could see your eyes widen oh you didn't tell me about all of these these oh, are incredible oh i know i know i'm sorry yeah we we like we like to do just you know drip feed it into yeah, the show absolutely and just and then you can see the reaction live on air you see they're beautiful aren't they yes done in such a lovely color and look how they shine against that silver yeah gorgeous again with your deal of the day again yeah. with your early bird it's all gonna work perfectly so jewelry makers as always drop us a message we'd love to hear from you this morning on this very rainy thursday it's just done nothing but rain hasn't it no i know but it's soon it's going isn't it it is going it's yeah. got to it's got to the daffs are sprouting now yeah, aren't they, they spring are. is spring is on the horizon um, yeah, I can see a few of my little daffs and my pots po poking their heads up. That's, see, whether it's, I don't know if it's because I'm, I, I grew up in Wales, but that for me is a really nice sign yeah. when you start seeing the daff sprouting. Yeah, I it's love like that. A, I love that with the crocus as well. Yeah. We live by a lovely park and I run through it yesterday and there were crocus everywhere. They're so like, pretty, oh, aren't they? Beautiful. Yeah, so yeah. pretty. Um, so drop us a message. Tell us what you're up to this Thursday morning. Are you staying in or have you got to venture out in this rain? Or maybe it's glorious sunshine where you are. I'm not sure. Um, shall we get cracking with... Oh, yes. Not what I was expecting, Roscoe. When you said lapis lazuli, I was expecting you to say it was a strand. But no, this is actually a cabochon, a faceted cabochon, no less. Um, oh, look, how beautiful. Oh, wow. So great for those of you that follow our social media, which I would encourage because we see lovely content on there. Um, <clears throat> you'd have seen, I think it was Claire, wasn't it? Claire doing that, that lovely um, Amazonite ring, or was it turquoise? Not sure. But if you follow social media, you can see the demonstration on there. £11.99, pence. what do you think? For a two carat lapis lazuli faceted round. Beautiful. Let me just double check something. I wouldn't. Yeah, I'm going to, I think it looks like a cabochon to me. It looks like a cab. Yeah, it's faceted. Yeah. A faceted cab. £4.99. Beautiful flex of pyrite inclusions. Mm. Like a starry night. Where else in the world will you get an 8mm, 2 carat, natural, uh, from the original location of source? Uh, aqua, uh, lapis lazuli <laughs> for £4.99 where else in the world how about them oh. <clears throat> just work, I'm just work, like, warming up my vocal cords a second because some of you might know what I'm about to do <clears throat> just warming them up do you know what's going to happen now Nikki no I don't 
<coughs> just clear your throat. You need to clear your throat because uh, <coughs> something's about to happen. Are we all ready? How many have you got, Ross? There's 90 available. Oh gosh, I'm really gonna have to work, uh, you know, warm up my vocal cords then this morning. Okay, some of you might know that producer Ross, he's got a bit of a trademark now that starts every single Ross show. Um, and I think that by the reaction on the web and on the phone lines, you all know what's going on. Yeah, I shouldn't do this so early in the morning because there's a likelihood that I lose my voice. That might be a positive, <laughs> you never know. Um, but in 13 seconds, you will know what's going on. Manchester knows, Chantal knows, Neil and Linda know, Ella knows, Ra uh, Rachel knows, and Tracy knows, and Dawn, and Hilda, and everybody else that's joining us, Jacqueline and Manchester, another Pat C, Patsy. Are you ready? It's a pen. It's a pen. It's a pen. pen. <laughs> that was very good. It was very good. That was good. It's a pen. Down. Pen. 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 Oh, that was really husky and whispery as well. Batman, um, yeah. <laughs> Batman voice, yeah. Oh, he has got a husky voice, hasn't he? Yeah, you're going the Christian Bale route, are you? Um, I was more thinking about uh, Frank Butcher. Oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. Oh, right, pet, 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 pet. 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 Um, <laughs> one pound only. That's why. So <laughs> honestly, I shouldn't do. That's it obscene makes... for a pound. <laughs> it, it is obscene. Is. It's a genuine gemstone. It's obscene, and to have one that's faceted as yeah. well, and a cab. Yeah. Amazing. We've got to we've got to look at it this way, you know. We've got to mine the gemstone, find the gemstone yeah. firstly. I mean, this is from the original location of source, so I guess the mine would be established. You got to mine it. You got to facet it. You've got to package it, you've got to QA it, yep. uh, you've got to transport it, and you've got to broadcast it, and we go, pound, 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 pound. So many multi-buyers, well done, everybody. London's just bought, no, sorry, Manchester's just bought 11. Not surprised. Not London, that's Manchester. Manchester's bought 11. Um, do I know how much that person's paid? Um, 11 pound. <laughs> Quick math. My math is bad. <laughs> it's not that bad. <laughs> you know, Suffolk, who's bought four, do you know how much, how much they've paid? Hang on, hang on, let me just work this out. One second. One second. Is it, is it, is it three pound? Close. No, it's four. Close, close, sorry, close, sorry. Yeah. Do I get a sticker? Yeah. Four pound! Four pound for beautiful lapis lazuli. Ah, oh, funny, aren't we? And we're a hoot. Um, <laughs> well done, everybody. You can say lots of things about us here at Jewelry Maker. You can call us one. We are a hoot, though. We're <laughs> definitely a hoot. <laughs> Amazing. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. Uh, let's do the what? Oh, these. I almost said that line, Ross. You were expecting it. They're not here. They're not here. They actually look a bit mookite. Mm. <laughs> um, here we go. What time are the five old pearls coming up, please, says Manchester. We're, they'll be in the between 10 and 11 in that hour, my lovely. So, um, sorry, I should have mentioned that. There are only 38, there are only 38. So, <clears throat> and they're absolutely incredible. And we're gonna do a massive deal on them as well. So definitely worthwhile tuning it in. Um, we're not messing around, we're not messing around. They look very Mukai-esque. Mukai is a Jasper, of course. Um, however, you see where I'm coming from. Mm. How amazing are these? They're gorgeous. Very cool, I love the markings. Amazing. Beautiful blends of colours. Not messing around though. It's a pound. Oh, behave. I know, I know, <laughs> I know, I know. For the tassels alone, surely. Honestly. Because this is a tassel strand. You know, we called them gem gems of distinction at one point. They still are. Exactly, exactly. And it's not like, you know, they're coming to their, uh, their sell-by date or anything like no, that, no. you know. 
where like, like you know if you go to the market things are massively reduced yeah, because yeah. they're coming to the end of their sell by date or use by date whatever it might be this this has been forming within the ground for thousands of years you're all right it hasn't got a shelf life how amazing is that it is purely because you know it's become ross's his little his little signature basically isn't it ross um he says that an excellent work he says well yes yes you being what an, an outstanding producer oh love that you what that's your signature what <laughs> being the best Modest, he does say that modesty. a lot by the way. he does <laughs> say this nicky he's like well i am the best i mean well, he, well i'm oh, difficult isn't it <laughs> well, you know, he is. he's like i am the best though aren't i you know i am the best it's very modest is ross very very modest um okay moving on to the earrings these are pretty Mm. These have a white, ooh, ooh, white topaz. Amazing. Oh, talking about those fireball pearls. How amazing would these be on the fireball pearls? Just a second. Sorry, my tweezers. I've, I've lost the ability to use tweezers <laughs> in all the stress, I think, of the last few days. Here you are. Oh, look at oh. those. They're stunning. Put one of your half drilled gemstones or not. It could be a fully drilled gemstone. How beautiful are they? That's They're a round brilliant cut topaz. Pure, colourless, dazzling with brilliance. Um, and then you have a little, little peg bale as well. Adam's like, have you been practising, Elle, on your days off? No, mostly I've just been shouting. Mostly, <laughs> mostly. <laughs> mostly, I have to say, stressful couple of days. Oh, I can imagine. Very, very, very stressful. But it'll be all good. I can leave it to my husband today. He can sort it all out. Love he that. sorted out the final things. And then I'll go home to, uh, go home to an actual concealed house, which is Beautiful. nice. It's yeah. a luxury, isn't it? One, one that people can't <laughs> just walk into when they feel like it. Well, it's willy-nilly, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> one that hasn't got gale force winds running straight through it. <laughs> <laughs> and just a precariously bo uh, a precariously balanced board. Oh, that's secure. No, it's not. <laughs> it's not secure. Nineteen pounds and ninety nine pence. I mean, Nikki, you could remove that chain and wear them as studs if you wanted to. You absolutely to. could. And the thing is, as well, we're saying about putting half drills on. You don't have to put half drills no. on. You can put a full drill through. And what you can do, if you're not loving the little hole that shows at the <coughs> bottom, a little dab of glue, cut the end off a little head pin, pop it in the bottom. Boop. Beautiful. Job done. Yeah. Job done. I like that idea. Yeah. I like that idea. So then you just got a little flash of luster, haven't Absolutely. you? Absolutely. Yeah. Amazing. Um, at 19.99, that's an amazing deal. These are solid 925 sterling silver, and you have got two beautiful round brilliant cut topaz. I've never seen these before. They're no, lovely, they aren't they? Wow. Oh. So, oh, they only launched last week. That's why then. Six pounds and ninety-nine pence only to get hold of these. Just the perfect little drop. Not too much. Nope. Just a little bit to suspend below the earlobe. Beautiful. I mean, like I said, imagine your pearls. Imagine some of your Amazonite. That would look lovely too. It doesn't have to be a pearl, does no, it? No, absolutely. They could be any of your gemstones. They're just gorgeous. And they would go with absolutely anything. They're your everyday dazzling earrings yeah totally you know, if you don't want to just wear studs but you don't want the massive exactly. shoulder dusters yeah. um then these would be a fantastic alternative yeah. i mean just as an example let me just lift these up oh dan's with me thanks dan <laughs> oh don't do that Al. look at that look, just literally put one of your aquamarines <gasps> on there so pretty and super simple to make even i could do that nikki oh so easy honestly so easy to make yeah if I can do it, then I can absolutely guarantee you can too, because I'm not the most talented of jewelry makers. No. Um, amazing, well done everybody. Make sure you're checking out your baskets now. You've got 41 minutes on this hour. Don't forget as well your lovely uh, early bird. <coughs> who, how many do we have? Got 100 available, they only launched last week. Who would like these under five pounds no today? Way. Hey. Me. I'd be multi-buying on them, Nikki. Because I mean, I'm hoping that somebody on my behalf <coughs> is doing so at the moment. Right. Well, I hope that person is watching right now. Not sleeping. No. Is she, there a probability? She probably will be. She probably will be yeah. sleeping in, yeah. She in uni. Yeah. Yeah, she's probably going to be sleeping, yeah, let's will. be honest. Yeah. 
Um, <laughs> although she might be awake, set the alarm so she can see her lovely mum on, on TV. You would think, wouldn't you? Yeah. Yeah, probably I'm not. sure. No, I've got faith. I reckon, I reckon. Cleo, you, you're awake, aren't you, lovely? You're awake. Texting if Texting, you're awake, Texting, Cleo, Cleo, are you awake? <laughs> Shopping on behalf of your mum. At £6.99, it's amazing, but it's not the closing price. As promised, these are going under £5. And like many of you, I would absolutely be multiplying because they're a nice little stash essential, aren't they? Absolutely. And do you know what they're brilliant <coughs> for as well? That little present. And the, yeah. You know, we've got Mother's Day coming up yeah. soon, haven't we? You've literally got to pop a couple of your just beautiful little gems on there. Done. Job done. And, we had, and we've had some lovely boxes recently. Yeah, we have. You know, the ones with the little on pearls them. on. Yeah. How beautiful would these be in those boxes? Yeah. Four pounds. In fact, yes, I bought some of those boxes. So a couple of these. Yeah, make them up. Have them in the present yeah, drawer. Yeah, Job done. Lovely. There's nothing to not love about them, isn't no. it? That's the point. No. Shall I put one of them in the ear so you can actually get an idea? These are studio samples, so don't worry. Um, really simple studs. The kind of earring that, like I said, you could wear... Yeah. Um, on a daily basis, yeah. probably never even take off because they're so comfortable. But someone's always going to say, I love your earrings when yeah, you wear them. Absolutely. Always. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. See, I do this to myself. I put myself <laughs> on pressure on it. Have I, is that right? Yes. That's skill, that. That is skill. I've done it a few times, <laughs> but it doesn't always go so seamlessly. Look how beautiful they are. They're twinkly. Oh, I love them. Gorgeous. Just got that little bit of movement there. Oh, look at those. Yeah, just pop one of your little gemstones, whichever it might be. Maybe the Amazonite would work, the ac Aquamarine would definitely work, or some of your pearls. Do you know what? Even one of your silver, which are coming up, spacer beads on there. Yeah, nice. Would just look gorgeous. Yeah, just beautiful. Just that extra little bit of silver. Love beautiful. that. Absolutely love that. Four pounds and 99 pence. We had a hundred of them. Julian Cheshire, Helena, Leslie, Linda, Manchester, Wanda, Jill, Maker, Tracy, Anna, Dawn, uh, Lincolnshire, Hertfordshire. Who am I looking at? Is it would Cle would it be Cleo's name? It or would, would it be. Uh, she'd be in uh, in Newcastle. That's in Newcastle, right? Yeah. Okay, we're looking out for you, Cleo. Uh, Maker Jan, <laughs> Greater London. Hello to you, Lynn, Beverly, Cynthia, Joanne, Jacqueline. Um, amazing. I'm going to be adding these to my order as well. In those nice little pearl boxes. What yeah. a beautiful gift. Stunning. Um, and at 4 99 as well. 60 second clock, because that's a crazy low deal, everybody. Um, <coughs> there are currently 38 of you with it in your basket. Get them while you can. Uh, and like many of you, twos, threes, fours, I'm not surprised. I would be no. too. Because like you said, it's a nice, it, it, just a nice little, it's a lovely earring finding, isn't it? And knowing with what's coming up later on on the show, uh -huh. I would be multiplying them now. Okay. What are you thinking with now? Those. Yeah, with yeah. the yeah with the Amazonite. Yeah, yeah they'd be beautiful. 100%. Absolutely yeah. beautiful. 28 seconds and we've got to move on, jewellery makers. They are still currently available. They're not guaranteed to you if you've just got them loitering in your basket, just so you know. You do need to confirm um, and check out. Don't worry, you can still add to that order. It's one post and packaging all day. You're not gonna be uh, you're not gonna be charged every time that you check out so don't worry um, that's per day so if you're thinking oh, I'll keep it in my basket and check out when I finish shopping that's, yeah you don't need to do that in fact you'll probably find items do sell out then um, so check out your baskets and add to your order it's, it just comes up would you like to combine your order and you go yes yes I'll combine my order um, okay amazing now if you love your silver essentials we've got a fantastic early bird for you today um, and we've also got a whole hour of essentials in the 10 o'clock hour or so um, launching with your deal of the day which are your five millimeter spacer beads absolutely beautiful at nine o'clock should we be brave should we put all those essentials on pre-order shall we yeah including the deal of the day <gasps> really i'll tell you what Ross, he's, he's, you can twist his arm very easily. If enough, enough of you show Ross the love, say, yes, Ross, we want them on pre-order at nine o'clock, then he yeah. will do it. He's that easily, you, you don't have to, you, you were, you, you're easily led, aren't you, Ross? <laughs> Did it get you in trouble when you were in school? Got you in trouble when you were, you were a, 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 a youth. You're still a youth. You're still a youth. Yeah, still a, a youth. Bang, yeah. yeah, but a babe. Um, <laughs> um, so let, if you're texting, if you're texting, the fact that I just used the word youth, youth yeah. says that I'm probably not described as that. 
middle-aged now, aren't I? No. I am. No. I'm middle-aged. Uh, although, I, yeah, middle-aged. I don't mind that, though. I hated turning 30. Hated Did it. Did you? Yeah, I don't I, I I've loved to be in my being in my forties. Yeah, I turned fifty. Um You never fifty. I did, yeah, I turned fifty last year. And I've got to be honest, I love it. Yeah. But I've now found myself say I've, I say all the time, at fifty years of age, I start every sentence with it. <laughs> at fifty years of age Yeah. <laughs> I'm not doing this. Yeah. Or I'm not doing that. Fair at fifty enough. years yeah. of age. Well that's it, you've yeah. got the experience then, haven't you? To back it up. I think at you 50. just get more grumpy. <laughs> I, I can't. I like that. Clearly, I'm not grumpy. I'm no, no, you, you're, you're, you're the least grumpy person I think I could ever imagine. Like this weekend's prime example of how how grumpy I can be. Um, anyway, let's move on to magnetic class. Oh, we launched these Ooh. the other day. Have you seen them? No. So we've had like the magnetic class for ages, haven't we? However, not the little ones. Oh, and we that's were saying. So cute. We were saying the fact that, you know, if you've got a magnetic clasp on a bracelet, you don't want it too big. Yeah. Because actually, because it, it weighs okay. down, yeah. it's going to get in the way. Um, and it might not be aesthetically appealing. Yeah. So yeah. to actually have something maybe that's a little bit more delicate, especially if you're working with your smaller gemstones. Um, so we've commissioned, as you can see, um, they're mm. five millimeters. Now they absolutely flew. We've got how many? We, okay. 15 left yeah. only 15 left so you Come do need then. to be quick and you get both of them as well yeah it's, it's just in terms of that balance isn't it when Absolutely. you're jewelry making yeah definitely and sometimes as well especially when you're making a necklace if you've got something if you've got a clasp that's too that's too heavy it acts as a counterweight and it'll pull yeah. your necklace one way or the other the same <coughs> as a bracelet yeah and you want that gemstone that you've got on your necklace or your bracelet to be seen so if you've got something heavy on it and it's pulling it the wrong yeah, way exactly it's, you know it's annoying so they are yeah if, if, if you want it to be the feature fair enough yeah. but if you want it to, to serve as a as a yeah. class then obviously that's not really what you're going for so um and they are very strong i wonder if i'll show you this um just because they're small doesn't mean that they won't do the job they are mighty. Ob obviously far easier for you to open when they're in a piece of jewelry because you'll have something to hold yeah. on to but here you go here you are. so look if i just hold it in the same vicinity this is the joy of the magnetic class oh was that so quick? Sorry, Adam. Here you go. Ready? <laughs> Beautiful. And when we're talking about accessible jewellery as well, for people who've got dexterity yeah. issues, they are just invaluable. <coughs> they really are. Brilliant. I mean, uh, yeah. I, it, any, it is hard putting bracelets yeah. on, isn't it? Sometimes yeah. I can't get them on. My husband did mine this morning <coughs> for yeah. me. Yeah. It is really hard sometimes. And necklaces, for example, because you can't see. No. You can't see. So this eliminates all of those issues. Now, we're at £39.99. We've only got 15 available, though. That's £20 per class. Now, we said, on launch... £10 for a magnetic class here at Jewelry Maker is pretty good, we Absolutely, think. Absolutely, because they're so hard to come by. So really hard are. to come by. So, if we had one, 9 99 they'd still sell out. Absolutely. Yeah? Yeah. No I think so, but we didn't do that on the launch. These will sell out this morning. Um, again, if you weren't there when we launched these, you, yeah, well, you're in for a treat. You're in for a surprise when we show you the original launch price. You get both of them. <coughs> Beautiful gold plated 925 sterling silver. Wow. There we go. 12 pounds and 99 pence. 6 pound 50 you for a magnetic glass. You can't get these anywhere. No, so and difficult. And if you go on different um, jewelry making, different groups and pages and things like that, people are always asking where you can get them and you can't yeah. get them. Yeah, I you know. Can't. Especially know. in gold as well. <coughs> and, and at six pound fifty. Yeah. And that shape, it's like a bullet shape, isn't it? Yeah. So it's really linear. It's discreet, it's lovely. So here we go, hang on. Just imagine you're making a necklace. Oh, look at that. There you go. There you go. Perfect. It's about that continuity, isn't yeah. it? A big, you know, say I put an eight mil there, it would look too it big. It would. It, it would look too big. Yeah. It depends if that's the look you're going for, but personally, I would prefer a smaller class. Yeah. Um, and it still works in the same way, still got that lovely strength and security. These will sell out today. Well done to you, Wendy, Leslie, Gloucestershire, Renfusha, uh, Lincolnshire, Lorna. I've got Rosemary, Jean, Lynn, Kate, Diane, Christine, Lorna. You've just got yours. Well done. And people are multi buying. Um, yeah, these will sell out this morning. And remember, 
remember you've got what is it about just over half an hour um 30 minutes is it exactly 30 minutes wow. left on this hour before they just disappear even if they're in your basket they'll disappear so make sure you do check them out everybody um and they're getting very limited now very 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 limited yeah. Yeah, and you can use them for a multitude. It's not just necklaces. Use them for bracelets as well. They work really strong. And we were saying if you type or if you write, yeah, maybe, yeah. or anything, if you, you know, if you had a big lobster well a big not just uh, magnetic clasp if you had a big clasp it can get in your way a little yeah, bit yeah. um whereas the more petite size is going to be less intrusive absolutely i'll tell you what i would use them for as well i would use them on a necklace so i could make like an interchangeable one nice so you could change the head of them put nice. some gemstones on the out. bottom of each one swap them out perfect Definitely. yeah that's a great idea um well done natural faceted ruby what you say goodness me so <coughs> I, I follow toby you know to toby cavill on facebook and instagram um and he's uploaded he uploaded last night actually a couple of i mean they were calibrated stones but these most incredible rubies and they were like Two hundred thousand pounds or something like that, but natural rubies. Yeah. Um, and then he showed some from Mozambique. Um, they weren't necessarily Burmese, I don't think. Uh, the one was Mozambique, and there was another one as well. Um, but the price—I mean, they were dazzling, absolutely beautiful. But emphasis on the word natural because it is rare to get hold of natural rubies um, of which these are by the way jewelry makers so it's estimated about five percent of the world's ruby will actually be natural most of it is sort of fisher fill treated heat treated in some way shape or form um, and there it is that beautiful rich regal red which of course has got the a legacy that spans hundreds and thousands of years quite literally um, not a gemstone we see very often in our early bird hour though this with your with your magnetic clasps perfect pop these on your magnetic clasps Absolutely. job done um and maybe your and maybe your hammered uh your hammered jump rings oh. that would be lovely too oh, <laughs> I, <laughs> I just realized i said this because uh, i hesitated at the word hammered maybe, maybe you're hammered <laughs> we're not judging we're not judging, no. we're all friends here. Yeah, it's all good. Hammer jump rings is what I meant to say. Sorry. It's cocktail hours somewhere <laughs> in the world right exactly, now. Exactly, exactly. Um, sorry, hammer jump rings. They would, look at that colour though, oh. Nikki. That's absolutely they're beautiful, gorgeous. isn't it? And you know what as well I love with Ruby? Ruby they're perfect for bracelets because they're really tough. They're yeah. really hard wearing. Yeah. So bracelets that you're going to wear every day, that you're going to see a little bit of rough and tumble. Yep gorgeous love that yeah right up there nine on the most scale yeah so just below your diamond so you could wear a tennis bracelet of ruby Absolutely. on a daily basis yeah. which you would, probably wouldn't say with many of your gemstones um sorry what was that that bracelet we just made with the natural aquamarine yeah gold bladed magnetic class throw in some ruby oh and and your hammer jump rings all of the above pretty amazing absolutely be. beautiful Stunning. And at 49.99 that's an absolutely amazing price but i've got a funny feeling we're not stopping there how about easy maths easy maths quick maths how about burnt a carrot that's very good for natural ruby totally natural ruby and it's not lesser quality ruby would be almost borderline maroon yeah Get you that know, brown tinge to yeah, it. Yeah, browny, dark colour, sort of like my school uniform was. Yeah. You know, not it's not like, oh, that's a nice colour. Yeah. You know, a bit I yeah. like maroon, but no, it's like a brownie maroon, not so much. And I don't want that in my ruby, no. more to the point. Because it's not recognisable as a ruby, that is Definitely. You yeah. can tell immediately that it is. Okay. So let's half that price then, everybody, shall we? <laughs> And I'll say, we're still not done. Remember that article that I was reading to you as well, the jewellery editor, where we were talking about the fact that, of course, the Burmese ruby mine is closing imminently. It's uh, after thousands of years of history. So, of course, uh, jewellers are looking to other known ruby sources, like your Mozambique, like your Madagascar, like India, um, to fill those boots effectively. Yeah, yeah. And they're big boots to fill. But it's this colour. It's not to say that the it was only Burma that produces, p p produced pigeon blood red. It's not the case. Um, for example, the ones that Toby was showing on his social media, you know, they were that perfect pigeon blood colour. And they were from, I think it was... Uh, um, I think it might have been Mozambique actually but um, either way 
you can see the quality ah i know what you're about to say ross ross has stopped the clock because he said look we've got natural ruby natural yeah. we're at 20 pounds and there's no way i knew you were going to say that there's no way near enough people on the phone lines he digs his heels in sometimes you know no. this is what i was referencing look so the jewelry editor which by the way you can all access this um african rubies fill the void left by burmese rubies with, with uh red flashes of rich red with prized burmese ruby mines virtually depleted gem hunters are turned to africa in their quest to find the perfect red gem there you go yeah now we are under 20 pounds for 40 carats of natural ruby and we are going lower in oh, imagine these are some white pearls they'd be amazing in 25 seconds we're going to crash that price how many do we have then roscoe 27. oh lincolnshire's just them. stacked up three natural ruby we become complacent nikki don't so, we though and the thing is if you make jewelry to sell <clears throat> if you're selling natural ruby yeah. you're big time you are yeah. you know you're you are because ruby is so recognizable as being one of the most desirable gemstones. Absolutely. Everybody knows what a ruby is. Absolutely. Even my youngster knows yeah. what, 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 what ruby is. She calls it treasure. And yeah. it's true, it is. Yeah. How many places? Treasure, not Trevor. <laughs> Although that would be really cute. Anyway. Uh, £14 pounds and not Where in the world, genuine question, where in the world can you source natural ruby of this quality? Look at the colour. Even treated, you're right. Treated yeah. ruby. Where in the world can you get it other than here? Because I don't know. No, I and generally don't know. It's a birthstone as well. Exactly, yeah. July babies. I told you. Oh, is it your your July baby, Dan? There you go. Um, I told you that story that I uh, when Willow was born, I said, right, I'm going to start saving because I want to treat myself to a, 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 a ruby piece of jewellery. Yeah. And of course, I was thinking my sister yeah. channel maybe, but actually, I fell in love with that one elsewhere. And I would have paid a higher price for it. I knew that. Yeah. Um, anyway, I, it was Fisher filled. It was Fisher filled yeah. ruby. It was still lovely. It's still ruby. Don't get me wrong. Teeny weeny weeny ones, by the way. Tiny tiny. Eight hundred pounds. That piece of yeah. jewellery cost me. And it was it was Fisher filled ruby. You're getting natural. I love the design. That's why I bought it. Mm -hmm. um, because I do often get asked that question. Why do you buy it then? I was like, because I like the design. Um, so I knew I was, paid, I was paying more than I should have been if I was shopping here at Jewelry Maker. £14.99. pence. Look at the richness of colour. Don't miss out. Come nine o'clock, this will disappear. But in all honesty, I've got six left. So if Teresa checks out, Alison, Maker, Jacqueline, Diane, a new customer, if your checkout is gone, well done. Um, I've been eyeing up this strand, Roscoe. This strand's so pretty. It's lovely. I'd use this with your deal of the day. Oh. I've been looking at this too. This so is So pretty. In fact, I'm going to bring both of those over. When was the last time we had pre night? Oh, I love pre night. I mean, I speaking of it. spring, yeah. I think pre night is the perfect spring it gem. It's ethereal pre night. Yeah. It's beautiful. Love it. Absolutely love it. Often a favourite, actually, amongst uh, many lapidrists. Yeah. The likes of Glenn Lehrer, for example, is a big fan of. Yeah pre-night because of its softer colour and almost like silvery green colour it, it plays with light I mean look at that it plays with light now the difference between let me just explain pre-night and we've had pre-night for many years but I used to think pre-night was all about the black inclusions mm. uh, <clears throat> pre-night like this you can see how minimal you've got some don't get me yeah. wrong but how minimal the black inclusions are so it should have a lovely mm. translucency almost jade-esque i suppose um so it should actually have a um, a translucency to it i can remember bringing the first gem quality uh pre-night to air and i remember because the powers that be um sort of sat me down and said okay this is going to be one of the most expensive strands of pre-night that jewelry maker has ever brought to air i was like okay why tell me why yeah. and it was all down to the t told me all down to the quality of it and it was about 50 pounds i think it was mm -hmm. um so it's still not bad don't get me wrong look at the gem quality that you're getting here and we're starting at 24.99 um faceted six millimeter rounds again i would be definitely using these with my dealer yeah. day you think? And can I say, Elle, as well, you're not really getting across on screen what they look like in real life. I totally agree. They're so totally, sparkly. Totally, totally agree. They're so beautiful. They yeah. really are. It's a shame in a way. The sparkle's but not coming across, no, is it? The, the luster. They're absolutely stunning. I would be grabbing these. They're yeah. beautiful. Well, first price crash, Nikki. 
We were at 24.99, which is amazing. Which is amazing. Look at that. First, oh you know, when Adam's gosh. recording, look at the back of the, the photo, the screen. See where it just, you just get almost like dusting of luster. Oh, that's it. That's what you can see. Yes, it just, it's a light performance. Yeah. At the back of that screen, the facets are just perfection. And again, that makes sense to me because that's why so many lipidorists love this yep. gem. They love this and they love Praiserlite. Yeah. Those are two soft green gemstones that really work yep. for fa with faceting. We're starting here at 9.99. How many have we got, Roscoe? Exactly 30. Can I just put together just the most beautiful kit? Look at oh. that, that is springtime. Look how pretty that is. It's just gorgeous, isn't it? It's Amazing. The green field and the summer sky. Oh, beautiful. Abs and maybe a nice soft rose quartz or something like oh, that yeah. in there. That would be beautiful too. It, <coughs> you've seen it with, pre with Chrysoprase. Yeah, it'd be beautiful. Mm. I love that strand. Oh, I see what you mean. Seven pounds and ninety-nine pence only. It's the light performance with this, the brilliance, just... but also the surface luster. Um, Ross is saying it looks a little bit like this piece, obviously in contrast. Yeah. I know that's turquoise <coughs> with chrysoprase, but you could kind of flip it round. Seven ninety-nine, absolutely unbelievable. Um, we've got quantity, but they are going super, super, super fast. Um, please make sure you do check out your baskets, everybody, to guarantee your success because. That I mean, it's what, 22.9 now? Goodness me, where's time gone? Um, so every item will disappear if they don't ha sell out. Leslie, Lavinia, hello to you. Lynn getting four, Linda, Paula getting two, Tracy getting two, Angela yeah. getting two. Uh, morning, everybody. Uh, come say hi as well. We'd love to hear from you. Very excited to be here today. Yeah. Very, very excited. Just I'm loving being here. Yeah. That's great for you, just to calm the Escape. Tail. Yeah. Escape. Absolutely. It's um, <laughs> Adam's just said, but you're right. We are the best. <laughs> you are you are good company. To be fair, yeah, you are good company. Work is never a chore when you come into the jewelry maker studio. I have to say, no, it's not. It's just such a gorgeous way to spend your time. It, it is. really is. Yeah. It never feels yeah. like work. It is. Yeah, it's true. It's lovely. We, yeah, we, we, we talk about a few gemstones, get amazing inspiration, we have coffee and have a little yeah, chill, bit of a lovely. giggle. It is. It's just all around nice, isn't it? But I love that about the whole community as well, because yeah. I love the Facebook community too. Yes. And it is, it's a real family and a community. I'm yeah, it's very, it. very nice. Very, yeah. very nice. Thanks, gorgeous Dan. Thank you. Sorry, I let my iPad log out then. Um, <laughs> amazing. Yeah, he's not Dan. He's gorgeous, gorgeous Dan, by Dan. the way. He is gorgeous. Dan. Um, just so you know, and, and this is by their own description. So we've got gorgeous Dan, yeah. uh, handsome Adam. So what do you call yourself? Handsome Adam. Sorry. Yeah. Love that. Yeah. And then we've got, <laughs> I was going to call you Rascal Ross. Yeah. Ross called Ross. Well dressed Ross. There we go. Well dressed Ross. Not bad. <laughs> no, but no, but hang on, Ross. You, you, what you're forgetting here is these are titles that they've given themselves. So you need to give yourself yeah. a title. So what? What would you? What would you want? What? What's your title, please? You need to sleep on it. There you go. See. He was so well dressed. He was so well dressed yesterday. Yeah. Was he? Was he? What were you wearing yesterday, Ross? Oh, uh, yeah, very nice. Yeah, nice. Had, a, had, a, had a new jumper on the yeah. other day. He did look very handsome. It was nice. Uh, um, it suited you, Roscoe, you know, that colour. Can I, um, speaking of suiting, can I just show you something? Oh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I wasn't about to say that, Ross. But look, yeah. How lovely is that? Beautiful. I mean, it's it's just out of this world. Hang on. How nice that is. You know what? Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Oh. Oh wait. Hang on. No, actually, I'm going to mix this up a bit. Now we're talking. What do we reckon to that? Yeah. Yes. How lovely is that as a kit? Look at that. So pretty. All coming up in today's show. All coming your way. Um, okay, we're going to do a big close out on the Buddha, by the way, which is so icy translucent. Are we going to do it now? Yes. Okay, so a few years ago when we first had Jadeite and when we first started introducing the carvings, it was actually Buddha that was the first one, I believe. I believe. 
Anyway, um, this little guy, and I remember seeing a version, he is drilled, by the way, so you've got a very discreet 45, uh, um, like a 45 degree angle drill hole, so just there. You know, some years ago, how much would this have been? Because I remember seeing them in Pillar, Pillar and Stone, and they were, what, 2000 or something like that, $2,000? But what about, never mind them, what about Jewelry Maker? You know, would he have been 199 149 maybe that's what ross was thinking and he's the man with the deals hand carved beautifully ice translucent you're gonna get we're already under 100 pounds give his belly a rub that again he gives you happiness there you go that's what the happy buddha of happiness is all about he's so sweet but you're so right ross what a couple of years ago you know a few years ago when we first started bringing you your type a jadeite um, carvings, which, by the way, hindsight, when the uh, Burmese mine was still in operation, wasn't it? It's not anymore. So it should have gone the opposite way, if that makes sense. Um, our prices should have gone up, not down. We're at 99.99, but you're about to get a massive deal. Again, just to show you on the reverse, he is drilled. Can you see that just there? So very discreet. You could put one of your, you could put a jump ring on there. You could put a clip bail. You could lock said not directly onto there. You could not normally not or yeah. normally bead big close out deal on your happiness buddha there he is look i remember seeing this i was at tucson on when that photo was taken he's roland schlussel and you know jake look at the buddha yeah mm -hmm. how much was he one thousand two <coughs> so, there we go one thousand two hundred and eighty dollars for that one Buddha, and that's 28 by 22. Very similar in proportions and size to yours. In fact, yeah, someone did buy it and they put it in jewelry. We found that piece of jewelry. Roland told us where it was. $4,100, wow. but that's wholesale. Wholesale, so it was set literally immediately into gold. That's, that's the value of jade. And it's gone up since then. Now, this is a price that you're not paying uh, 99 pounds and 99 pence. But you're also not paying this. What on earth is that, that all about, Ross? How many have you got? Oh, I've, I, I, Nikki, I'm in that situation like you. <laughs> I, I so want to buy these. That's ridiculous at 29.99. <laughs> it is ridiculous. Seriously. The thing is, as well, what I would say with this is beware of cheap imitations. Yes. Because there is so much cheap rubbish out there on the market and it's not jade it's definitely it not type more a than this. yeah exactly we we laboratory cert everything it's yep. type a grade we've never brought you type b or type no. c um I, absolutely i 100 percent support what nikki was just saying jade is such a loosely used term um, and it's not actually jade or nephrite no. even this is totally and utterly natural type a jade I, and we're not stopping here this is madness do you know what I'm going to be grateful if these don't sell out because yeah. I will buy the remaining quantity. I'm, and I won't. I don't know what, especially what I'm going to do with them as of yet. Put it. it this is this is this is a collector's piece. Ross, this is madness. You know those earring findings we just had. Get two. Oh, wow. How beautiful they be in earrings. I, I just think they're gorgeous. Just literally just giving them to somebody yeah. as they are. Yeah. Just to carry in their handbag or their pocket or whatever. They're just beautiful. You know, they don't really need any other embellishment. No. So, Ross is just saying I've gone through the history and found out when it was launched. And we had some Buddhas that were 149. We had 150 of this little chappy, hand carved. So on launch, we took it to 79.99. Today, you can buy four of them for that amazing okay. price. I am not surprised. Manchester, I would be doing exactly the same as you, getting multiples. Yeah. Manchester's got eight. Julie, London, Sandra, Jackie, Jacqueline, Frederick, multi-buying, Emma, uh, Leslie, Lou, Mary in Cardiff. Uh, that I agree. Ross is just saying in my ear that's one of the best Jade Eye deals um, I think that we've ever brought yeah. to you. I mean, it is. Look, 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 look at the little folds of his robe. His jolly little cheeks. That's all hand carved. Amazing. It's type A, it's not imitation. You know, and, and really be mindful of the fact because um, what you're looking for is 
type A jadeite. That's yeah. all you need, type A jadeite. If they say type B, type C, then you know it's treated. But you want the word jadeite rather, or nephrite, yeah. not the word jade. We sometimes use it, but we'll tell yeah, you. Absolutely. It will tell you which jade it is. See, jade is sometimes used for other more plentiful gemstones, quartz. It's sometimes yeah. used for things like, uh, um, um, I've gone blank. Prenite, we've just seen that with prenite, but other gems which are much more abundant, or even a resin. Yeah. That's the thing, it's, it, That's it can it. be referencing a the glass. colour. A glass. Yeah. yeah, we don't, we bring you the real, genuine gemstone um, here. Yeah, so be mindful. And even the use of the word genuine, mm. it can be it genuine what? Genuine what? Yeah. It's, you've got to be really, really careful. Uh, 19.99, it's going to be an on-screen sellout. Mariska, Lynn, Janice, Rachel, Julie, London, Sandra, Jackie, uh, Jacqueline, Frederick, Susan, Linda, Gloucestershire, Hampshire, Surrey, Weldon, Shoe, Natalie, you'll need to check out if you want those, my yeah. lovely. Joanna, Joanne, um, Jackie, Swansea, Margaret. I've got two left within the vault. Once they're gone, they're gone. I would 100% be joining you on that opportunity if I was at home. Amazing, absolutely amazing. The one with the, the jump rings. Oh, the jade jump, jump rings. Yes, that was all mm. carved out of one amazing piece of jade. That was, what, was it six figures or something crazy like that? Not crazy, though, because that's the value of jade. Yeah. Um, it's us that's crazy, really. Your early bird is coming up in one auction's time. Um, oh, and Ross is saying, surprisingly, the gold, more than double of the gold of sold, than the silver, which is very unusual. However, oh. however, the popularity of gold has skyrocketed, hasn't yeah. it, over recent uh, recent years? That's Definitely. one auction away. Your hammer jump rings, um, amazing, amazing, amazing. Shall we do? Oh yeah, beautiful strand of cat's eye. Oh, so pretty. These would go nice with your kits, wouldn't they? they at nine o'clock. That, you can see the colours of those so brightly, they're gorgeous. Look Stunning. At yeah, you get a lovely amount of chatoyancy, light travels yeah. literally around the gemstone itself. Look at those. They are amazing. I love those. You're so about water. They're, they're water. Yeah. They're beautiful. You don't just get this though. No. No. Is it, Ross, is it? Oh, stop. You get ten. Oh. <gasps> Let me show you each colour. So you get the pink, you get the yellow. These are all 38 centimetre strands. You get the pure whites. Oh, you get the most amazing. Oh, look at that. Lovely green. You get like a kunzite colour. These haven't been on air since October last year. We've oh, checked the stock. Amazing. There are 23 within the vault. Come back here, you. That's the problem when you bring in 10 strand bundles. It's really <laughs> difficult to hold. Oh, you get a multicolored one as well. Oh, a bit Masomery, aren't they? That, that color with the blue. Yeah, Just beautiful. Gorgeous. You get a nice, almost like a um, fire opal, yeah. and then you get a gorgeous Look orange. Look at that. Ah, oh, these for summertime, everybody. How beautiful. So this bundle has not been on air since when? October last year, you've got that cat's eye effect that literally travels as the light hits it, it kind of travels across the surface um, of your gemstones. I mean, 10 strands, nine, uh, 99 pounds and 99 pence, that's a tenner each, that seems, yeah. that seems fair. How about today, for the next eight minutes, we bring them to you at five pound per strand. What? Again, with your, with, your, with your deal of the day, they'd be absolutely beautiful, they'd be stunning with Nikki's kits at nine o'clock as yeah. well. Forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence in your trusty four mil. I've always said this, Nikki. I think four's the I new love six. Four mil. They're perfect. Yeah, they're brilliant because they're so delicate, but they're still there. You can still yeah, see they're not them. so small that no. they're intimidating or or yeah. yeah, don't make an impact. For me, four mil's my favourite size. Yeah, I do. Because um, I think you can just literally chuck them on a stretchy bracelet and they look absolutely amazing. That's, they're festival jewellery. Oh they? yes, nice. your boho are. chic. Absolutely. How yeah. about? Three pound fifty per strand. No way. Yep. Yeah. Three pound fifty per cat's eye. 
how unbelievable and the color palettes that you're getting i mean yeah. you could literally just so sort of de-strand them all maybe put them into individual pots you can incorporate them into your seed beading as well um i know that if uh, uh, lovely mark's watching then he would be thinking oh, oh kiss yeah. cross Absolutely. they make an amazing kiss cross or what about our deb's with her capriccio bracelet yeah. they'd be beautiful in that gorgeous um, £3.50 per strand, amazing. Make sure you check it out, your baskets, everybody. They haven't been on air since October last year for whatever reason. I don't know why. I don't know why. No, I, I don't, don't manage the warehouse. I don't think I've ever seen them. They're gorgeous. Nor me. They'd be lovely in tassels. Oh, absolutely. I just think they're just so pretty for summer. They've got all the ice cream yeah. colours there, but you've got those lovely other darker colours that just go so well with them. Very nice. Stunning colours. I wouldn't describe myself as a follower of fashion. However, I did click on to one of the high street shop apps yesterday yeah. um and uh a lot of boho and it literally yeah. said it had a section for boho yeah. and i clicked on it so you saw lots of quilted jackets yeah. on there lots of tiered maxi dresses tassels are really big so i think That's that it. boho look wilderness. is going to be back wilderness and boho is the new thing for some wilderness what wilderness. does wilderness mean so it's kind of again it's those colors it's outdoorsy yeah. kind of boho you yeah. know get your nice boots on with your flouncy skirts oh i like things. that or, I like yeah. that. Yeah, but they would go beautiful. They'd be perfect. perfect. Like sort of long line, like sort yeah. of I don't know, navel skimming uh, necklaces. Beautiful. Make sure you're checking out, and don't forget your early bird jewelry makers. You can shop ahead on those. Your hammer jump rings, Corinne, Sandra, Julie, Janet, Beverly. New customer, you've got yours. Amazing. You've got ten strands here, so more than enough to accommodate multiple pieces of jewelry. Yes. Um, do stay where you are on those phone lines. Um, but it is time. Um, it is time for your something that Nikki's very excited so about. Excited. You're beautiful. Well, they say hammered, but I actually think they almost look a little bit Van Cleef beaded yeah, as well. Yeah. Um, hammered closed jump rings. So these are closed. The, I mean, that alone, without the detailing, a closed jump ring to me is an absolute godsend. It is. Because so you, the, th the thread's not going to work its way through. Um, so it is a solid and complete jump ring effectively but they have also got a lovely design aspect and you've got different sizes we've got them in the gold we've got them in the silver you've been shopping ahead on these already and you're going to see an amazing early bird deal Okay, starting with the yellow, those warm tones. I've always been a yellow gold fan. Are you a yellow gold? I'm, I'm both, to be honest. You I know both. my daughter's like, oh, you can't have both, you can't like both, but I do, I like both, but I'm a golden girl today. You, I, I noticed think. that, you're wearing all yellow, girl yellow gold, very nice. It's a bit grown up, isn't it? Yeah, I, I just think it's got a richness to yeah. it and a real opulence to it. Um, but yeah, some people. You a, a lot of the time people do have preferences, but it's nice actually that people are mixing yeah. them together now Absolutely. as well. Um, now, you could, and I'm sure Nikki's about to agree with me. Take one of your gold plated or silver or rose, whatever it might be. Take a chain, and you could feed one of these onto yeah. that chain, and there's a beautiful pendant. Yeah, absolutely. It's because I suppose I see jump rings totally differently. <laughs> Do you? a lot of people do yeah because to me they're pieces of jewelry yeah they're not components no not you functional know, well they going, are functional yeah but they're dead functional and you know if you if you're going to make bracelets and things like that and necklaces you, you're going to need closed jump rings because otherwise as you said the thread's going to come off yeah but for me they are jewelry they're decorative as well they aren't are. they that's the yeah. thing um and so pretty that hammer detailing um really bringing out that luster now what's that sorry ross we only had 30 really oh no i was expecting you to say a much bigger quantity than that yeah you get nine so three of each size and in total five grams of sterling silver it's how stunning. lovely is that just literally yeah. put that on a chain. Absolutely. How beautiful. It's gorgeous. For five grams of silver, I think we're already quite low on yep. price tag. You could lark said not onto it. Amazing. You could macrame onto these. Beautiful. Yep. Use them as a clasp if you wanted to. Certainly use them as a feature pendant. In fact, I think they're so pretty, I wouldn't want to hide them at the back. You'd never hide those. No. And the thing is as well, if you're a silversmith and you want to include a bit of gold in your yep. design, but you... because gold buying gold is really expensive you can solder those onto silver and you've got gold in your design and absolutely that's going to elevate it so much 
We're at £29.99 pence only. Are they just screwed? For me, I've just got Roberta, um, Roberta coin, Roberta coin. Because Roberta coins are big Italian jewellers, very expensive Italian mm. jewellers. Um, but they don't necessarily specialise. Well, they do. They include gemstones. But for me, they're more about the beauty of the precious metal. Yeah. And that's what I think you're seeing here. Beautiful precious metal. Yeah. I've got nine left within the vault. Guaranteed sellout. Pardon? A little extra incentive, says Ross. There's five grams of silver. We are running out of time, though, within this hour. We've got an amazing uh, nine o'clock project hour coming your way. £24.99. pence. We only had 30, though. Um, yeah. Oh, no. Lincolnshire, Diana, Tracy, Mariska, Suzanne, Renfusha, Sarah, Amanda, Hampshire, Linda, Diane. There's loads of you there. Um, oh, I'm so God. sorry that we only had 30 of them. We've got, have we got quantity of the silver, then? 75 not massive quantities quite a limited quite an exclusive early bird um, but something most definitely that will work with your deal of the day and all of the amazing launches gemstone launches that we've got coming up um, it's little components like this i always say it nikki that it's easy to overlook especially when you first start making jewelry but yeah. actually they really transform your designs don't they absolutely they make or break a design and things yeah. like that that have already got the texture on them or, or they've already got that that difference yeah. that's what's going to set your designs apart yeah is somebody looking and seeing that extra bit of oomph that yeah. they've got and and i've said before and i'd say it again when you're at home and you're looking at these and you think oh i don't know whether and i'm saying in the studio i'm sitting across from you and i can see them they're so bright and they're so substantial yeah you know they are. And, the weight and, is, is and that's it and they're very used for me they're really gucci yeah they totally give me gucci vibes, yeah the gold i can ones. see that totally um, not a Gucci price though, eh? No. Amazing. Twenty four ninety nine. London, Amanda, you've done it. Li uh, Beverly, Leicestershire, good luck. Linda and Surrey's just secured hers on the phone lines. Well done to you, Devon. You're there. I've got the silver coming up, but again, heads up, no way near enough in terms of quantity, by the way, yeah. um, that we would hope, especially with silver being the most popular of your precious metals. Would you mix them up? Because I think they'd be really lovely together. I would. I would make a simple silver bangle. Yeah. And I would just thread one of those onto it and solder it. Lovely. Beautiful beautiful now the silver 75 available oh. but 22 have already gone these are gorgeous look how pretty now question we'll show you the should be price should be it should have been 29.99 for the gold should have been 24.99 for the silver but because of what we did on the gold or rather i like it's the royal we um <laughs> however same gram weight you got five grams of precious metal we are going to go lower we don't have enough of these 75 is not a big no. enough quantity in silver and um, it's always the most popular of your precious metals again you could never have made a single piece of jewelry in your life yep. in your life you could just feed one onto a chain, beautiful. You could put them onto leather, you can put them onto your cords, yeah. your macrame, your kumahimo. These make my heart do little skips. Ah. <laughs> they do. Because I, I would make a suite of jewellery at those. You could solder them together. Yeah. You could solder, which what I would do is I would be multiplying on them and I would be soldering posts on the back of them. Yeah, And nice. they would be earrings. And then I would Lovely. have a little necklace hanging on a chain, one on a bracelet, you've got a whole suite of jewellery. Beautiful. And I remember, Nikki, one of the pieces that you created during yes. the competition was all circles, wasn't it? Most of my jewellery is circles. Really? Yeah, because I love, there's so much sort of lore, I could go on forever about how, what circles mean to people and how. Yeah as human beings were sort of attracted to circles but yes my jewelry all starts i remember that piece i remember yeah. it and so if you want a bale if you're a silversmith and you're looking for a bale yeah. which is always the hardest part of anything that you're yeah. making there you go there there it is. that way 19 pounds and 99 pence jewelry makers a big gram weight five grams of precious metal you get nine of what i'm holding so can you see you get nine of them in total should i put them all on i'd buy more i'd honestly i'd be buying as many of these as you could get i've never seen the like of them anywhere else as well no i mean i mean and also to make these i know lots of you could but it's a 
it's a it's it's a big task, isn't it? Because you've is. got to you've got to solder it, you've got to hammer it, you've got to yeah. polish each one. It's so difficult to get them all the same size, all the same sort of. You know, when you're hammering things, they go out of shape. It's difficult yeah. to get them to all match. You're never going to achieve that kind of uniformity. That perfection, yeah. Um, now Ross is saying, got to be honest. Silver's gone a bit slow today. Yeah. Really? I think that's because you and I are both wearing gold. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. I tell you what, we shouldn't be doing this, but minute clock, so I was just, <laughs> <laughs> just smiling at Michael. Minute clock and we will go even lower. We'll go even lower purely because we are reactive. We always say that live TV, shopping TV, it's very different to a normal retailer where the price is the price. Um, however, however, yeah, it's, uh, it's a case of, oh, it's a bit slower this morning. I get it, I get it. You know, you might be thinking, he's off, L. It's not even nine o'clock yet. Yeah. Um, well, it is actually, technically, so. Um, and we should have moved on, to be truthful, but we've only got 75 minutes. There's no point in us entering into an early bird auction, to be honest, with such a low quantity and not selling out. So no. that's the only reason um, that you've got this price reduction. Again, you get all of these. That's five grams of precious metal, fully closed, beautifully textured. 19.99 is already an amazing deal. Yeah, we've got the we've got the problems of like time, haven't we? Restraints, time restraints. There's only so much that we can squeeze into one show, so we have to manage that quite well. We don't always succeed, by the way. I, Ross says, I've done it. We're definitely in trouble, he says, for this. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh. £16.99 for five grams of silver. You know what I was just thinking as well? Even if you never made a piece of jewelry, jewelry before and you didn't have all the kit and anything, you, yeah. all you would need is a couple of open jump rings yeah. and just link them together. Yeah. And just put a chain on either side and you've got the most amazing necklace. Beautiful. Oh, I can see what you're doing now. Just, li just link oh. them in between your gemstones. I mean, that's Look a smaller, that. so you would probably go bigger, but you get the idea. Yeah. How beautiful would they be? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, let's put the clock on your screens. That's the countdown, not just your early bird jewelry makers, but to count down everything that we have brought you so far this morning. Um, it will disappear off the system. Bye, so if you've got bye, anything, bye. yeah, if you've got anything loitering, you need to yeah. check those out. You can always combine your order. It's still one post during packaging all day. Um, 47 seconds, and we'll be diving into a break to uh, go towards Nikki's amazing projects, um, which are so colourful, perfect, full of spring. Yeah. Um, 16.99 we have gone lower for you amanda you've got three mariska's got two lincolnshire's got two uh hello to uh gerda in saltburn by the sea we've got west midlands tracy uh linda lorraine uh neil and linda i can't keep up there's lots of you there now well done everyone and again we've got perfect projects coming up in the next hour with nikki in which these would look perfect too with as well remember also we sowed that seed that we might put some of your essentials for in the deal of the day hour the 10 o'clock hour um, on pre-order so um, watch that space check out your baskets and join us after this Debbie Kershaw, I'm back with you on Friday the 23rd of February for a really, really exciting show. I'm going to be launching Delft Clay Casting. Now Delft Clay is a form, a refined form of sand casting and it's really, really exciting. So we're going to be using things like this, these and this to create things like this. So I hope you can join me on Friday the 23rd of February at Jewelry Maker. Hello 
my name is Rachel Norris and I'm so excited to be with you on Saturday the 24th of February for the most amazing show. I don't even know where to begin, there's so much um, going on. So in the 9am hour there is this amazing toolkit it's multi toolkit. It's got everything in it. It's got swage blocks, doming punches, um, all sorts of. Um, and there's an anvil in there. All sorts of shapes and sizes, and there's so much potential in this in, in this sort of kit where you can actually a kit of tools. Really, it's enormous uh, potential. So I've had fun because some things I've never used all before. So I've had fun experimenting really, and you can use it to make uh, them to make tubes like these color lilies. Um, and um, you can do sort of um, folding and impressions and bee caps like this autumn leaf necklace. Um, and there's goodness knows I've made starfish with it. And um, also you can do sort of almost like a fold forming technique um, with this sort of heart necklace with this pattern like that. And so I'll be teaching you some of the techniques in that. Um, of the show and also there's, there's tutorial booklets in there with them as well so um and there's um, so much as i say so much potential and do you know what <laughs> as if anything could beat the nine o'clock hour the 12 o'clock hour is up there because there's a launch of some some brand new sort of dapping punching tools um, and you can make some fantastic effects with them there's a set of feather um tools which you can actually use to make uh, feathers and, and sun rays and all sorts of wonderful um, patterns and there's line punching tools which you can use to make snowflakes and, and wonderful sort of dandelion firework explosions sort of type pieces. I really hope you can join me on Saturday 24th of February for the most fantastic uh, metalwork and tooling show. Um, I've really enjoyed uh, preparing for it and I hope you can tune in to watch. Welcome back everybody, it's lovely Nikki! Hi! Oh, and I'm surrounded by beautiful jewels. Oh, I'm surrounded by a beautiful jewel already. Oh, bless you, bless you, bless you. We have a giggle here, we, we do. do. We do. Um, wow, can I just say wow? Your oh. jewellery, wow. Oh. Amazing, I love the colours, I love the Cartier vibes. Definitely. And I've been reading a lot about it, a lot about panther energy and mm. about reclaiming your power and the yeah. symbolism of panthers. Yeah. I love it all. And you know, it stretches back longer than the Alhambra yeah. motif does. Oh, absolutely. It's, I think it's like very, very early 1900s, mm -hmm. the panther, for Cartier anyway. Um, weirdly, I was watching one of the... Uh, um, Mission Impossible films last night. Oh, yeah. Well, yesterday, actually, of course. Uh, and Vanessa, is it Vanessa Kirby? I think it is. Her name's Vanessa Kirby. Mm. Stunning actress yeah, she is. Isn't she? Absolutely beautiful. stunning. She's uh, the ambassador for the Cartier de Panther wow. collection. And I thought, because she's quite fee, I know, exactly, <laughs> tough job, eh? Um, because she's quite feline looking, yeah. I think. So yeah. she's got that definite, very, very st striking. Yeah, she is. I yeah. would say. Yeah. Um, but again, I can see that connection. That's why I'm talking about it. I can see that connection. These are beautiful. And again, a history that stretches back. Something that we did a while ago, didn't we, Ross? We actually spoke about the history of, uh, of, of the panther. And you're right, the emblema em uh, emblematic symbol that has meant and stood so dear to Cartier uh, for many a years. Now, essentially, your projects today are the same but in terms of their components, but different colors. Yeah. So very, very, very different colors. Very. Um, and again, come with the 
Sea beads. Come with sea beads. They do. Beautiful. Yep. And, and then, Panther. and have we got the PDF? Yes, they come with a PDF. They come. Now, the PDF shows the how to make the green necklace, which is, it's got all the separate components oh, wow. on it. And I'm gonna run through today just a little quick show you how to make the bead connector that's in the center. Yeah. But I'm also just gonna talk to you briefly as well, how you attach the panthers, because they're really useful because they don't have a clasp on as such. Yeah. And you'd think that would make them more difficult to work with, but to be honest, it makes them miles easier to work yes. with. Yes. You can yeah. do so much with there them. Is, there is a set, effectively like a drill hole, isn't yes. there? So it's quite discreet. I wonder yes. if I show you this one side profile, you'll see where it is. There you go. No, just on the side, it's there, it is there. Yeah. Can you see just behind his ear? Yeah. Um, so if I show you this, amazing, absolutely beautiful. Look Cubic zirconia, beautiful tassel. Now look at Cartier's version. Yeah, it's, it's such a good match, isn't it? Yeah, it is, of course, a fraction of the price. Oh, I know. A fraction, even though we're going back to, to 2015. But absolutely beautiful. Yeah, Cartier used tassels quite a lot. Yeah. Um, amazing. So, yeah, take inspiration. And by the way, if you research, I think this is what I did for your uh, presentation that one time when we first started launching um, the Panther collections here at Jewelry Maker, was if you talk about, if you research history uh, history of the Panther at Cartier, oh, and you'll see it's, so it's quite much. a long, yeah, quite a, a, a long um, article about it. So you get, here we go. I know that, um, so Jean Toussaint, who they originally worked with on this, she felt that the panther was a symbolism of the emancipation of women because it was from sort of 20s and 30s era. Yeah. So it was when women were really starting to come into their own, wearing masculine clothing. Wow. And, and really, you know, really finding their own power. And that's what she felt that the panther was symbolic of and, and you know, and the use. And I love that. Yeah, I that's amazing. That, you know, the whole reclaiming your own energy. Yeah, love that. Yeah. Because they are very, well, they're very beautiful, oh, firstly, gorgeous, aren't they? Gorgeous, gorgeous um, but obviously very powerful as well um, well if you go to the, I think this is the Cartier website natural fact and they say from the ears to the jaw eyes and nose the aesthetic tension lies in the scale of the design which is clean and precise the panther head is characterized by its true-to-life design that emphasizes the depth of every ma uh, magnetic detail mm -hmm. I mean they're solitude as well aren't they the solitary animals yeah. and also Part of it is about embracing, and when I say this, I don't mean this in the wrong way, embracing that darker side of yourself, that yeah. more mysterious side of yourself. Yeah. And you know, and really embracing that and sort of coming into your own. Yeah. I love all of yeah, that. Yeah, I do. I do. You, you know, you saying that you're more mysterious, I was like, oh, am I mysterious in any way? I don't know. But I guess we all yeah, must we all be in some way. We all have our own in, inner sort of secrets and yeah. story, don't we? And I, I love suppose. that. Yeah. Well, here she is, actually. We spoke about Vanessa Kirby, didn't we? She's actually a very successful oh. Hollywood actress. But again, look how pretty she is there. Stunning. Beautiful. And, and you can see that panther feature. Yeah, she's there, very feline in, yeah. her, in, in her face, isn't she? Uh, um, indomitable and wild, the panther fascinates. Her power of attraction is all the, all the stronger because of its paradoxical, both predatory and protective. It is the guardian of the secret territory uh, where the vitality and beauty of the world coexist. In its latest campaign, Cartier returns the original footstep uh, of its emblematic animal embodied by Vanessa Kirby, ambassador of Le Panther. Amazing. Well, like I said, we're not about to bring you uh, um, the Cartier pieces, of course, because that would be very, very expensive. However, we can take inspiration from the Maison themselves. Again, you get we've got choices of different colors. Are, are each of these projects on pre-order us they are mm. so we're going to start with the green which is what you get the pdf for as well yeah. um you get some it's a lovely green too very fresh beautiful very it vibrant is. and deep isn't it yeah now there's less than 50 of each of these sorry i'm just gonna have to put that down a second um less than 50 of each kit so i would encourage shopping ahead on these you get three strands do you know what's nice about these as well is that it's not when you when you look at the gemstones they're not one completely solid color there's little variances mm. here and there in the color and it just makes them look so natural 
beautiful. I love onyx. Yeah. Onyx, green onyx in particular. I absolutely love it. It's got this beautiful translucency. So here we go. You get um, the three strands of green onyx in your four, six, and eight millimeters. Um, full strands as well. You get your Cartier inspired panther motif, which is um, encrusted with cubic zirconia, um, and that obviously comes in the tassel. That is, like I said, there is a drill hole there. Um, and then you also get the seed beads. Um, hello, Miss Janet saying, hi, gorgeous girls and Team JM. Hello, my lovely. Um, they are beautiful uh, pussycats too. And the jewelry maker versions uh, previously are gorgeous. They We've are. got a photograph actually, Miss Janet, haven't we? Because do you know what? I didn't know that panthers have got spots. Oh, no, I didn't know that too. No, I remember having this conversation with my husband. He was okay. like, yeah, of course they do. Because I was looking, I was like, it was me actually oh, wow. researching. I was going, Hang on a sec. Why? Have, why has the Carty Panther got spots? And Tom's like, well, they have got spots, but I was, no, they're not. They're black. Oh, I had never noticed. They've that. actually got little wow. spots. Wow, how gorgeous is that? I know. Look at him. I just want to boop his nose. <laughs> look. I wouldn't. No, I'm not going to. I like the fact that he's just a little bit cross-eyed as well. I love that. Just so a cute. Little, little wacky look. Boop boop. Why is it? Why is it? That, I know they don't like it, but yeah. cat's nose is just yeah. it, just boop. boop. Yeah, very cute. Um, no, I wouldn't actually boop its nose. Um, but so majestic, aren't they? Now again. So the 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 panther motif alone, we think it would be more than reasonable. Absolutely, uh, one two nine. Definitely. If I was to see your necklace, Nikki, in any in any boutique or artisanal market, 129 for that piece of jewellery. It's a genuine gemstone yeah. piece of jewellery. I think is more than reasonable. I mean, I'd charge for that. And yeah. That's how much I would be charging for it. I don't blame you. Yeah. I think that's very reasonable. Yeah. Um, we could stop there, but we're not going to, says Ross. Can we shop ahead on all of them? All of them. And you've got to remember how much you're getting with these kits. You're not just going to be able to make that necklace. You no. can make that necklace three times over with these kits. Oh, and really? More. Yeah. Wow. So you get the three strands, five components essentially. So the three strands of your green onyx, um, the beautiful tassel, and the sea beads. How about £10 per component? It's, it's unreal. It is unreal. Green Onyx, I can remember doing, uh, we used to have it a lot, by the way, didn't we, Green Onyx, once yeah. upon a time, but um, I remember doing it for £10. Absolutely, I remember yeah. bringing Green Onyx strands for more than that, in actual fact. You've got four, six, and eight uh, millimetres in this size, and you've got, look, and even the green, it even matches the eyes of the panther, too. I can't stop looking at it, because it's just I know. beautiful. They are beautiful. And the seed beads, we're not stopping there though. Mm. Are you ready? There's less than 50 of each of these projects. So again, I would encourage yeah. shopping ahead. Don't forget you also get the written instructions as well you from do. Nikki. 34 pounds and 99 wow. pence. There's no way on earth I was imagining that price tag. No. I said there's so, so much you can do with these. And also on my JM Guest Designer page, I'm gonna be putting some little extra tutorials oh, on lovely. there. Oh, lovely. With extra things that you can make. So Perfect. it won't just be one thing. Perfect. Well, you like you said at the beginning of the show, Nikki, I mean, if you're brand new to jewelry making, this is actually something that will be quite you know, straightforward yeah, to I'm gonna, start. Yeah, I'm gonna be completely straight up and honest with you, like I've been before. I am not a seed beater. I'm not, it, it, you know, it's not normally the kind of jewelry I make, but these were so easy to work with. Yeah. And they just, the, the stones and the panther just do all the work for you. Yeah, absolutely. So if you've never ever worked with any jewellery before, you're going to be able to make, I would say, at least five great pieces of jewellery with yeah, this kit. Yeah, 100%. If, you, that. if your budget allows, can, can you imagine making a pair of earrings oh. out of the panther and then... And and you've then you've got six strands of gemstones over. Yeah, exactly. Amazing. Now, we've got more to bring you as well. Um, <laughs> and something else that's on pre-order, by the way, aside from uh, um, Nikki's amazing projects, is the entirety of your 10 o'clock hour. So if you want your essential silvers, including the deal of the day, those five millimeter spacer beads, you know, you've got peg bales there, you've got lever backs there, I can see, I can see bracelets there as well, rose gold of your five mil deal of the day, um, spacer beads, you've got jump rings, amazing. head pins, yeah, all of your essentials are 
loaded to the website now so you can shop ahead um, and don't worry you will get that show price as well when we do drop them just make sure if there's something in particular that you're desperate for make sure you are shopping ahead let's bring you this gorgeous oh, sunshine yellow this is lovely I love this have love you got a favorite so colorway you're are you allowed favorites do you reckon i think probably would be the yellow because it's sunshiny and it's gorgeous and it's sunflowers but it's also the necklace that i made with it i think it's for the kind of person who you think i don't really i don't think i can wear a panther well you can yeah you can wear a panther because oh i love what you've done you deconstructed it i, I deconstructed it yeah <laughs> ah. completely and the necklace is actually on um stretch as well so you can just pull it over your head and wear it just under your collar of your shirt oh gorgeous and just have that panther showing and then the chains are used to make the earrings. That's amazing. Yeah, because if you're thinking I'm not a tassel person, yeah. because I suppose it is quite personal. Yeah, absolutely. Everyone's got different tastes. Then take the chains off, use yeah. them elsewhere. What a great idea. Yeah. I love that. We have 50. I agree. It's very much, it's a proper buttercup yellow, it isn't is. it? It's beautiful. It's so sunshiny. It can't. It just makes you feel good. Yeah. It can't stop me from making you feel good. It's just beautiful. Well, they say that about yellow, don't they? That yeah. it's a happiness-inducing colour. And also, on the skin, it makes your face glow. Yeah. It, oh. if, you know, if you feel like you need a little bit of a boost when you, you know, get up in the morning, put something yellow around your neck. Ah, there yeah. you go. Top tip. Very beautiful. In your lovely onyx, we've got this wonderful sunshine yellow. Yeah. £34.99 pence, everybody. Again, you get the PDF instructions um, of the green onyx yep. necklace that Nikki has. Okay. I don't have it here in the studio. Oh, I do. Yeah, I do. Yep. Hang on a second. Um, here in the studio. So one second. You also get this, which is beautifully mm -hmm. illustrated so mm -hmm. you can see everything that you're going to need you know what skill level roughly how long it's going to take you to actually create the piece of jewelry yeah. itself i mean look at that this is a beginner piece of jewelry as well don't forget you know it's so straightforward to make it is never picked up a pair of pliers before you will be able to make this piece of jewelry oh there you go there you yeah. go um get hold of the project and you'll get that with your order history so again uh, make sure you check it out nice and early we've got the red we've got the blue still to bring you as well yep. and of course you still get your demonstration um let's do the red oh the red's gorgeous beautiful Love red. it's very rich isn't it this it is. one now we're talking about a different panther now a different color of panther yes so that's here it is and i think this is where the seed beads really come into their own because yeah. they're very contrasting in this but they work so well yeah they just look amazing together beautiful and don't forget you're getting a full 22 gram tube of seed beads as well yeah this isn't a little tiny tube of seed beads it's the you know the real deal is and with the silver panther as oh, well um yeah stunning absolutely I made stunning. this last night and this is what you're going to be demoing as yeah. well, isn't it? Literally last night. Beautiful. So you have, again, your Cubic Zirconia Parve set panther with the tassel, which, as uh, Nikki showed in the previous piece, you can always remove those chains and use it as yep. a, almost like a, as a connector, yep. I suppose. Three strands of beautiful, rich red onyx, and you also get your tube of your Mayukis, which are a matte silver, oh, 11 wow. Um Okay, 50 available. Look at that red. It's, and there's very few red gemstones. I know. I know, and they're very, very hard to get. I know at Christmas yeah. we had red onyx, and I was desperate to get it. I had it on my wish list. I couldn't get it. And then these came along just after. I was like, oh, God. Yeah, you needed you know, it then. Absolutely. Yeah, it's red in particular. It sounds daft, but red in particular is difficult to get yes. hold of anything in the lead up to yeah. Christmas. Um, so no surprises here, jewellery makers. We've brought you the green. We've brought you the yellow. Um, actually, sorry, we've got a bigger quantity of the red. Ooh just over 50 55 okay fair enough um this has got the silver plate uh, silver plated yeah. uh panther i mean okay okay just because we've got a fraction no. more maybe about 10 percent more <laughs> we're gonna take it even lower i can't believe this no i Honestly, can't either because 
because of the amount of gemstones you get in them, they're not tiny little strands as well. No. You know, they're really, there's so much in them that you can do with them. And it's really onyx. Is. I know. You know, onyx is used by m most of the big design houses, yeah. Cartier absolutely yeah. included. You've got that really beautiful kind of berry red, yeah. like a cherry tomato it red. Is. It's a proper red. You yeah, know, there's beautiful. There's no mistaking with it. And it's with the silver as well, it just looks so nice. But I am in love with the little matte seed Yeah, they're as beautiful. Well. They're so unusual. Purely because we've got a marginally, and I do mean marginally bigger quantity. It's, um, I mean, I think, I think we're on thin ice there, but there's ten percent more um, available. That's what's justifying this price crash for you all. You can shop ahead on the blue as well, jewelry yeah. makers, and don't forget all of your deal of the day hours available um, on pre-order as well in your essentials. Um, absolutely beautiful. Again, he is, he's got a very discreet drill hole, so it's just yeah. tucked behind the ears, so it's not going to spoil the design. No, nope. very easy to work with really really easy and you can you know you, I'll show you in a minute you can put a clasp on if you want yeah to, but they're lovely to okay, work beautiful with. if your budget allows they must make oh, amazing wow, earrings wow, wow 29 Honestly. pounds and 99 pence only so that's what one two three strands four yeah. five you're talking about what four pounds is that right about four pound per component and how much do seed beads cost normally on their own you know six six yeah exactly six pounds no, they're, they're eight, eight normally. Yeah. Normally. I'm just trying to work out, sorry, my maths is rubbish this morning. <laughs> How much is that working out at each? Yeah, per component. Is it six pounds? Six yeah, pounds per component. For, yeah, for, for the panther, panther, for the onyx. We're just, yeah, we've got a Do you know what? You could... You could string that panther just on a chain and by itself, and yeah. that would be, you could sell that for £50 easily. Absolutely, because of the Cartier sort yeah. of inspiration behind it. Um, now, we're going to dive into the demo. We've still got one more project to bring you as well in the blue. Yeah. Um, so do shop ahead on that one, everybody. Um, and any questions that you have um, for Nikki texting. So, yes, please. Um, it's all available on pre-order as well as everyone your deal of the day out which is about your essentials so those beautiful five millimeter spacers they're available plus loads more so definitely worthwhile keeping an eye on our website all the w's at jewelrymaker.com um yeah if you shop ahead you're guaranteeing your place you're not uh, um, exempting yourself if you like from the yeah. imminent price drop so um do shop ahead on those but take it away my lovely thank you so much well what i'm going to show you today and as you can see i've already made a couple of them is just this i don't even know what i would call it i think i've been calling it a corona yeah. so basically it's the little um the smallest of them which i think was the four mil mm. um and and then I've surrounded them with the seed bead liner. Like I said, I am not a seed beader. So when I got these, I was like, oh, I don't know what to do. But I've learned this technique and I think it's incredibly effective. And I think it's really useful if you're new. So what I've been doing, and you'll, you'll see it on the green necklace, I've separated them with the larger ones. So I'll pop one of those on now. And then I will show you what we do. So what we do is we just take six of these seed beads now I'm using a size 12 needle. I think you could use a 10 as well, but 12 works for me. And I'm also using, let me just check, I've got six, yeah. I'm also using Fireline, but any beads and thread would be absolutely fine. And then I'm gonna pop on our four mil here. Now, honestly, this is so easy. It's almost embarrassingly easy what I'm gonna show you how to do here. So what you do, is you take your needle back through the first seed bead that you put on. Now, if you bear with me, I'm trying to do it down below so you can see. And I'll pull my thread through. Now, when you pull your thread through, you'll see that it sits around the stone. So what you want to do is pull it so it's upwards, okay? So that your threads are poking upwards, okay? Mm -hmm. Then we're gonna thread on a seven. Have a look, seven, four, five, six, seven. Okay, thread on the seven seed beads, and then we're going to go back through this one that's on the top. Okay, go back through that one that's on the top, and then what you'll find you have is if I can pull it round, let me see, 
she says, when it's gone the wrong way. Which way has it gone? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, and you can undo it. This is why I say with sea beading. Oh, hang on, I'm going to undo it again. Undo it and start again. I'll tell again. you what, we'll start again. Yeah. Right. Don't you worry, it's live TV. It it's is always, live it's TV. It's almost a guarantee Honestly, that that's what happens. A million times last time did it right. But you know what? Like I said, I'm not a sea beader. I make mistakes. So this is really good for anyone to see. Absolutely. Okay, so there's your six on. Yeah. And then your bead on. Let me see. They want to run They're away not playing from me. ball, are they, this morning? They never do play ball with me, these little ones. Okay. And then we go, okay. Then we're going to go back through our first one. Okay. There we go. Right. And there we have our little corona. Okay. Little really corona pretty. sitting there. Right. Now I want it so it's that way. And then we're going to add seven on. I bet you it won't work again for me. Don't worry. Four, We've got the instructions five. as well, haven't we? So yeah, it's seven. But you know what? See if you didn't like anything, it's practice, isn't it? Yeah. No? So yeah, of course. Put your seven on. And you said you you tried this for the first. I did. First time last night. I know and put the seven on and put it back through. I think what I might have done before is put it through the wrong seed bead. So you can see here, if you put it through this seed bead, because I had it slightly the wrong direction, that's all. So if I pop it through, here we are. Is it gonna work this time? <laughs> let's see, go on, let's see. Is it gonna I've work? I've got confidence, I have confidence. I have confidence that it is going to yeah. work and there we are. Oh, it's like a, do you know what else it's like? A little all-seeing eye. It is like a little all-seeing eye and I love these because they're really cute and then you just pull them down but look it's like it could be like a little daisy. The yellow ones work brilliantly. So that's how not to do it. And that's how you do do it. <laughs> and that's how you do do it. Now what I also want to show you very quickly is on the other necklace that I made last night and I was having a little play with this because I was looking at clover designs, to be honest. And this sort of came about as an additional one. So what I did was I threaded four of the larger ones and then I just tied a knot. And when you just tie a little knot in them, let me see here. Right. When you tie a knot, they come together like this sort of square shape. OK. And then if you tie that knot again and then put the thread off. You don't need a tail on this. Quite a lot of seed beading, you need a little tail on. You don't need a tail when you're doing these ones. So just bear with me one moment. Okay. There we are, right. So you end up with like a little sort of square or a little diamond shape. Now what you do is you go around through your beads with your smaller bead. Okay, bear with me. And with each one, you'll take your smaller bead and you'll take it through the next hole and you'll end up, if I can grab this other necklace in a moment, so you'll take and you'll end up with all the beads around here. And then all you do is pretty much the same as I've done before. When you've ended up with all your beads around, these one, two, three, four, like this, then you take two, three, four, you take eight of your seed beads back around here. It's a very, very simple process. If I've got time now, I'll just see if I can show you with one. But what you'll end up with is this gorgeous little motif and you can see that the corona is above it there. And it just creates something really nice. Now what I did say I was gonna show you is this tassel. Can I borrow yours though? Of course. Okay. So. It's really easy just to thread your needle straight the way through on these tassels because there's tiny, tiny little holes. So can you see? There's one there. Can you see my needle going through? And then there's one here as well. So it's very easy just to thread your, if you've got like clear thread like this fire line, it'll go straight through directly onto it like that. And it's so discreet. Now, if you want to, you can actually take a piece of wire and you can take it up 
through here, bring it back round and take it up through here. And I did this on one of the other ones. And all you need to do is you just twist your wire at the top and then you'll have a, you can can a little wrap loop and you'll have a bale. There you go. I yep. can show that. See it there? Perfect. Just They're there. so easy to work with these panthers. As I said there's so much you can do. Now if you want to take off the chain, you just go underneath and there's like a little crossbar underneath. And all I did was I just snipped one of the little crossbars and then the chain will come off for you. And then you can work along just using, there's like a little crossbar. Can you see it yeah, there? Yeah, 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 perfect. Then you can just work along putting your thread underneath that other crossbar and that's how you'll get one like the yellow necklace before. And then you can use the chain for another project. Yeah. But there's so much that you can do with these little panthers. There really is. And those these beads, honestly, you can make a million different things. You could make stretchies with them. You could literally just hang that panther from a stretchy. It, you know, there's so much you can do with them. I love them. Amazing. Love them. Well, they're I've just clocked those lovely uh, green onyx earrings as well. They're beautiful. Same and again, technique. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, a lovely colour combination. They're stunning. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful, Nikki. Um, we've still got one project to bring you as oh. well. So it's all really down to your personal colour preference, I suppose, yeah. if you prefer greens, yellows, reds, oranges um, or blues. Well, um, here we go. Now, this is the blue, always a popular choice yeah. in gemstone world, of course. You get those same three sizes um of uh your onyx so lovely translucency to your onyx you also get the mayuki which are a dark gray Gorgeous. 11 -o, very pretty yeah. and also let's not forget you have the beautiful panther yeah there it is so all what is it five components 10 pound per component wow. it's amazing isn't it oh, look at the little flashes of their eyes as well green cubic zirconia eyes Beautiful. Again, it's a, it's a drop in the ocean in comparison to the prices that you might find in Cartier. You know, I don't know if they do anything double-figured, to be honest. I love this necklace. Yeah, that's beautiful. I had so many messages about this Ammonite necklace, honestly. It, do you know, it reminds me of um, Moana. Oh, I, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I love Moana. Very much like Moana. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. At £49.99, pence, that's five components amazing we've got 50 of them available exactly wow. 50 again 29 pounds and 99 pence maker ali angela sonika valerie lots of you getting involved already Brilliant. lots of you loving the blue i'm not surprised and you can mix them up too couldn't you you yeah. don't have to have honestly one color do, per design you can do chakra necklaces if yeah. you mix them up there's so much you could do those blue because i wanted to show that there was so much more that you could do with them than just the panther the panther is beautiful i would literally just put that on a chain itself yeah i agree make a million other things with the beads and the seed beads and this i guess you could wrap loop directly onto the bottom of the tassels with some of your yeah, gemstones as absolutely. well that would be nice yeah. wouldn't it um well done everybody make sure you're checking out your baskets and again any questions that you have for nikki do text in um amazing all of your deal of the day hour um your essentials are available on pre-order well, we're looking at six pound per component again <sighs> i remember doing we haven't had a lot of onyx recently no. not colored onyxes anyway yeah. um and when we did have it back i'm talking like ivy house days when we were in the old studios you were talking about you were talking well definitely more than a six pound per yeah. strand and these are a proper all of them I mean, the blue is a proper blue yeah they're all very bold colors and yeah. really really nice colors to work with amazing thank Gorgeous. you nikki beautiful and of course don't forget with any of your projects whichever color um you'll get your pdf instructions oh, yeah. too um now take a look at the website all the w's at jewelrymaker.com it's rare we do this by the way but because as it's an essentials hour yeah. so your wire end tips your peg bales slider bracelets everything is on pre-order right now and they will be going lower so if you want to guarantee your place on anything precious metal then shop ahead you can do that right now your deal of the day there's 500 available wow. sterling silver spacer beads in five mil but we've bundled them which means there they are hang on a minute ross that says how many pieces do you get because that says 20 it's 20 in each mm. pack so you do get 40. Oh, wow 
Yeah, there is 40, yeah. So you get 40, yeah. Not 20. Amazing. I can definitely see 20 in that pot, can't you? Yeah, easy. Yeah, that's all right then. And I think as well, knowing what's coming up, I would shop ahead and buy these. Yeah, so ignore what it says in black and white, the yeah. 20 pieces, you actually get 40 pieces. Um, so it should have times two yeah. next to it, okay. basically. Now, when we brought you these very same spacer beads, uh, they went crazy because we rarely get the bigger sizes. Yeah. There's a single pack of 20, and I'll tell you how much they were, £12.99. Which is unbelievable, oh, yeah. isn't Great it? Great value. Absolutely unbelievable for 20. So that would make today's deal of the day 26 pounds, yeah. Yeah. Amazing. It's a great deal, yeah. isn't it? Brilliant deal. You're gonna get a mega deal today because we've bundled them. There you go, Adam says, can you give us a wink? I'm rubbish at winking. <laughs> um, <laughs> so do shop ahead on those. But again, you've got lots of the other essentials, your jump rings, your head pins, all of those things, all available on pre-order yeah. in the 10 o'clock hour. Also, don't forget, those amazing that new parcel that we've acquired of both the aquamarine and also the Amaz Knight. in fact and those pearls that are coming your way which oh, are absolutely so dreamy so beautiful that's coming up in the 10 o'clock hour now you know that we have an amazing of buy, uh, amazing buying team that works um, we've got the buying team that works exclusively for jewelry maker we've got a buying team that works exclusively for gemporia and we've got a buying team that work they work together as well um, but in those efforts they will pretty much cover every single um, area of this planet pretty much I said all right it's my, maybe an exaggeration but they go they travel long distances um, to make sure that they're sourcing you the finest gemstones and it's not an easy task let's be honest it sounds like a jolly it's really not um it's a full-on a very time-consuming role but those efforts really do not go unnoticed because one of the biggest gemstones this is what we've of now but we think it's it's destined to go yeah. even further i think you know like taylor swift she's always successful wasn't she but now she's on another planet yeah. in terms of her success yeah. um that's what i think with amazonite you know it's always been popular it's always been in the big um in <laughs> um in lots of jewelry uh, jewelry houses but moving forward i think it's going to be everywhere yeah. everyone's going to know about this gemstone um this is a brand new parcel a brand new parcel and it is oh, utterly exquisite it is. the last parcel that we had was on air once gone sold out yeah on air and gone this um, is unreal so beautiful Honestly. when we think about amazonite Firstly, opaque gemstone, member of the Feldspar family, um, beautiful markings to it. It's, it's lovely if you can get some translucency. This has that translucency. Mm -hmm. But when we think about its color, it's such a unique color in comparison to many, all of your gemstones out there. It's almost yeah. tropical destination-like. Um, it's certainly one of my favorites, always has been, always, always has been. But one of my favorite descriptions of this beautiful gemstone comes from um, a, a designer who's multi-award winning. Um, I know that our founder knows her personally. Um, I've seen some of her pieces of jewelry actually being made. Um, and I will say she has the same quality of Amazonite that you do. Does that make sense? Oh, yeah, it does. Yeah? It does. Um, okay. Um, but on Monica Veneda's website, uh, they do a beautiful write-up on this gemstone. So let's yeah. read that. So um, Amazonite, the stone of hope. Amazonite is one of the many reasons we love gemstones so much. They come in rich histories, startling beautiful colors, and vast range of uses for everyday jewelry. And Amazonite is undoubtedly a leader of the pack. I think we totally agree. I mean, when you look at that stack on her hands, mm -hmm. which gemstone do you notice first? For me, it's the Amazonite. Yeah, you do, close. you notice. Yeah, you it's notice close. the Amazonite first. Um, but what is it? It's a member of the Feldspar family, a uh, group of minerals, um, or to be more specific, K Feldspar in relation to its potassium content. Amazonite is a blue green. We don't use semi precious anymore, um, precious gemstone, I'm going to say, uh, that has seemingly been used for medicinal purposes as much as it has for jewelry pieces throughout history. Its potassium content is believed to bring physical benefits um, of stamina to the wearer. So it also, uh, sorry, has been a favorite jewelry item for many a civilization. It's the stone of hope. 
as well as its physical benefits of owning and wearing Amazonite, it has something of a divine appearance to it. The blue-green variation of it often resembles the skies, uh, sky and the heavens, so it is often regarded as a beacon of hope and faith. This isn't only applicable to its spiritual qualities either. Its very appearance as a variant of turquoise is seen <coughs> as the bridge between the blue of cold winter and the green of springtime, laden with life. No matter how cold the winter might be, there is always a springtime to look forward to. And the colour of Amazonite acts as a quite literal reminder of that. The hope that this gemstone represents is manifested in the idea that it allows the owner to see the tr full truth of all matters. So it inspires confidence in balance arguments and helps us to achieve equilibrium in all walks of life. Wow. It's lovely, it's a That's beautiful so writer. It's emotional, isn't it? Um, whereas its source, well, the beautiful blue-green Amazonite has been mined all over the world. It is named in some uh, somewhat misleading as it's led many people to believe that it originates from the Amazon River, um, based in Brazil. But it actually hail, uh, hails in the most part from uh, the Ilminsky Mountains in Western Russia. Uh, deposits there have been so historically plentiful that the gemstone was dis distributed across Europe and perhaps even to Egypt in ancient times. It is known to have been a favorite during Egyptian dynasties, uh, but not much is known about Amazonites' presence um, on those intercontinental trading routes, as in how did it get there? Uh, what is widely known though is the powerful impression that one of the finest gemstones in the world has left on countless civilizations. Amazonite might be a rare stone, but its influence has spread to every corner of the globe to bring hope and healing to the masses through beautiful jewellery and adornments. I love these words. I think it is oh, so perfectly, wow. uh, perfectly beautiful. worded. And this Look is the Ilminsky Mountains, yeah. You know, we always talk about the beauty of the location being actually brought to you in the gemstone itself. Yeah. Definitely. Um, it is that like almost, and by the way, I could be showing you because Amazonite forms all around the world, mm. not just here, but um, it is that balance between the lush of the green and the vibrancy of the blue, yeah. you know, from the azure of the sky. It's that perfect balance between the two. But again, to, for, for Monica Veneda, she's included in her collection for many years, and it's probably one of her most successful gemstones, I should imagine. You can see it in the siren rings just there um, that are uh, designed almost to be stacked up. I can tell you the quality. Your, your Amazonite is a brighter color, much. Um, much brighter. You've got them in the Hamza hands just there, which is lovely. I love her jewelry. I think they're absolutely gorgeous. Um, a bit of gold plating all the way around. But they do come with the Monica Veneda price tag as well um not we're not talking like sort of cartier prices um but still three figures um however what about irene newis now she's working with amazonite at the moment um in 80 it's just an 18 i say just it's one 18 karat gold class what i mean is it's not laden with gold no. 2930 pounds Sorry, 50 pounds. But you know what, fair enough, because it's beautiful. Absolutely, I'm, yeah, absolutely. Often when I show these prices, I'm not necessarily saying they're yeah, wrong. Yeah. I'm absolutely solidifying the fact that we're wrong. Yeah. Um, so this is, in terms of color quality, is what I would most like in our Amazonite yeah. too. This is Tiffany's & Co, a simple beaded bracelet, yeah. one sterling silver clasp and Tiffany charm. Mm -hmm. 530 pounds. Uh, do you see where you're coming from? It's almost identical. It Let me just it scooch. Is. I'm going to say ours is better. Yeah. I am. It's got more translucency, I think. Yes. Yeah, you can see the quality, can't you? Now, jewelry makers, we have it in three sizes. It's a brand new parcel launching today for the very first time. We're going to start with the 10 mil. Oh. We've got them in the eight and we've got them in the six. Now, where's this from? Okay, because you know we said we showed the Ilminsky Mountain, so you also know that we're not buying from that location at, 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 at this present moment in time for obvious reasons. However, uh, which I won't get into, but you know. Um, so we have to source it elsewhere. It does form in different locations around, around the world. However, the most prominent location was where we mentioned yeah. earlier on. So we could bring you big quantities very easily. Yeah. However, we can't do that now. We've got 25. I'm so sorry. That's the reality. And that's what the buyers have to contend with yeah. when they're sourcing. Yeah. It has to be of the best quality. It has to be up to jewelry maker standards. We still want the most amazing price. However, you're in a market which is in high demand. This is a gemstone that 
so many of the big designers want. Oh. And actually, in terms of access, it's very difficult to get hold of now. Um, you know, we used to bring you Amazon night by the hundreds, literally triple figure quantities all the time. We can't do that. Did you say 25, Ross? 25 available, oh. that's all we could buy. So it is a very exclusive opportunity. The quality is it's exceptional. Incredible. It's incredible. I'm that. looking at it now. It is every single separate bead there is unreal. It's like a little planet of its own. Yeah, and they've got translucency to them as well. Sometimes Amazonite can be completely opaque, most of the time in actual fact, certainly if you look at the Monica Veneda ones. Um, however, these do have uh, almost like that icy translucency. Yeah. Now, I've got 25 available. Totally natural. This is not dyed, treated in any way, shape, or form. Um, and they're huge in their size. So, yeah, you could pop along to Tiffany's and Co and get an Amazonite bracelet. It makes sense that Tiffany's have it, doesn't it? Yeah. Because it's their, it's their, well, it's their branding. Yeah. Um, it's that perfect robin egg blue. £530. But as jewellery makers, you could recreate that. That's actually a really simple piece oh. of jewellery to make. So easy. Really simple. Yeah. Remember, there's only 25. The phone lines, the web has backed up straight away. There's four, how many? 40 wow. of you have this in your I basket. I would grab this instantly. Yeah. Especially, look, when we did get this predominantly from the Uminsky Mountains, we probably could bring you those quantities earlier. We can't do that or we're not. No, we could. We've decided not to do that. That was a conscious decision for yeah. obvious reasons. Fair enough. But it does mean yeah. that our, our supply is going to be much more limited. Yeah. We're at £199 in your 10 millimetre rounds. Natural Amazonite with glow, with markings, you know, those beautiful patterns that you see across the surface of an Amazonite stone with with that lovely translucency as well. Yeah, Ross has always said he thinks in the future um, this is going to be, you know, the new jade, if you like. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's why I described it probably a little bit, I don't know, coarsely. Like, it's like T Taylor Swift at the moment. You've noticed she's everywhere. The success mm. of her era tour. She was very successful before, but now yeah, stratospheric. she's stratospheric. Yeah. I agree. I think, I think Amazonite is always been a popular gemstone. Yeah. But I think it is going to be Taylor Swift levels moving it, forward. It has universal appeal. That yeah. is, if the ocean were a gemstone, that would be It would be Amazonite, yeah. It Amazing. Would. We're at a £199. I only have 25 available, though, jewellery makers. We've still got the 8 mil, we've still got the 6 mil. We're going to do a big price crash. First come, first serve. Can't say any fairer than that. Wow. wow. <laughs> This is the thing, and it does make a difference as a gemstone buyer how many we, 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 we purchase. When we yeah. go to a trader and say, right, we'll buy 200, fantastic. They, we, can, we can negotiate somewhat there. They'll give us a bit of a discount. But when the world wants this gemstone and we're only able to buy a quantity of 25, that does make a difference. Look at that one. I know. I mean, every single individual gem on there is incredible. These on those earrings that we had earlier on would just be absolutely oh, amazing, wouldn't they? Perfect. Stunning, stunning, stunning. We've got the 8 mil as well. Half the stock has gone. I've got 10 of them left. And 49.99 was still not your price. We're talking about the 10 mils right now, but I wanted wow. to show you the full parcel together. This doesn't bear any resemblance to the Amazonite that you got 10 years ago. It's no. nothing like it. Much more opaque, yeah. much paler in yeah. its color. It was almost gritty, the Amazonite yeah. that you used to get. This is smooth, it's glass-like, it's beautiful. It's stunning. We're going even lower, everybody. I've only got 10 left, though. With your eight mils coming up, your six mils coming your way, it's a brand new parcel. But again, you see that tropical colour. I often liken the finest quality Amazonite to your Paraba. That's the thing, which yeah. is probably an unusual comparison to many people. But um, this colour, I'm not talking about its texture, its crystal structure, or anything like that, or its rarity. I'm talking about its colour. This is almost Windex blue Paraba tourmaline yeah. colour. And we're not even stopping at 49.99. Suja, Marie, Anne, Devon, Swansea, London, Susan, Tracy, Swansea, Carol, Cambridgeshire, Lou, you're all there. Um, I can, oh, there's people on the phone lines I can't yet see. This time next year, let's, let's, let's make a mental note of this. What prices do you think uh, Amazonite is going to be this time next year? And are wow. we going to be able to get it at this quality again? That's the thing. No. £29.99 only. 
We're talking the 10 mil strand, the biggest. So no, it has that knock on effect. Honestly, it's, it's, uh, I, I'm sitting next to it and I know if I had that in a shop and amongst everything else, yeah. that would be the thing my customer was most drawn to. Yeah, because I think we gravitate to that colour, yeah, do. don't we? It's about, yeah. that, and that's why I read the article earlier on from uh, Monica Venado. I think it is a very hopeful colour. It's yeah. a comforting colour, it is. isn't it? it I is. love the fact they said that it's that bridge between the cold of winter and the, and the warmth of springtime. If you know, it's very positive. Yeah, if you wanted to wear something that would bring you confidence, this would be the colour yeah. that I would choose. I agree. I've just got two of them left and then we're going to be diving into the eight millimetres. Yeah, I, 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 I referenced this the other day. My cousin came round after, it was after Christmas in actual fact, and I was like, oh, I like your necklace. And straight away I recognised it was Amma's and I. Mm. And, uh, and she was like, yeah, I, don't, I can't remember the name of the gemstone, but I just love this colour. And I was telling her about Amma's and I, and she goes, yeah. but I love it all the more. And she's like, oh, yeah, uh, my husband bought it for me because of... Uh, um, Let's just say many of the medical properties yeah. that beliefs that are attached to this gemstone. Um, down to the final one of these. Um, make sure you're checking out your baskets. Um, down to the final one. Well done. Okay, let's do the eight mils now. I'm just going to take this out because I don't want to confuse no. anybody. Okay. Um, I'm just going to. I've got the wrong neckline for this, but look, looks absolutely amazing against the skin. It's beautiful. It just glows against your skin, it does. doesn't it? The more you, you know, it just it has this ethereal glow. It's just beautiful. Now we're going to do a minute clock. How many have you got, Ross? Okay, the biggest quantity of all three from this one parcel, and a very, very versatile size as well. We can already see interest. I'm not surprised. Eighty. Let's let, let's say it as it is. It's still not enough. It's nowhere near the quantities that we used to have back in the day. In an eight mil, which is perfect for knotting, marlas, stretchies, yeah. all of the above. I mean, I don't know. Oh, there you go. The Tiffany necklace, the bracelet that we showed you eight is mil. eight mil. Yeah. And you could make from this one strand, two of those bracelets. Absolutely. Just got to get the sterling silver components, which we can also bring to you in the next hour. There's. 21 eight millimeter Amazonite beads on that bracelet. So yeah, this that's you could make that times two. The just quality is like for like. Just look at that color. Look, I can't sit here and say our diamonds are the same quality as Tiffany's. I can't say that. No. I can't sit here and say our Tanzanite is the same quality as Tiffany's. But what but I can is. say is our Amazonite is the same quality as Tiffany's. At least. Just sit, at least, <laughs> you know. if not better, absolutely. Yeah. Do you all agree with me? I can't say our diamonds are the same as Tiffany's. I can't. Tanzanites, no, I can't. You know, the canary diamond that you saw on the red carpet with Lady Gaga, that's, it's priceless, millions of pounds. But I can say that our Amazonite is. Oh, 100%. You know, Amazing, loads of multi buyers getting involved. Devon's got two, Dorothy's got two, Helena's got two, Swansea's got two. A brand new parcel and one that I think is going to be a one show wonder. Um, Linda, Catherine, Lou, Anne, um, and I, yeah, 100%. Ross is saying, I, I think that is going to be one of the way uh, Amma's Night pans out moving forward over the next year. You think 2024, 2025 yeah. is going to be the year of Amma's Night? Yeah, I agree. And Neon Appetite. Yeah. Because those colours have got that universal appeal. Everybody likes this sort of aqua colour. Everybody likes yeah, it. Yeah, absolutely. You know? And it complements every skin yeah, tone. Yeah. Every skin tone, every age, every gender. You know, it, it, it literally complements everyone. Yeah. Now at 179, a third of the stock is confirmed. I have 80. We're actually rapidly approaching half. Look at that colour. It's, it's dreamy, it is. isn't it? absolutely dreamy it is just like looking at the sea it, it for me it, it's so so marine like it's just it's beautiful it's it's like looking at the sea when you're on holiday yeah 69 pounds and 99 pence for this quality you know what this time next year I don't I think that will probably be more realistic our availability of Amazonite is much more restricted. Yeah. 
we brought you the 10 millimeter natural amazonite at what 29.99 well that tends to have a knock-on effect so let's beat that price tag jewelry makers and still not be done 80 is not enough not for our audience we've got we know we've got more than 80 people watching right now we've got hundreds that if not th yeah. i don't know maybe thousands and it is one of the most popular gemstones on our planet right now yeah. we are in line with what we did previously i mean if we launch the, the 10 mils at 29.99 these at 27 that seems amazing that seems fair doesn't it completely fair we are going lower though if we had 25 like we did on the 10 mils we would not move on that price tag we couldn't move on that price tag obviously we always endeavor to but half the stock is already gone so we would have had to held it here we have 80 available or had past tense look at that color though you know i, I know we have pantone colors of the years and every it is very much in um, a sort of personal choice but what's not to love about the beauty of amazon i agree with you everybody like that everybody likes that color it's just that it has that universal appeal yeah and i think it's really important to remember that this is totally different than the amazite you used to get the amazite yeah it's from that years was much ago. more opaque wasn't yeah. it much more opaque still lovely don't get me wrong but yeah much 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 more opaque whereas this has got a real glow to yeah. it 24 pounds and 99 pence only it'll be perfect with lots of the items that we're bringing you in the next hour oh, as well, so well that you can shop ahead on like your five millimeter spacer beads don't forget we've still got the past the four mils to bring you as well maybe you're going to go for that beautiful graduated necklace yeah, um um lauren you there have you got have you got that amazonite marla necklace that we've had behind the behind the scenes for a while have you got that one because if you've got those three strands, this would be beautiful in a long line Marla necklace. It'd be amazing, wouldn't it? £24.99 pence and Manchester, Staffordshire, Cornwall, Jeanette, Cynthia, Leslie, Mary and Jerry, Christy, Mary, Mary in Lancashire, Mary in Surrey, uh, Northumberland, Tracy, Carol, Lorraine, well done to you, Judith, Swansea, hello to you, Hampshire, Devon, I can't keep up, Joanne, <laughs> Elaine, Geraldine, Helen, with the spacer beads, absolutely, your dealer oh, yeah. day would be absolutely amazing, in fact, let me just get one of the pots that you're getting, because you get that times two. Fabulous amazing and you know what when you get this home you will wish you bought more yeah 100 percent. because it looks even better on in yeah, person doesn't it, it? Does. i totally agree with you 24 pounds and 99 pence for 175 carats of glowing natural amazonite and you don't even know i'm gonna guess it is but you don't know that the tiffany and co bracelet is natural just saying no you don't know it no. they don't stipulate yeah. it do you i'm guessing it is I would probably ask the question though if I was spending 530 pounds. Oh, absolutely, I'd want to know. Yeah, is it natural or is yeah. that treated Amazonite? Uh, 24.99, well done. Debbie in Northampton snapped up two. Anne says I'll have two. Swansea says I'll have two. Manchester says I'll have two. Don't blame him. I would as well. Um, it is a difficult gemstone to get hold of, but again, fast forward. Is it going to be the? Uh, I don't know. You know, we had jadeite fever or have jadeite fever over the past few years. Is Amazonite the next stone? I think it will go beyond it. Yeah. I do because just because of the color and the quality that you've got in your hand there now not everybody will have that quality no. but that there to me is the quintessential gemstone that everybody loves yeah absolutely absolutely i think if i made a stretchy bracelet for my husband in amazon he'd love it oh perfectly so yeah yeah, yeah gents mine would yeah it, it's it has that appeal as i said you know it, it's just that gorgeous glowy color that just yeah. reminds us of all the things we love yeah, I might have to join you on this one, actually. You know, you're just looking at it going, why am I yeah. not Why am I not reaching for my phone right now? As soon as the break comes, I will do. Um, it's on the verge of selling out. What's that? Look at the price of the Peruvian yeah. Icy Amers Night, which was, what, triple figures? Yeah. And amazing, by the way. This could yeah. go that same way. Well, this is what I was saying earlier on. There is translucency yeah, to this as well. It's not a million miles away from no, it. No, you've got the strength of color and you have got markings. So if you look at this one here for a second, yeah. you have got markings inside. Can you see? That's what Amazonite's Night's all about. You get these lovely patterns. Wow. Um, but can you also see the translucency? That's, you know, that's what takes this part. Look at these, yeah. 
That's what takes this to another level. Yeah. You've got that lovely glow, and that's what they do light up. Well, they say, don't they? They say this gemstone looks even better at sunrise and sunset because yeah. they glow. Um, but when you get this home and you see it in real real life, you'll yeah, understand you why it's making us all a little bit hot under the collar. It's absolutely amazing. Um, congratulations, it's gonna sell out. This is your eight <sighs> millimeter. Brought you the 10 mil earlier on if you've just tuned in. I've got four left. The phone lines are so busy. We're massively over allocated. So I'm, I'm wish list it, wish list it, wish list it. Now. This is so pretty. There's only 60. Can I just, I don't want to sideline them for a second. It's so pretty. Stock update. Look at that colour. Look at that colour yeah. from there. We're not even, and these. Look at the colour. They just literally, oh. There's one left on the 10 mil, four left of the eight, and I've got 60 of this. Look, look at stunning. this translucency. Oh. Incredible. It's so beautiful, isn't it's it? Absolutely gorgeous. This is almost like a minty, bluey yeah. green. Amazing translucency. It glows, it does. It's just it's like it's got a light inside it. Yeah, yeah. You you would be forgiven for thinking that this was a man made stone, wouldn't oh, you? Oh yeah, hundred percent. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Because it doesn't look like nature could create anything so no. incredible. You can imagine actually you're mining you're mining gemstones or whatever it is that often they're stumbled across, aren't they, when they're mining something else like ore or, or gold or some or copper. Anyway, can you imagine you're mining and then you see this yeah. colour within the ground? Mother Nature blows my mind yeah. that honestly, she can create this colour. Because honestly, because you, you would think that that would had been dyed, that that had been played with to create yeah. that kind of beauty. Yeah, but it's not. It's, it's not, not. No, it's not. Again, can I just sow this seed? How amazing would this piece of jewellery be? It's. I mean, it will go with any metal, but it's made for silver. Yeah, it's it just a must. Things with silver. Um, so shop ahead on those. You get two of what I'm holding. Um, they're five millimeter sterling silver beads just beautiful now for the six mil and look at the cool screens goodness me there's loads of you there i'm not surprised at all i'm not surprised the translucency the intensity of the saturation those beautiful fingerprint markings that you see within amazonite the, you know the love the global love of this amazing gemstone you know if Monica Venade is one of the most successful new jewellers, and they are still relatively new, I suppose, comparatively speaking. Um, most successful, award-winning. It's that middle-of-the-road price tag. It's not quite Cartier and Van Cleef and Arpels, but it's also not your Samuels, no dis disrespect for them. It's that kind of, you know, 100, 150, 200 pound price tag, yeah. yeah? So still consider, don't get me wrong, you could be inspired, make working with the same quality, I need to emphasize, if not better, yeah. um, I think better, as Tiffany's and Co, and make it at a fraction of the cost. Six mil is the most popular size. Yeah. I have exactly 20 left. We're talking about the six. Oh, sorry, six. How about with the with the difficulty of sourcing currently how about if we take this natural amazonite strand under 20 pounds unbelievable i have to try and word this in the best possible way that i can without it coming across wrong so bear with me i'll do my best we're not often wrong are we when we when we see a gemstone that um, is about to take the jewellery world by storm. Mm -hmm. This is what really has made uh, um, Gemporia partnership as successful as it is. Steve foreseeing that yeah. with his gem buying. And look, he's taking a step back these days from gem buying, but it, that's the success story. So we're not often wrong. No. We'll buy ahead. Yeah. You know, Amazon, I, I do think, is going to be that huge gemstone. 
it's pretty much sold out i've said it out loud we're bringing you the six mil under 20 pounds from that same parcel i think the whole parcel is going to sell out on this show today yeah. it's unbelievable quality if you look at monica veneda the reason she chooses these gemstones is because she knows that they're popular yeah so she will choose amazonite she will choose onyx because these are the popular gemstones these are the ones that everyone wants but that quality there that's like the very top yeah notch. top tier here it is under 20 pounds twos th look at the multi buyers on that four i can believe it twos threes twos four two 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 you disappear wow. off the screen as well you can get the entire selection so that's the 10 the 8 and the 6 mil for 70 pounds however wow. moving forward I think this 10 mils on their own will be that price. Yeah, definitely. And Ross is, yeah, I totally agree, Ross. Um, for natural, uh, natural Amazonite of this quality, look, we'll always be able to bring you the, how do, I, how do I word this? So we'll be able to bring you Amazonite of all grades. What we aspire to is bring our audience the best quality, of course, the most, at the most competitive price tag. Um, but we're not exempt from the world's desire for one particular no. gemstone um so yeah i agree ross says it, i think that's got potential of being 70 pounds on its own well done everybody the final five of these they've absolutely flown out marie's got two cambridgeshire catherine maureen dorothy devon elizabeth angela linda debbie Le uh, leslie d hello to you mary lorraine northumberland hello um and i can't keep up <laughs> um i've only got five available and i would strongly encourage shopping ahead in the next Next hour. Oh, so Remember much. also we've got those amazing pearls. <clears throat> Here we go. Written recently. Oh, literally a couple of days ago. February the 16th, 2024. Exploring Amazonite. So uh, we've just found an article that says this week we are exploring the Amazonite stone. Similar to Jade, Amazonite is associated with money, luck, and overall success. Ooh. It's known as the gambler's stone. Oh, I didn't know that. I love that. Um, encouraging good luck and fortune. Amazonite is said to have a soothing effect on the nervous system. But I can see that because it has a soothing effect just yeah. looking at it. But I mean, that's a big, you know, similar to Jade. I mean, definitely look at, you know. But you, yeah, I, I agree, you can see it, can't you? Oh, you yeah. totally get, you know, that bridge between winter and spring. You can see that gemstone of hope oh, you know that so encouraging much. good luck fortune all those things yeah you can see it can't you understand it yeah. amazing everybody now just before we duck into a break um i do have another parcel of amazonite to bring you um this is amazonite is a member of the feldspar family and like many other gemstones it actually comes in different shades and tones um Amazonite's palette, shall we explain, um, is very varied and it's absolutely beautiful. So you can get that sort of like tropical blue, but you can also get your kind of dusky pinks, your uh, soft, almost aquamarine like blues, your delicate greens. Um, these are coming up at 11 o'clock. They're brand new. And it's, am I right in saying that's a long strand, isn't it? A wow. meter long strand. Um, a collection of meter long opportunities and don't forget that beautiful aquamarine parcel too now you will not believe the price that we take this to still natural very different to what you saw earlier on like just just moments ago was like okay that's what i know i know amazonite to be that's the best i've ever seen mm -hmm. however it comes in many different varies it's like it's like sapphire for example most people go oh yes yeah, sapphire's blue but then you go oh actually it comes in pink yeah oh you can get green you can get orange you can get colorless sapphire it's eye-opening yeah so they're coming your way as well an amazing deal make sure take this time during the break to keep an eye on the website all the w's at jewelry maker because all of your sterling silver essentials are available on pre-order um keep checking the web for your last stock opportunities on your amazonite um update the 10 mils are sold out two of the eight mils and six mils have sold out. Grab okay. those eights. Get, grab those eights, yeah. Amazing. But do not go anywhere, jewellery makers, because we've got more to bring you in the next hour. Well, we'll see you in two.
it's Debbie Kershaw. I'm back with you on Friday the 23rd of February for a really, really exciting show. I'm going to be launching Delft Clay Casting. Now Delft Clay is a form, a refined form of sand casting and it's really, really exciting. So we're going to be using things like this, these and this to create things like this. So I hope you can join me on Friday the 23rd of February at Jewelry Maker. Hello, my name is Rachel Norris and I'm so excited to be with you on Saturday the 24th of February for the most amazing show. I don't even know where to begin, there's so much um, going on. So in the 9am hour, there is this amazing toolkit. It's multi-toolkit, it's got everything in it. It's got swage blocks, doming punches, um, all sorts of, um, and there's an anvil in there, all sorts of shapes and sizes and there's so much potential in this, in, in this sort of kit where you can actually, a kit of tools really, it's enormous uh, potential. So I've had fun because some things I've never used all before, so I've had fun experimenting really. And you can use it to make uh, them to make tubes like these color lilies, um, and um, you can do sort of um, folding and impressions and bee caps like this autumn leaf necklace. Um, and there's goodness knows I've made starfish with it and um, also you can do a sort of almost like a fold forming technique um, with this sort of heart necklace with this pattern like that and so I'll be teaching you some of the techniques in that um, part of the show and also there's, there's tutorial booklets in there with them as well so um, and there's um, so much, as I say so much potential and do you know what? <laughs> As if anything could beat the nine o'clock hour, the 12 o'clock hour is up there because there's a launch of some some brand new sort of dapping, punching tools. Um, and you can make some fantastic effects with them. There's a set of feather um, tools which you can actually use to make um, feathers and, and sun rays and all sorts of wonderful um, patterns. And there's line punching tools, which you can use to make snowflakes and, and wonderful sort of dandelion firework explosions sort of type pieces. I really hope you can join me on Saturday 24th of February for the most fantastic uh, metalwork and tooling show. Um, I've really enjoyed uh, preparing for it and I hope you can tune in to watch. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Welcome back everybody. Um, I love doing hours like this next one because you know take the Amazonite parcel as an example amazing beautiful gemstones but you need the foundations don't you 
to bring it all together. You need those little embellishments, those little extra something that take your jewellery from a beautiful gemstone piece to an amazing precious metal gemstone piece. And the spacer bead, if you were to ask me now, five years ago, probably even before that as well, I would say the same. One of my favourite essentials that we bring you here at Jewellery Maker is a spacer. And I remember going back to when we first started, we had them initially in like our, our multi findings packs where yep. you'd have you'd have some head pins, you've had some junk ones, you'd have some glass, you know, in the chiffon bag. Do you remember those back in the day for us old school jewellery makers? Remember them? Um, however, then we started doing them individually in packs of 10 and we were like, oh, amazing and then that was around about the same time we started introducing jump rings on their own and head pins on their own and we we're like this is great because you can actually customize your stash can't you now oh I could stock uh, stock update from Ross who's saying at least double figures of each item that's in the print on the website has gone on pre-orders but again I remember some over 20 being pre-ordered, yeah. I remember us doing those packs of 10. And they were, again, they might have changed. There might have been different prices depending on the show. Might have been a special deal or whatever. You might have a discount code. But I can remember, and what I have in my head, for like a pack of 23 or 4 millimeter spacer beads, 14.95. Yeah? He, I remember that price quite vividly and I know that's been sort of backed up by a lot of our guest designers. Now, I, it's only very recent, sort of fast forward many, many years, that we start introducing the larger size. And every time we have brought them to air recently, they have completely sold out. Today, though, we're bundling them. So that means you get a deal of the day saving on top of a bundle saving all the better again i love your three mils i love your four millimeters and then we started doing your stardust spaces and your diamond cut spaces and they all bring their their, their own unique beauty to your designs however these are your plain smooth five millimeter rounds five mil so that's all precious metal and i want to show you a few design houses that are actually working with your classic precious metal spacer bead. Pop along to Goldsmith. We all know Goldsmith, don't we? They're on most of your um, uh, most of your high streets. Or Tiffany's and Co. I think every single one of us knows Tiffany. Now they look smaller than five mil, but all the same. You can see one of their classic, mostly about your spacer beads, isn't it? And that's beaded onto a lobster claw clasp. Let's look at Goldsmith. Oh, Pandora. Simple stretchy, I think that is. Yeah, a couple of, I think you've got one parve bead in there, 70 pounds. 70 pounds for that bracelet. It's not bad, actually, I don't think, for Pandora. I don't think that's a bad price for them. Um, Tiffany Co. again, but without the sort of Amazonite coloured charm. Beautiful, but it's all about the space beads. Love wow. this one, I think that's great. Um, I don't know if they're silver, though, as in 925 silver. It might be referencing the colour. You know, so I would ask the question, um, but it's like a little stack, beautiful, all about the, st uh, the, 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 the bead itself. $179 for your eight inch triple strand silver bead bracelet. Again, I don't know if that's 925. If it is, that's a great price. A great price tag, I think, for that gram weight. Goldsmith, 50 pounds. I mean, that is space of beads, isn't it? Yeah. On a beading thread it is lobster clasp that's it lovely lovely 50 pounds for that bracelet now i can tell you if anybody is watching for the very first time and you've never made a single piece of jewelry in your life you could make that so easily even i could make that and that's saying something it's not a hard piece of jewelry to create is my point you just need the right components and whether you're Tiffany's, whether you're Goldsmith, whether you're Pandora, whether you're online on Etsy, whether you're a jewellery maker, whether you're, um, I don't know, any of the, the jewellery brands out there, if you've got these components, you could very easily 
very, very easily make that piece of jewellery. Now, in the past, when we launched the five mil, which are bigger than the weaves that we've done up to recently, um, we launched a pack of 20 for how much? 12, 12 pounds and 99 pence. And do you want to know how many sold at that price? 700. I can believe that. I can as well, because I know that it doesn't matter what medium you do, you know, what techniques you favour, you're going to use spacer beads, aren't you? Now today, I've got 500. So less than what I've already sold. So what we should have done is said, right, actually, let's, let's not bundle them. Let's say we've got 1,000 quantity and we'll match that price. Because we know it sells at that price, don't we? Over 700 have sold at that price tag. So surely we could do the 1,000. Yeah, we could do. But nah, we were like, no, I tell you what, let's do this on a Thursday, deal of the day, We'll launch some amazing natural parcels of gemstones and the most unbelievable pearls and amazonite and loads of other sterling silver essentials. And let's bundle our brand new, let's be honest, they are new to our vault, our brand new five mil sterling silver spacer beads. Bundle them. So instead of getting 20, you get 40 of the little guys. And they're still 925 sterling silver, but we'll bring it to you an even better saving. Let's do it. 60 seconds, there's 500. And you might be thinking right now, loads, that's plenty, that's loads. I'll check out my basket this afternoon. It won't be enough. It absolutely will not be enough. The biggest quantity auction I have done here at Jewelry Maker was, nine, uh, was 925. It was all 925, no gemstones. It was solid 925 sterling silver and it was a meter by the, by, sorry, chain by the meter. And we did just under 2,000. I remember that quantity. So 500 is what, 25% of that. So there's absolutely, absolutely potential of this being an on-screen sellout also. People don't just get one either. Because if you want to recreate or take inspiration from Tiffany's and Co, they're probably smaller on there, uh, that bracelet, I'm gonna say. But you're gonna need, well, probably the bundle to make that bracelet, would you agree? I would, yeah. Yeah? You could make that bracelet, I don't know what price it is, but it's going to be hundreds, isn't it? You can make that bracelet for your jewellery maker deal of the day saving today. Graphics are live. The largest of the spacer beads that I've seen recently here at Jewellery Maker, I love it. I love the three mils, I love the two mil spacers, I love the four mil spacers. These are five though, so they'll work perfectly if you can just remember alongside, you know, all of your other strands of gemstones. It's definitely one of the biggest that we do, yeah, for sure. And we've got, look, look, just dotted in between your aquamarine that's coming up a little bit later, whether it's your six mils, whether it's the four mils whether it's the eight mils, just dotting them in between. A, f a three or four millimeter would look lovely, however, far smaller. What about with the fireball pearls that are coming up? You know, maybe you're not uh, um, great at knotting. Maybe that's a skill that you need, um, you think you want to improve on. Just to whet the appetite a little bit, uh, some more on these. How about dotting? some of your beautiful sterling silver spaces in between your fireballs. How beautiful is that piece of jewelry going to be? Oh my goodness me. Now we have 500 had. Almost 100 have gone already. Let's show you the price, because like I said, we've launched. It was me as well, wasn't it? I launched these five mils, I think. And they were 12.99. Wasn't it with Wayne? I'm sure I was with Wayne. And they flew out, 700 of them sold um, at 12.99, which is a fantastic price tag because we've got to consider that's a lot of precious metal there. Um, 700 of them gone. Now, you know that we're not going to say, okay, well, let's have a little look at this. We sold them at 12.99. We'll sell those at 12.99 too. So 26 pounds for the bundle. That seems fair. It's a great saving. That's what we probably should have done or maybe just separated it brought you the quantity of a thousand um but no they're flying out the door big large drill holes as well by the way for want of a better description because i know they're not technically drill holes pop them directly onto silk silver chain elastic cords all of the above now, just to start making our way towards that amazing deal, £39.99. It's a great price when we consider. What's the gram weight, Roscoe? It's 
It's a big, it's a big gram weight because they're five mil sizes. And in Essex is shopping how I would as well, getting five. Renata's multi bought, well done. Elizabeth's multi bought. Isle of Man's multi bought. Stephanie's multi bought. Dee's multi bought. Leslie's multi bought. Um, you disappear off the bottom of the screens, everyone. Um, amazing. Mariska, Valerie, and Cyril. Denise, Lorraine. Four point four grams times two. Does that make sense? So that's four point four grams. Yeah. So 8.8 .8 grams in total. It's huge, absolutely huge. We should be at 26 pounds. I think that's fairly self-explanatory. But today we're gonna do an, an extra saving. We've got 500, it was a great deal earlier on at 12.99 for the pack of 20. You're getting 40 today and we're going to squeeze those margins, bring it down even further on your precious 925 sterling silver. 8.8 .8 grams of precious metal, loads of multi-buyers. And you know those of you that have multi-bought, I think you'll come back and get more. I think you will. Because how often do we see them? I, I, only remember, I think I launched these very, very recently. Um, I think it was alongside Wayne. I think Wayne was producing me at the time. I think it was when, when Chloe was poorly. Um, if, if I remember rightly, Ross, I might be wrong. Um, but they absolutely flew out the door. 500 of them sold out. Sorry, 700 of them sold out. <laughs> <laughs> and it's about to do the same again everybody we'll bring you the most unbelievable deal congratulations not 12.99 for 20 you're actually getting 40 and an extra saving because we bundled it why well, don't know <laughs> 24 pounds and 99 pence only Oh, incredible. I mean, there's so many uses why, uh, so many reasons why we would class this as an essential. Would you agree, Nikki? Absolutely. And I would say to anybody who's bought any strand today, because you've got the already paid post and pack in, yeah. I would be throwing them in your basket as well. Sure. Because they Absolutely. are going to go with everything. It, when I come in 12 o'clock hour, you'll see how many times I've used them. Well, I'm looking at your beautiful, put, is that amethyst? That's amethyst, yeah. Uh, amazing. I mean, you could literally just put them in that design, couldn't you? Yeah. I use them for everything. I make charms out of five mil beads. Yeah. Yeah. I do. Absolutely beads. gorgeous. Yeah. That's working out at what? Six, did you say 60p? 62p per sterling silver bead. And don't forget, you know, Mark always mentions as soon as he introduces anything sterling silver, he's adding a minimum yeah. of five pounds, a minimum. So just one of those beads added to a beaded necklace, maybe it's a focal, yeah. or it's hiding, a, it's hiding a, a knot in your stretchy bracelet, whichever, because that's the thing, they're perfect for hiding knots. Oh yeah, and these aren't tiny little things where you're like, you've got a little hint of silver. These no. are wham, silver. Yeah, I agree, you know. exactly. 8.8 .8 grams in total. Wow. That's a lot of silver, isn't it? it? Is. Um, 24 pounds and 99 pence. Jackie's got two. Uh, Shirley's got two. Stephanie's got two. Dorset's got two. Florence has multi bought. Devon's got three. Nicolette's multi bought. Buckinghamshire's. There's almost, yeah, the call screens have completely filled up. So I've brought you this before at 12.99. Today you're getting this. And we've actually brought you a saving as well. But Ross is saying, hang on, how it's a it's a bit of a saving. But he says, I reckon I could give a bit of an extra saving. How about we said twelve ninety nine for one pack of twenty on launch, and then the other for ten pounds. Wow. Hey, that's like. Yeah, that's like, yeah, but isn't that like 20% off? Isn't it something like that? Am I looking at it right? Yeah. It's about 15, yeah, 20%. Yeah. That's not bad, is it? It's like we've given you a discount code, yeah. but we haven't. We've just done it anyway, just because we can. Because. Is that what's the point in bundling if you can't if you can't bring savings? 
Oh, definitely bringing a saving today. Wow. And we know you're going to use them, whatever your medium is, whatever your favourite jewellery design is, whether it's beading, knotting, wire work, whether it's metal smithing, whether it's macrame, whether it's uh, um, kumihimo, what am I missing, sea beading, you're absolutely going to use them, aren't you? In everything that you do. And it's going to take you from being somebody who works with gemstones, which is amazing and lovely, to somebody who's creating precious metal jewellery. Absolutely. It's it's that it's that subliminal message without actually saying it out yeah. loud. It's that level of luxury yeah. that you're creating. £22.99. Because we have that perceived value of this of precious metal, yeah. don't we? And all customers do. The minute you put precious metal into something, yeah. you're elevating it. Instantly. Totally. I, I hey listen, I've always said that there's absolutely a place for base metal absolutely and costume jewelry you know however if you can afford to work with your precious metals which is what i one of our greatest strengths i think here at jewelry maker do it because like you said it's that perception yeah. so you're buying one pack of 20 for 12.99 and you're getting the other pack for a tenner it's amazing and they're not any bitty bitty ones they're five oh, millimeters in their size it is more than 20 i thought so it's more than 20%, isn't it? Let's work it out. Do you see where I'm coming from? Just under, sorry, a whisper under yeah. 20%. Should we round it up or round it down? So this should be 26 pound. Let's give 20% off that price. We haven't given you a code or anything. You haven't got to enter a code. For buying the two packs, we're going to give you a 20% saving. That was completely spontaneous, wasn't it, Roscoe? But only that. because I mentioned it. It was like 22 99 was our rock bottom deal. It was already amazing when it was £12.99, wasn't it? So, yeah. But because I mentioned it, Ross is like, ah, oh, let's go with that. Let's go with it. 20% off, everybody. 925 sterling silver. Again, absolutely perfect alongside your Amazonite. Absolutely perfect alongside your Aquamarine. Absolutely perfect with Nikki's amazing 12 o'clock masterclass. And don't forget with those beautiful pearls that are also coming up within this hour as well. Um, shop ahead on those. There's only 38 available. Look at all the multi-buyers. Why are we not surprised? They are essential, aren't they? Um, Anne's got five. You've all got this saving as well. Don't worry. Don't worry. If just because you shopped ahead, you get that same saving. Because nothing is debited from your card or account until your order is ready to be dispatched. 20, yeah, now you know that's not a normal jewelry maker price, don't you? <laughs> we don't normally do random prices like that. That's how spontaneous we are here at Jewelry Maker. 20 pounds and 80 pence. Amazing, absolutely amazing. Again, to go alongside those beautiful pearls that are coming up, they're totally natural in their color and you've got one of the greatest palettes as well. Um, a really beautiful selection. But yeah, maybe you're not fantastic at knotting then use these actually as an alternative to knotting because they give you that separation they bring you that lovely pop of luster to complement your pearls likewise alongside say um your beautiful aquamarine this parcel which is brand new and that's coming your way as well what about with that meter long length strand of multicolored amazonite that we're bringing sorry this is aquamarine did i say that um but also the amazonite that we've got coming your way so lots pretty much everything that we've spoken about today will absolutely complement your space beads the days of us bringing you and I, i'm not saying we're stopping it but we've brought you two mil we've brought you three mil for many years in actual fact and i think i, we, I remember us actually doing it in packs of 10 then they went up to 15 then they went up to 20 and i seem to remember 14.95 now we're bringing you a larger size a pack of 20 or actually pack of 40 for 20 pounds and 80 pence what's that working out at each Fifty-two wow. p, and an over eight point eight grams of solid nine two five silver. It's 
It's amazing, isn't it? I love the fact that Jewelry Maker does deals like this. You mentioned earlier on, uh, Nikki, the fact that magnetic clasps are actually hard to come by. Lots of findings are, to be oh, truthful. So they are, yeah. And, and the thing is, like I said as well, because you've already paid your post and pack if you've bought something else, it just makes sense to yeah, buy them at the absolutely. same time because you can't always get them. Quite often, especially in these larger sizes, they're sold out. And I know I'm sitting looking at something that you've got there, and I'm thinking they'd be brilliant. Just about five of them on the slider bracelet. On the oh, on the 925 slider bracelets yeah. that are coming up. They'd yeah, they look amazing. They'd look absolutely gorgeous. I totally agree. They would. Totally agree. Um, you're going to use them, aren't you? This is the thing. Always. You are going to use them yeah. repeatedly. It's one of. That's why when we we sort of opened this uh, today's deal of the day, we were talking about the fact that you know. Of your findings you've got and they all do different things of course jump rings head pins class i class a spacer bead as a finding oh definitely it is a finding but one that it it, it it's aesthetic it's an aesthetic it finding if that it makes is. sense it's there it's very present yeah in your jewelry. beautiful yeah. i think you'll use it frequently now ross is a little bit i've got I, i've got to hold up a sec because ross is like l feel a little bit uncomfortable he's not it happy about this price. he says l i don't like <laughs> that price that, that those numbers 10 pound 40 per pack go on then shall we you know what's going to happen ross doesn't like those numbers and i see where he's coming from it does feel a bit un it feels a bit weird doesn't it yeah you it's know an odd number just like when you do something different to what you normally yeah. do. It's making me uncomfortable. Give me yeah. a twitchy eye. Sleep on the wrong side of the bed or something like <laughs> that. No, oh, it doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel right. Say in the same way, those numbers on your screens, on your graphics, doesn't sit right with us here in the studio. So Ross is like, shall we just tip over that price bracket? You yes. know which one I'm on about. Let's do it. And give it to you for a pack of 20 under £10 how amazing I, I i i get you it's like trying to eat your dinner with your knife and fork in the wrong hands just feels weird doesn't it yeah just feels weird everybody pays the final low regardless of whether you were the first person to enter into the auction or you're going to be the very last we had 500 what's the stock update roscoe okay these are absolutely flying out the door so you need to be a bit quick no, that's that is crazy though isn't it that, that is crazy that bracelet you showed before that goldsmith's bracelet yeah you've got it there and yeah. more and more and that's the goldsmith bracelet i think we're quite small yeah i think the beads were quite i don't know you can't really tell by that picture can you i don't know but 50 pounds you could make that twice over at the very least yeah, definitely at the very least 8.8 .8 grams of precious metal a really really substantial amount it is for 20 pounds only amazing look at the call screens six pounds saving but i mean that's with us here at jewelry maker outside these four walls it's going to be much more much 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 more um amazing look at the call screens uh someone has lost the plot silly price says margot it's ross it's ross <laughs> he, d he just didn't like that price those numbers yeah, he didn't like those numbers. And I do kind of get it. You know, like when you do something a little bit differently and it's, it feels a bit strange, because I'm a proper creature of habit yeah. as well. So when you do something a little bit different, I don't know. Have you got a designated cup for your tea? Oh, definitely. Yeah. yeah. And you use a different one. No. It's not quite right. Doesn't fit. It's not no. quite the same. Doesn't not quite as same. satisfying. Yeah. Like I so say, you sleep on the wrong side of the bed. It feels weird, yeah. doesn't it? To Ross, that £20.80 price tag was a bit weird. Um, okay, yeah, we have gone too low though, Margot. You're right. So I tell you what, we're going to have to hold these on air for one final minute. Um, keep an eye on the website because there's loads of your essential goodies um, um, on the website for you to shop ahead. Slider bracelets, as Nikki mentioned them. You've got other bracelets, head pins, all sorts of goodies. Um, you know what? If you've got the Amazonite, the 6 mil, say... 20 pounds and this 20 pounds that's a lot to make 
multiple Amazonite sterling silver bracelets. And they would sell instantly. If you're selling your jewellery, they yeah. would sell instantly. Do you sell jewellery? I Nikki? do. You do? Yeah. So do you like, I know that they would sell. Yeah. Do you do like your artisanals or have you got a website? I've or? got a website, Instagram page. But I've got really nice core of customers who just repeatedly buy off me. But they're the kind of people who, you know, Amazonite, for example, is one of my most popular gemstones. I'm not surprised, yeah. Because I make a lot of sea-themed pieces. Yeah. But those silver spacer beads, they're the foundation of, yeah. of all my jewellery. Yeah, you know. absolutely. I, I, yeah, I mean, it's one of those that's going to complement everything, it isn't does. it? Yeah. Well done, everybody. Stay where you are. Keep on dialing through. You can still get those, but obviously I need to move on. Now, ooh, where do we go from there, eh? Oh. Shall we do some more sterling silver? I'm going to bring you some lovely sterling silver. What did you say? Jump rings. Yes. No. There you go. Oh, wow. Now, <laughs> oh, 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 eh, eh. Perfectly <laughs> spherical. Now, these have absolutely flown out on pre order. I'll get to show you in a second. One minute. Okay. Oh, you know how I feel about jump rings. Now, yes, they make you. You. <laughs> you. Uh, do, do you chain mail then? No. No. I don't know. I just love jump rings. Ah. There's so much you can do with them. Yeah, honestly. absolutely. I love. I agree. These. I'm not surprised these have flown out because most jump rings are bigger. Yeah, they are. Um, and I love the three mil internal yeah. diameter size because it doesn't compete. Nope. It's not too intrusive. You just. And again, it's about that balance. Um, in terms of scale, if you're if you're creating, I don't know, a necklace or a bla bracelet, you've got the class, but you want the jump rings really to be I don't know behind the scenes yeah. serving a purpose Definitely. not necessary unless of course you are using it for a design yeah. but um, now these are open jump rings I use tons of these do you tons of them well and unfortunately they're not on our, our screens that often um, look you could just literally loop them together already yeah I'm not surprised yeah we haven't seen these since September last year, where over 200 flew, we have the same quantity today. So three millimeter, look how lovely that, I mean, I didn't do that. That's literally how it must have worked its way. Um, now, there's a pack of 50. We could say 49.99, that's one pound each, amazing. We could go 24.99, 50p per sterling silver jump ring. And we need them as jewellery makers. It's like your bread and butter, your flour as a baker. You need jump rings. First price crash are not your price. Oh, wow. <laughs> Under £10 for a pack of 50. There's three and a half grams of sterling silver. But again, if I just remove that unintentional chain, mm. you can see the precision of the actual opening. Um, these aren't... You can make a jump ring, but it's quite you, difficult to do with a saw where they don't align perfectly. You never get a join like, no. like they are. No, I agree. We've got 200 available. Minute clock. We're going again. I can't believe it. Look at the call screens. You are not alone in your love of jump rings. Oh, honestly. Because that you use them so often for so many different things. Yeah. And, and I said, silversmiths use them. I mean, I when I make a bale for a necklace, I make a sort of horizontal bale, three jump rings on. Yeah. Everything I make, I, I like do that. that. Yeah, three, three absolutely. Mil jump rings. Because they just sit on the neck so gorgeously. So beautifully. We're going even lower. Pack of 50 of them as well. It's not, not just a small no, amount. No. Only issue is that I've only got 200 available. And we're going even lower, and I can see the reaction on the call screens. There's a little bit of a queue on the phone lines, but do bear with our amazing team upstairs. Um, they will absolutely get to you. Um, you can always shop with us via the app. There's no queues there. You can always shop with us on the website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. $9.99 is a great deal for sterling yes. silver. They are sterling silver. You know, you think about the success of Lynx of London Sweetie Bracelet. That was all about the jump ring, wasn't it? Close them together and put them in between. You've got yeah. spaces in between. 50 spaces, sir. £7.99. pence. Yeah, that's... That, are Shush. you sure, Ross? That is... Are you... That's a very low price. It is. Goodness me. Three and a half grams, a pack of 50. That's amazing. That's, that, that is incredible. 
Over 100 are gone, you need to be quick on these, everyone. Whether you do chain mail or not, you need your jump rings. You will need jump rings. It, would you say it's the jump, the, sorry, the finding you use the most? Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely beyond any Without shadow hesitation. of doubt. I mean, for me, I use millions of them. But yeah, because you can use them for so many things. Yeah. You're going to use them when you're making bracelets, necklaces, you're just going to use them to attach things to. But you can use them as spaces, you can use them as bales, you can yeah. actually make jewelry out of them there's so much you can do absolutely loving that what a deal sorry you know i i, I get used to sort of amazing deals because i'm i have the good fortune of being here frequently however that shocked me yeah 7.99 I remember, I, it's, just, it's shocked you guys looking at the reaction too. I remember doing base metal at these kind of prices. Yeah, that's the kind of price you would expect base metal to be. Yeah, not precious metal. Well done, everybody. Make sure you're checking out your baskets, everyone. And keep an eye on the website. There's loads of your essentials on there. You know, and there's nothing worse. Nothing worse. You know, you were saying you're really chilled and placid. Yeah. You know, when you try, you've got inspiration, you've got an idea in your head and you've no design that you want to, you want to make and you go home and you think, yeah. you think, yeah, right, I'm going to do this and I know this. And then you go, oh, drat, I haven't I got the finding. Have. Yeah. Is there anything more infuriating than yeah. that? And it's those, it is jump rings that are the ones. It is. They're always, and, and especially smaller size ones. Yeah, I love, I love the three mil ones. Yeah, I do. Because when you're making bracelets especially, you don't want a massive jump ring. No, you don't. Because you know. that becomes what you look at then, yeah. and that's not really the idea. Um, <laughs> it is frustrating though, very frustrating, because it hinders your creativity. Yeah. And then that design never manifests, no, does it? It doesn't, because then you leave it and it's gone, then yeah. the moment's gone. All right, there actually might be some things that are more <laughs> frustrating, but as a jewellery maker, yeah. as a jewellery maker, that's got to be up there. It's, I mean, it's a throw a hammer across the room moment. Yeah, it absolutely. Is. Dolly's out pram. Yeah. 100%. Um, okay, let's now bring you, oh, I love these little guys. They're so cute. And they do achieve so much. Your little wire guardians. Oh, yes. Also look like earphones or a horseshoe. Yeah. So if I can just describe, because I know that these are, as a finding, they were quite, they're not, we haven't had them forever here at Jewelry Maker. So a wire guardian, I, it's one of those you think, I wish I thought of that. I wish I invented those. So if you look, you've got two tubes, which is like the earmuffs. Then um, two tubes there. And then where I'm holding, if I tilt it towards Dan, you might notice is a, obviously a, a sort of strip of silver that has a gully running through it. It's like a, a dip. So ideally, if I flip it in this direction, you can see you feed your silk, beading thread, tiger tail, yep. whatever you're using, through the one tube, you follow the gully, and then you go down. You can crimp them as well. Okay. Um, and you can put another crimp at the bottom. What that does, A, it looks so, if I take one of your jump rings as well, what that does, A, looks really professional, yeah. but B, um, adds longevity to your jewellery because um, you're not going to have any uh, friction on the thread, just purely on the thread. So if I can do, one sec, see if my tweezer skills are up to it, clearly not. Hang on. So, oh, as a piece of jewellery, it will sit like that next to your clasp. Does that make sense? Like that. The pearls that are coming up, I would 100% be using your oh, yeah. wire guardians. Definitely. 100%. Um, and it basically is protecting the silk. So your clasp will obviously sit here and then you've got your gemstones coming out here. Um, they are, I think, an absolute revolution. Um, and I genuinely wish I invented them. I think they're a great idea. So it stops the friction, which m the bulk of the friction is actually going to be on the, uh, um, by the clasp, of course, where effectively your piece of jewelry is doing all the work. Now, I only have 75 in stock. My advice would always be, thank you, lovely. My advice would always be to get them when you get the opportunity, when you have the chance. Now, this could do with a little bit of a polish, but it doesn't matter. You see, the wire guardian within there so let me notice there you've got the notch you've got the crimp covered by a crimp cover and then you've got your wire guardian so what that's doing is looking after the silk against that jump ring there 
that's going to add years to the piece of jewellery itself. Not only that, I think it looks really it does smart. Look, it always makes it look professional. And I tell you, if you're making, you know, these uh, seed bead, I know you've got a pair behind you, seed bead fringe earrings yeah. where they have long, you have to have them. You have to have them at the very top. Ah. so that you can attach the hooks to them amazing uh, and again it's one of those moments when you've done all your seed beads and you're ready to go and you think i don't have that i don't yeah. have a wire protector you need to you, yeah they need to be one of your essentials and we didn't have them forever here at jewelry maker yeah. but when they when i first saw them i was like yes yeah they're fantastic because there's n <sighs> again if i was looking at a piece of jewelry and i was considering buying it buying it and i saw it with an exposed silk i would walk away yeah I would personally, you know I can only speak personally because I know it's not going to last. Yeah. I would walk away because I think that, you know, that silk is going to have natural friction. It's not going to last that long. Nine ninety nine. you get a pack of how many? 20. Wow. Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> They're going to absolutely fly out. Six ninety nine, an hour of your essentials, everybody. Again, with the pearls that are coming up, Wire Guardians. You don't need two. Don't you? Only need two perfect for that um 75 isn't yeah we're going to be selling out if you can shop with us on the web or on the app that would be fantastic because there's no queues there for the time being how long is that wait on the phone lines roscoe a minute okay that's not so bad when we say a queue you know it's it's usually a matter of seconds you know mi you know minute two minutes maybe you know it's not like when you phone the utility companies and you're on hold for like 45 minutes and losing the will to live, <laughs> aren't you? With, every, with that dreadful music. Oh, We're a couple of minutes, so they are an amazing team. Just upstairs. Um, or you can shop with us via the app or the website. And don't forget, also, it's in our interest to answer quickly because we're paying for the call. If you're dialing off a landline, um, we're paying for that call. Six ninety nine. Well done, everybody, for your beautiful wire guardians. Is that the right description? Well, I guess so. Yeah. They, they do create a tidiness, don't the they, to your designs? Definitely, they, they definitely, certainly with something like the pearls, you couldn't not use them because they, they just give that high-end look. Yeah. When, when, you know, when you're using something as incredible as those pearls, you're going to want to have that with them. 100%. You know. 100%. You know, and even something like your nylons, which are probably a bit stronger than yeah. your, than your uh, silks, if it's constantly rubbing against an edge or, or some metal, yeah. which is obviously harder, it's going to create stress to Absolutely. the silk itself. So yeah. definitely, definitely, definitely encourage getting hold of these. Uh, 6 99 well done. There's tons of you there. Goodness me. They're on the verge of selling out. We're massively over allocated. So congratulations. Now... Let's not forget as well, not only are we bringing you your essential findings, we've got 37 of these absolutely beautiful pearls. Oh. They're not available on pre-order because of the quantity. Um, they're absolutely huge, multi-colors. I mean, I've got a full spectrum across these. And those of our regular viewers that tune in on a daily basis will certainly be up to speed on the fact that the pearl world has completely changed. Completely changed. Um, it kind of, the turning point was in was COVID really obviously which impl implicated the supply um, but what we didn't foresee is the oh, the implications of influence uh, influences over in China and the popularity of pearls completely skyrocketing so much so first time ever really I think in the in the world of pearls um, the price per pearl has massively skyrocketed we've never been able to say in the past freshwater pearls can command the same price tag as saltwater pearls we can now we definitely definitely can now these are coming up we've got 37 available they are truly incredible we'll talk at greater length during that auction opportunity but not yet um, they'll come up after the silver so they're coming your way after the silver i know some of you have been asking about those next up Rose gold, these are Ooh. lovely. Oh, have you seen these? No, they go beautifully go with those pearls. Oh, oh, look how gorgeous they are. I want these. Oh, look how pretty. Isn't it funny? Just one silver, one rose gold, 925 silver, five millimeter bead. Look how beautiful they oh. are. And they're so simple. They are, but that's what makes them beautiful. Yeah. It's not, it's not the texturing. It's not the fact they're completely encrusted with gemstones. It's 
the simplicity, the luster, that blush mm. tone. Look at that, the blush tone of your rose gold. And we kind of uh, um, started discussing it earlier on, Nikki, that you know, rose gold, or oh, sorry, yellow gold and rose gold are really popular right yeah, now. That definitely. warmth that you get. Yeah. It is, and I think mixed metals are becoming much yeah. more of a thing now. And I, I certainly, you know, with the ones that you had before, can you imagine a lovely bracelet with just each one of them? All yeah, to lovely. Be beautiful. Stunning. I I'd do that, the, the deal of the day with one rose gold and vice versa. Yeah, I love that. And then a rose gold with one silver. Yeah. Just gorgeous. They are. Absolutely, Absolutely gorgeous. gorgeous. In their own right. Because the metal is just coming through. Yeah. The, the beauty of the metal and rose gold is so so beautiful it it's is. romantic i think it is yeah very romantic because uh, again sorry to keep mentioning cartier but cartier one of their most successful collections aside from the panther is their um trilogy collection mm -hmm. where they talk they use that's all about the precious metal colors so um i know lots of you all know this uh yellow is for friendship Roses for love and white is for fidelity, and it's just oh, that is something that they have used for uh, um, decades. I think absolute decades. We're at forty nine ninety nine in a pack of twenty, and we've got quantity. Have we? I might have to get some of these. I like the rose gold. We don't see them very often. Over a hundred available. I will. Um, have you got a white piece of paper? Just because I don't think you can quite see them there. There you go. Oh, look how pretty. £14.99 pence only. Wow. These are not your little two, three millimetre guys. They are not your, thank you, not even four mil. Five millimetres in their size. That's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Sorry. Oh, I yeah, that's those not... with the aquamarine. Um... Well, yeah, with the aquamarine would be amazing, wouldn't the they? Aquamarine. Beautiful. Well, make sure you're checking out everybody. Congratulations. They are flying Samantha, Marie, Angela. Shall I get the aquamarine, actually? Let's hold them together. Yeah. Look at that. Beautiful blush tones. These are also coming your way, all with those pearls that are coming up in a few oh. moments' time as well. Um, well done. Make sure you're checking out. We've got a big quantity of them, but absolute essentials. You know, rose gold... It always, oh, with the Ams night, yeah, lovely. Rose gold, gold let's, 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 let's just say it as it is, used to be the colour of the precious metal that was probably the least popular. Yeah. I don't think that's the case anymore. I don't, because I see it like yellow gold and I see it, you know, when people buy it. I think people tend to think of the rose and the yellow gold. It used to be sort of like a more old fashioned thing. Yeah. But it's completely flipped now. Yeah, totally. And it's very, very fresh and young and yeah, new Yeah, absolutely. Now. And my daughter won't wear silver. She wears rose and, and yellow gold. She doesn't wear silver at all. Yeah. You know, and I think it's, it's much more fashionable now than it used to be. I totally, totally, totally agree. Um, it's that, it's, that, it's that one in between colour, I think. Thank you, Dan. It's that in between colour that, you know, if you don't quite like the coolness, the brightness of your silver, yeah. um, but maybe yellow gold is just a little bit too warm, it is that perfect balance in between the two. There you go. I think it's also lovely as well is that sometimes you don't know, if you're giving somebody a gift, you don't know if they wear gold or you don't know if they wear silver. Yeah, true. But rose gold will go with anything. Yeah, it true. It just looks gorgeous. It's a, it's a, it's a safe bet, yeah. isn't it? Well done. There was a hundred, but there's tons of you there. Uh, Mary and Jerry, Jenna Weaver, hello to you, Hampshire, Yvonne, new customers, Ken, hello to you, Gloucestershire, Gerda, um, stay where you are on those phone lines. Absolutely fantastic. Again, they're absolutely flying. Um, okay, let's now bring you Oh, I can't remember the last time I did an auction on these. Uh, uh. <laughs> Just one man down. It's all right. It's all good. No, I can't remember the last time I did an auction on these. Oh, oh there we go. Ross is say saying, I can tell you. July last year. Have they got ball on the end of them? Oh. <laughs> We've only got what? 70. They're and they're the ones which... It's a... It's a sensible length of head pin. Yes. You know, I like the long ones. Don't get me wrong. They've got their place, but you don't use them as often. No, because you waste a lot of silver with the really long ones. Yeah. You yeah. Do. So these are that a sensible length. 
but it is that little ball detail as well it they're is. so beautiful aren't they absolutely all that 925 is that 3.9 grams i can't quite see yeah 3.9 grams now they haven't been on air so you know those earrings with the topaz that we had this morning the rambling cut topaz and we spoke about the fact yeah just put one of your amazonites put yep. one of your aqu aquamarines on there you could wrap loot them on yep if you wanted to you know so I, I like that tip that nikki gave where you just put one little head pin underneath so you no longer Absolutely. have the hole yeah just slip it off bit of glue pop it in done. job done we are at 29 pounds and 99 pence and you're getting a pack of 30. two millimeter ball detail which i love it's like a little space of bead in its own it's in its own right isn't it if you look at the necklace that i've made for the 12 o'clock hour it's got loads of those in it has it yep they're all over the place ah i'll oh show you my why because i use them to create charms so beautiful they are basically i've never looked at it like this before they basically are a spacer bead on a pin yep aren't they yeah that's exactly what it is how some 13 years into me working here at jewelry maker have i only considered that now how is that the case but it's true those yep. little ball details yep space bead on a pin space bead on a pin 12 pounds and 99 pence we've got quantity but these are really on our screens and they are so important i think to um our jewelry maker stashes don't put yourself in that situation that nikki and i were just describing when you've got something in your head and you're like i'm going to do this i'm going to do this and you're just ready and everything just you know like the planets align and yeah. you've got the time to do it and you know there's no craziness yeah, everything I'm like, out. everything's out you've got the gemstones and you go ah oh, no head pin no. and there's nothing worse and then you're scratching around in the bottom of your jewelry box aren't you trying yeah. to find something or you're cutting up existing pieces of jewelry you know we will always need them i've only got 70 though i tell you what's good as well they're a nice substantial size as well because quite often what i look i get to my stash and i think i've only got these tiny featherweight ones which are great but sometimes when you put if you've got a pair, anything that's got a larger drill hole will go right through not with those uh, i love featherweights however they're also a bit wibbly wobbly they aren't are they wibbly -wobbly. they're and not they they're not they're create not create wibbly wobbly loops they're not perfectly straight no so actually to get like you say a loop yep. or an eye pin a loop or to rosary link with it then it's all personal choice of course but they're never yeah. as perfectly straight they're nice as a traditional head pin yeah wibbly wobbly there you go love that Did you? very professional <laughs> we all knew we all knew what i meant though didn't we yeah, um amazing 12.99 these were on the verge of selling out so well done well done well done come on now next up oh i'm making a right hash of that goodness me leverbacks <gasps> next now if i w ever describe a leverback one way it's always the same way um so i love shepherd hooks shepherd hooks are great you know they're, they're kind of like almost like a coat hanger where mm -hmm. they kind of go through the ear um however with a lever back it's like a lock in the door if that makes sense so it's it's the difference between say a stud with just a slide on butterfly back and a stud with a screw back um it's about the security of them so if i was working with say those pearls prime example some of your amazing cotan that's coming up on saturday or your amazonite that you had today or your your aquamarine any of your high-end gemstones these are the ones that i would go towards because it's peace of mind isn't it at the end of the day um it's knowing that once they're in the ear and if you mess it with your hair a lot like i do um sometimes you do catch your catch your earrings and they come out so anyway i leave it back oh just like a lock in the door effectively and you open them up like so again much easier when they're actually in a finished piece of jewelry and you're not holding them in tweezers earlobe here there you go and then you literally close them up like so and you attach whatever it is to the bottom so they would sit in the ear like this effectively does that make sense yeah beautifully weighted again they it's engineering i always think Nikki. Yeah, it is i i shouldn't even say this <laughs> i make a pair of earrings and they're called strand line earrings and all they are basically is two millimeter um faceted gemstones on ball head pins lots of them 
on lever backs for 65 pounds a pair or something yeah well they sound amazing by the they're way they're lovely but i wouldn't dream of putting any other binding on the end of yeah. them other than those yeah. because they need to hold all those gemstones yeah. and they need to be secure absolutely and they make they create a lovely movement as well lever backs yeah, yeah. I, I i'm not surprised and i think it's just one of those if you're really conscious of okay i want to make these and i want them to absolutely i don't want to be at risk losing them yeah I would gravitate towards the lever back as well. Uh, Twelve pounds and ninety nine pence, absolutely amazing. Have we got quantity? Um, okay, we're in triple figures, but only just. But again, the reaction on the phone lines have gone crazy. It's three grams of sterling silver. Yeah, look, there's there's a, always a place for your shepherd hook. There always is, one hundred percent. So those, you know, and uh, look, I'll show you some amazing wire work earrings that Claire created. I think these were Claire's. They certainly look like Claire's wire work but look absolutely beautiful there's your classic shepherd hook but i think if that is what i think it is is if that's a cotan jade personally yeah. first thing i would do if i was buying these is put them directly onto absolutely. it absolutely personally <laughs> because claire probably didn't have them in a stash bless her but because I wouldn't want to risk losing the gemstone. No, and I think as well when you're going, when you're charging a certain price point for things, yeah. you've got to you've got to put that extra security on. Yeah, totally yeah. agree, totally totally agree. Um, well done, everybody. Again, stay where you are on those phone lines. Um, incredible. I do have. Oh, this is fast becoming one of my favourite findings: the peg bales. I do so many pendants <laughs> with peg bales. This is a great stash builder out. Yes. And we don't get them very often. No, it's incredible. Um, don't get them very often. And so I'm here missing the... it. <laughs> no, no, you can. I always say this. I'm a bad influence, I am, Nikki. But literally. Get on the phone. <laughs> if I see you doing that, I won't speak to you. So I know that you can do what you got to do. Um, <laughs> I'm like that friend when you go shopping, they'll be like, yes, buy it. Do it. Treat yourself. I, yeah. <laughs> 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 look at how lovely these also great to make connectors out your gemstones yeah. not just pendants you could put a peg at either side or say yeah. your aquamarine there's a lovely connector Absolutely. um that's a pound a peg and they're silver pegs very discreet nice little discreet peg bales i love them they're lovely aren't they we've got a hundred available wow Wow. These are quite hard to get as well. Yeah, it's, uh, they often sell out. Look. I love that. It's really nice. Yeah. And I'm only reaching for that because that's the only bead I've got. I love that as a pair of earrings. Yeah. I would wear that as a pair of earrings. Yeah. That's so nice. And you can put a peg the other side if you want to use it as a connector in a necklace or a bracelet. Yeah super simple now if you think about these peg bales if they were much bigger then it wouldn't work would it no. it wouldn't no. really work so it's about that balance amazing we've got quantity of these is that right roscoe over 100 you say but i reckon yeah they're gonna sell out they always do it's uh, peg bales for me you know when you've made your piece of jewelry and then you've got a couple left over yeah that's when I always got right account okay, I'll, I'll put them into yeah. peg bales and they can be connectors they can be maybe a connector in between your shepherd hook and a drop earring a, yeah. a, a gemstone they could and, be and don't be afraid of using your fully drilled ge uh, no. gemstones with them because you can always as I said pop something on the bottom you can even glue a tiny little gem onto the bottom there's yeah. nothing wrong with doing that it'll look gorgeous it absolutely will I mean look these are obviously on the strand, but you'll get the idea. So if you can imagine that in there. Yeah. Look how lovely that is as a necklace. Just one pearl from the strand okay. that you've got coming up. Just one. And that wasn't cherry picked, by the way. It's just okay. the one that naturally actually came. Um, Monica Veneda, I know for a fact, sells charms exactly like that. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, amazing. Look at these colors look oh, at these wow. colors look at that they're insane aren't they it's like oil on water I love insane coming your way yeah that's why you need little peg bales 
And again, you can just literally glue them into place using something like your uh, um, hypo cement. Um, you get a pack of 30 of them, which is absolutely incredible. Georgina, hello to you, Merseyside, Cynthia, Elizabeth, Regine, Valerie, Elaine, Tina, good, Buckinghamshire, Jane, hello to you, Anne and Samantha, um, Cornwall. Well done, everybody. Um, now, I'm going to sort of tease you one more time because they're coming up in one auction with these absolutely incredible pearls. So what we're going to do is what, we're what, sorry? Um, we've got one more auction and I'll tell you that the pearls are coming your way the other side of the break. So you can do whatever you need to do oh. to make your pearl dreams come true. There are only 37 and we might put these on pre-order <laughs> during the break. They'll go. They will, absolutely. They're totally natural fireball pearls coming your way and they have got the most incredible palette of colour and it's all natural. So the last of your essentials. And these are going back to your head pins, but they're different to the head pins that you had earlier, if that makes sense. Not all head pins are the same, are they? Um, these are even smaller. So amazing. So you were th if you were looking at the last head pins going, okay, they're great, but I don't really want L the two millimeter bead at the bottom. I want something that's maybe one mil, yeah? Then here you go. Also, you can use these with your micro gemstones as well, this can't you? This is what you? I use when I make the strand line earrings. I oh, use, really? I use hundreds of them. I use so many of these. So you need them to be a good price then if you use hundreds? Absolutely. Right, okay. Yeah. Genuine question, have you found anywhere else that can actually sort of match the quality and the prices here at Jewelry Maker? No. And, and, and I'm, I'm a buyer from Jewelry Maker. Of I buy everything from Jewelry Maker. Yeah. I do. Yeah. You know, it, uh, and I'm not just saying that. You, nope. You've seen my name a million times. I'll come up. Yeah. You know, I'm, I'm forever. Nikki Merseyside. <laughs> Always. There she is. There's our girl. Yeah. 9.99. Goodness me. For your essentials. Yeah, well, this is the thing. Yeah. And it's often how people, um, you know, might get recommended. We don't do adverts no. or anything like that. We don't, people either stumble across us or they get recommended. Yeah. Um, and they realize, you know, that's one of our, I think, greatest strengths is not only the price, because that is important, of course it is, but it's the quality. But the quality, because there's no point in, you know, it's like <coughs> false economy then, isn't it? You can buy something like uh, that's, that's cheaper, but yeah. if, it doesn't, if it's not fit for purpose, then that's false economy. No, and I trust Jewelry Maker. Yeah. I know when I'm buying from Jewelry Maker that I'm going to get what I see. 100%. That's the thing. 100%. And, you know, if, if anything does arise that you're not happy with, we have the most amazing oh, customer centre team as well. Um, 9 99 well done, everybody. So, again, your essentials, you need them. You need them. Um, make sure you're checking out your baskets. Those incredible bills are coming up the other side of the break, jewelry makers. And also, um, also, you've got the most amazing masterclass at nine. Now, don't forget as well that beautiful meter length strand. Yeah, because there's much of it behind here as well. Mm -hmm. um, meter length strand of multi, uh, multicolored Amazonite. That's coming up as well. Um, and that parcel of aquamarine. Now, the Baroque Natural Pearls are going to be on pre-order in three, two, one. Oh. Okay, and these have had quite the reaction, everybody, throughout the course of the show. There are only 37 available for obvious reasons. Look, ignore the price, but let, can I also just say, before we duck out into a break, that's actually not a bad price if that's where we were staying. For that size, this quality, five virtues, one's already gone, well done. That's actually not a bad price. For pearls of this grade, they are on another level. They're not bleached, they're not dyed, that, would be, that we would expect. They're natural and we know the pearl world has changed almost overnight actually. You know, here's a gemstone that has over centuries been up there with the most popular. I can tell you again, three have gone, so well done. But what has happened over the past couple of months, we've never ever seen and likely won't ever see again. So um, to be able to bring it to you at 2,600 would be incredible if that's where we were staying. Don't go anywhere, we'll be back after this. <laughs>
Hi, it's Debbie Kershaw. I'm back with you on Friday the 23rd of February for a really, really exciting show. I'm going to be launching Delft Clay Casting. Now Delft Clay is a form, a refined form of sand casting and it's really, really exciting. So we're going to be using things like this, these and this to create things like this. So I hope you can join me on Friday the 23rd of February at Jewelry Maker. Hello everyone from a very, very wet and windy Whitney. It's horrible out there, so I'm glad we're in, in the warm making jewellery. So I'm here today to tell you all about my next show, which is going to be this Sunday, the 25th of February. I'm going to be joining Carol, Tom and the crew. And in front of me, I've just got three little things to show you. So do you remember those of you who watched my birthday show last week? I was given as a gift from Elle and team what is now going to be this Sunday's early bird, most amazing two-tier plastic caddy for all of your tools. So by Sunday, I'm going to be fully organised and everything will be nice and neat in this. So this is, this is eight o'clock, this is the early bird in the eight o'clock hour. Then at nine o'clock, I've got agate, most beautiful, beautiful agate. And the tutorial piece that you'll get the free PDF download for will be this beautiful necklace here, all made out of Pico stations. So this is going to be your PDF tutorial in the nine o'clock hour. We've got some beautiful, beautiful, colorful kits on. I think we needed in this green is the weather we're having. And then in the 12 o'clock hour, we've managed, I can't believe how we've done it, but we've managed to get more of the six millimeter rainbow selenite. So it's obviously going to all be about Kiss Cross. This is in the 12 o'clock, absolutely beautiful. And the tutorial, the PDF tutorial, is how to make, and we show you how to make all three different kinds, the beautiful crossover bracelets. And these are using the individual colors of the selenite. They've got green, blue, and this beautiful morganite pink. So this is in the 12 o'clock hour. This is the free tutorial via PDF. So that's gonna be a jam-packed show. So that's this Sunday, 25th of February, early bird toolbox, nine o'clock, we've got the most beautiful, beautiful agates, and at 12 o'clock, incredible selenite. And I'm not gonna tell you anything about the deal of the day, it's gonna be a surprise. So I'll see you all Sunday. Hello, my name is Rachel Norris and I'm so excited to be with you on Saturday the 24th of February for the most amazing show. I don't even know where to begin, there's so much um, going on. So in the 9am hour there is this amazing toolkit, it's multi toolkit, it's got everything in it, it's got swage blocks, doming punches, um, all sorts of um, and there's an anvil in there, all sorts of shapes and sizes and there's so much potential in this, in, in this sort of kit where you can actually, a kit of tools really, it's enormous uh, potential. So I've had fun because some things I've never used all before, so I've had fun experimenting really. And you can use it to make um, them to make tubes like these color lilies, um, and um, you can do sort of um, folding and impressions and bee caps like this autumn leaf necklace. Um, and there's goodness knows I've made starfish with it and um, also you can do a sort of almost like a fold forming technique um, with this sort of heart necklace with this pattern like that and so I'll be teaching you some of the techniques in that um, part of the show and also there's, there's tutorial booklets in there with them as well so um, and there's uh, so much as I say so much potential and do you know what? <laughs> As if anything could beat the nine o'clock hour, the 12 o'clock hour is up there because there's a launch of some some brand new sort of dapping, punching tools um, and you can make some fantastic effects with them. There's a set of feather um, tools which you can actually use to make um, feathers and, and sun rays and all sorts of wonderful um, patterns. And there's line punching tools, which you can use to make snowflakes and, and wonderful sort of dandelion firework explosions sort of type pieces. I really hope you can join me on Saturday 24th of February for the most fantastic uh, metalwork and tooling show. Um, I've really enjoyed uh, preparing for it and I hope you can tune in to watch.
it's opportunities like this that I am really grateful that we, I wouldn't own pills like this if it wasn't for jewelry maker. Fact, I'm never too proud to admit I wouldn't have the budget to, 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 to buy them. Um, but I'm also really grateful of the fact that jewelry maker keep us so up to speed on situations within the jewelry world because it is, like many I suppose, industries, it is quite clo close knit and unless you are sort of rubbing shoulders with the likes of Eddie Levion and the likes of, I don't know, uh, um, Cartier and all of those big design houses, then you're not necessarily going to know. And even beyond that, actually, you're not necessarily going to know how things change. And it can change overnight in a heartbeat. And I think now more so than ever, it has become, that story has become most apparent. Here at Jewelry Maker, little, little shopping channel in the middle of Britain, in the middle of Britain. But let's never lose sight of the quality that we actually produce and we actually offer and the opportunities which most of us would not be able to afford um, other than on this shopping channel. So we are bringing you the world of luxury here. There's no doubt about it. And I can only ever share my own personal experiences. Some of you know that I've worked in the industry since I was 20. So that's 25 years. And the first jewelers that I worked at um, used to sell big design names like uh, your Bulgari, your Piaget, your Cartier, all of those brands. And they were, as you can imagine, very expensive. Um, but they also had amazing pearls. They had nothing like this though. Absolutely nothing like this. And every single one of their pearl strands, necklaces, was a thousand pound or more. And I do mean more. More frequently close to the five figures than, it, than the low 1000s. Anyway, but things have changed and it's something that, I'll be honest, I would never have even thought about. COVID, how does that impact the jewelry and gemstone world? Well, in all honesty, it doesn't affect many gemstones. It won't affect your diamonds. It won't affect your sapphires. It won't affect gemstones which are sort of found in the earth effectively, because you can walk away from them and then come back, can't you? However, your gemstones of the sea, i.e. cultured pearls, your ammonites, um, your, not so much ammonite, sorry, that's a bad example, your uh, pow shell, those, your mother of pearl, they have had a big impact. And that's because the pearl farmers were not able to tend for those harvests. And it's estimated they lost a minimum of five seasons, five harvests of pearls. That might not sound that many, but that's multiple years impact, decades in actual fact. So you can walk away from many gemstones, but you can't really walk away from cultured pearls. And that's because they literally get returned to the sea, literally float away. Um, and you think, okay, so on the next harvest, they can start it all back up again and it's no problem, nobody's lost out. Might have to wait a little time for the pearls to, to mature. No, no, we have to wait for the mollusks to grow to an age, firstly, where they'll be able to house pearls of this size. And they're not gonna be your little junior mollusks, they're gonna be the big ones. So that's gonna be probably years to actually produce. Then you've got to specialize in actually the hybrid variety of mollusks that will be able to even produce this color. Because not every single mollusk will produce a purple pearl. Look at that purple. That's like, that's like amethyst purple. Not every single mo mollusk will be able to produce those strong, intense pistachio greens or those amazing metallic golds and silvers. That is a very rare hybrid variety. And you've got to remember if you've already bred some mollusks to have to be able to produce these colors, which you might have done pre-COVID, they've gone though, haven't they? So you've got to do it all again. Um, anyway, so you set out, think, okay, got to start that process all over again. We already know that the, the pearl market and what was estimated is going to be at least a decade behind. So the price, the supply of pearls goes down, the price skyrockets. But what we didn't envisage was the impact that influences. And to us here in the UK, I don't think we quite get social media into the same degree as they do in China. Um, but the impact that an, a Chinese influencer has on the world of pearls. You might think, think don't be daft, Elle. Well, China makes up 
How much of the world's population? A third. It's about that. A third of the world's yeah. population. It's crazy, that, isn't it? One Chinese influencer starts wearing pearls like this, starts blogging about pearls. One Chinese buyer, don't know who, buys the entire decade coming of Tahitian pearls. Then, don't know if it's the same one, another buyer gets all of the South Sea pearls. What do you think is happening to the price of those pearls moving? Not just salt water, all variety of pearls. Your fresh water. The days when we used to be able to bring you, it's obvious actually on our screens, but the days when we used to bring you pearls for a tenner, do you remember them? Do you remember those, 9 99 mm -hmm. Ringed potato pearls, used to see them all the time, didn't we, here at Jewelry Maker. Amazing, can't get them. Can't, we cannot get them. Because over in Hong Kong, which is happening probably in a few weeks, I think it is, can't be far away. My, yeah, I think it is, a couple of weeks time. Um, we already know, all the pearl traders have already said, you know, just set the stage, everybody, we are going to Hong Kong with all of our pearls, but they're already sold, just so you know. So we are not going for the first time in our almost 20 years as a partnership, we are going to Hong Kong, I say we like I'm going, I'm not, but team, the team is Jake and, and Dave and, and Toby and many of the other buyers, Steve probably and Sarah, anyway, they will go, but they won't buy any pills for the first time ever because the traders have said, yeah, we're going, but you can't buy them, sorry, they're already sold. It's just gonna be literally that exchange. Why? Here's that influencer that I was talking about. The power of influence, how Nini shook the Tahitian pearl market. Now again, she's an incredibly successful, uh, well, she's a celebrity, isn't she, in China. And just photographs like that, like that, go viral, I think is the term that we use. I'm not up to speed with social media myself, but go viral and all of a sudden Tahitian pearls now are the hottest gem in the world. No, sorry, let me rephrase that sentence. It was Tahitian pearls. Now it's all pearls, all pearls. So again, when we think about it, you've got the issue of supply, which there's no way that we can recover from that other than wait, we have to wait. You've got the issue of price, price has gone up. You've got another issue of demand. The world is going crazy. We've always loved them, I think, here in the West, but China really, like we've woken up to Jade, they've woken up to pearls. It's so much so, the AGTA, which by the way, when you're at Tucson, this is at Tucson just gone, AGTA is like the Oscars of Tucson. It's the one where you turn up and there's a red carpet. Um, it's very swanky, yeah. Um, you go through, you go through like securities and, and, and everything to get through there. It's it's you have to get a pass to go in. So it's quite a privilege to go into the AGTA. But they write updates afterwards. Check this out. This is on the back of the recent, um, the recent Tucson Gem Fair. Pearl updates. Prices are still climbing due to Chinese demand and limited production. That's literally it in a nutshell, isn't it? American pearl dealers are having a lot of difficult uh, conversations with clients this year. Since the beginning of 2023, Akoya shortages, price hikes, and Chinese demand have created a difficult buying scenario for US. Uh, um, you've got to remember this is the American Gem Trade Association. That's why they're referenced in the uh, US. Um, wholesalers and pearl uh, jewelry manufacturers. Reports from the June um, edition of the Hong Kong International Jewelry Show reveal uh, that Yanks can expect more um, of the same for the foreseeable future. So that's, we know this is happening. We know. Let's talk about that appetite, that insatiable appetite. And it's almost a case of like China saying, yes, you've loved your pearls, haven't you, for so many centuries. Now we want them because you're coming after our jade. It's like that, isn't it? It's, it's like we love jade now, we've woken up to that and they've woken up to our beauty, beautiful pearls. I say our, it's not necessarily our. Um, 
Like his peers, Yen faces sourcing difficulties and high prices because of the Chinese market. Many pearls uh, never leave Asia, he says. Clean, fresh water goods are being sold within China and farmers and manufacturers don't want to export, he says. Some of them are holding inventory and not even showing in Hong Kong. They're sold already. Um, I can't pronounce that. Israelis? Uh, blames Chinese social media uh, for lack of goods. Selection um, is way down since farmers are now selling on WeChat before sh uh, shows open. So they actually uh, do social media in a much more advanced way than we do. Um, they've got lots of different platforms. Uh, Japan Pace firm sees Chinese demand firsthand, particularly for white colors when he, uh, when he um, exhibits in Hong Kong. Strong demand in China has led to a notable increase in the price of uh, pills, regardless of their mother oyster species. What that basically means is whether it's uh, saltwater or freshwater. Another new development, Chinese buyers shopping uh, the US shows. We saw many more at JCK Las Vegas, Yen adds. This includes some wholesalers coming over to the US to source and sell back into Asia. So this has never happened before in the world of pearls and the price has not just gone up by a fraction, it has completely skyrocketed. There's a photograph that Dave showed and, and, and I thought he was brave holding it. He's literally holding a pearl necklace. I think they're South Sea pearls. Doesn't really matter though, does it now? At wholesale, that pearl necklace at, at Tucson Just was $800,000. A South Sea pearl. We've sold South Sea pearl necklaces on our sister channel for 50,000. We have, with the likes of Charlie Barron. 800,000. I can't even work out that increase. We have 37 available. So you've got to remember, these are rare hybrid pearls which were two years ago, three years ago, lost to the sea, effectively. The supply of these dramatically down. The demand so high, it's almost unfathomable. The price unobtainable for the majority. So the fact that jewelry maker are still able to bring you opportunities like this is an opportunity not to miss. I've said this so many times. The graphics will appear in 60 seconds, but I said this so many times, now more so than ever, I, bar I get involved in opportunities like this, not only because I love pearls, who doesn't, but because I feel duty bound. You know, my daughters are not gonna be able to afford pearls. Not now, never mind in 10 years time. You know, if things continue the way they are, we're not just talking about a 10%, 20%, 50% increase in, in, in price of pearls. We're talking hundreds of percent. I can't even work it out. Can't even work it out. These aren't just sort of your classic bleached white either. They're totally natural. Look at the gold at the top of the screen, top left. Look at that, that's natural. Absolute, the color abundance is unprecedented. The quality, unprecedented. The deal, ridiculous, frankly. I wish I had more. We used to be able to bring you pearl strands like this or versions of by, what, 50? 100 maybe? We can't do that anymore. Can you remember when we brought you big fibre pearls or before all this happened, they call it pearl mania, before all this happened, do you remember when we used to bring you 200 quantities of pearls like this and they'd all sell and they'd be on air at £299? I agree. Ross is saying, I remember. Listen, I can tell you, the purple pearls that I bought, gosh, I don't regret that purchase at all now. Goodness me. I bought, remember, those purple pearls that were spherical, do you remember? And I had to ask, I, I, I did ask my husband, I was like, look, I really, I'm in love with these pills, please can I buy them? I work too, so it's like I do say, no pay, no say, but I, it's a big amount of money anyway. Mm -hmm. And I bought them and they were hundreds, they were 799 pounds. It's a lot of money for me, a lot of money. Do you remember? And that was like the going rate, wasn't it? I remember a strand like this, with a box, and we had 200. Yeah, and they would be closer to four figures than they would the three. Now, 
That's why earlier on this morning, the reality is £2,499 is a fantastic price. Roscoe, you know that photograph of the purple pearls that we took in Tucson, Dave and I? So that was the year 2021, just post-COVID. The one on a necklace that's 1,200. Oh, we can show that, that works, that's fine. Let's do that, yeah, because it's almost very similar to yours. Two years ago, those pearls were 1,980 wholesale. So times that by four plus that, yeah? Two years ago. Let's, let's do that maths. That's what they would be in a jeweler's. 7,920 plus 17.5% if you can. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> let's just, all right, let's do it pre VAT. What did you say it was? It's about 10,000 pounds. That makes sense to me. That makes perfect sense. That's what that necklace would be. Retail. Because that's a wholesale price on that calculator. That's two years ago. Things have changed since then, massively changed, massively changed. Now, that's why Dave was holding a strand of beautiful pearls that was a, a crazy amount of money. 2,499 is incredible. Tell you what, let's go to the wholesale price, shall we? That's amazing. How many of us get the opportunity to source top quality pearls at wholesale price? That's basically what we are. We're doing right now, we're matching the wholesale price. In fact, I think they're better. I do think they're better. Here's the exchange between Salim, one of our, uh, one of our pearl buyers, and Dave, who said, ah, oh, took a photograph clearly when he was at Tucson, later uh, on, that's when a lot of the exchanges and pearl, uh, uh, sorry, not just pearl, gemstone purchases get made, are agreed in the lobbies, for example. Um, and it's, it's true, it's true. So lots of pearl exchanges or gemstone exchanges. Um, but he WhatsApp saying, great to meet you, same here. This lot, my friend, um, is sold, sorry. Such a shame. If you ever find more, please let me know. And it's almost like tumbleweed then, isn't it? Because, yeah, no answer. Look at the price, $2,500 per strand. Sorry for the entire lot, you have to buy it all. Or 4,000 if you buy them individually. That's why I say so passionately that 1,999 pounds was a fantastic price in comparison to a decade ago. Never mind what's going on now. Are you ready? These are so rich in their quality. This look, 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 looks like complete solid gold. There is only 37, or rather I should say was. Good luck. Big, beautiful, fireball pearls. Strong metallic. We are at 499 pounds, but you can see in this corner that there is also a purple clock telling us that we're going even lower. The reality is, Look, here we go, here's another photograph. Another, that's Dave, that is, pointing to that. It's a lovely necklace, absolutely gorgeous. $6,995 wholesale. This is all at wholesale. Do you know what I would be disappointed by there? The way they're displayed. Look at the quality of the pearls. Put them on busts. Put them on busts, my goodness me. No, you can't just have them thrown across the table. Goodness me. And they want $7,000 for it. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. We're at £499. And we're not stopping there. Every single one of these with an absolute abundance of amazing, amazing iridescence. Look at that. Look at the colours. See how they change? I can't believe we're doing this. 200, look at that. 249 pounds. You've got your four way split payment there as well, jewelry makers, they're absolutely incredible. The strength of the colors, again, remember your five virtues. I almost wanted to try and avoid going into your five virtues, but we'll skim over it. Size, we know the bigger the pearl, it's like a carrot weight in a diamond effectively. That was the one, Ross. Um, 
then uh, and then we start talking about shape of course that's really the eye of the beholder if you prefer your baroques your perfect rounds your drop your fireballs whichever it might be your buttons then we start talking about color well firstly these are natural totally and utterly natural which is really the pinnacle then we start talking about the nacre which is so important when it comes to your fireball and baroque pearls the thicker the nacre the more luster you get basically and luster is the most important of the five virtues because you can have a big pearl you can have a perfectly shaped pearl you can have a lovely colored pearl but if it hasn't got luster then it's just me basically these are so lustrous they look borderline metallic for uh, 249 pounds susan anna jane multi-buying virginia manchester multi-buying amazing florence you've got yours incredible i've got collectors on the phone lines as well uh carol in berkshire ian in merseyside ronda in hertfordshire cumbria nancy Teresa, and new customers i mean they are nothing short of breathtaking and the reality is we have never as Pearl enthusiast, which I'm gonna, I'm speak. Those of you that are watching this this auction opportunity, I'm gonna say is a pearl enthusiast, right? Um, we have never seen the industry change in such a dramatic way. Not just with pearls, with any gem. Never. I have 15 left, and that was not where we were closing, ever. We could, we could. These prices are unfathomable in comparison. Never mind what's outside going on outside these four walls. We didn't bring pearls like this when they were available, did we? At these prices, I mean. I can't believe them. I, I've, I've seen them on the TV before. I've seen you do them on the TV. I've never seen them face in to person. face in person before. And they are astonishing. They really are, aren't they? I can't believe that a living thing could create something so... It, it's emotional, a response I've got to it. It it's is, It's so yeah. beautiful. It's, it is. It's untrue. It, 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 thank you. Yeah, I totally, totally, totally agree with you. And I mean that completely sincerely. Yeah. I absolutely do. Uh, uh, Nikki, that's why you've certainly heard me say this so many times before. And it, I, can't, I won't be able to say this moving forward. Right now, this is our greatest strength here at Jewelry Maker. Yes. Right now, yeah. our ability to bring our audience the finest, most sought after pearls in the world at yeah. the most unbelievable price is our greatest strength. Never mind 499, never mind 249. Today, under 200 pounds, this is crazy. Uh, it, it, it's a full strap one of those pearls should be 199 pounds and that's a wholesale Absolutely. deal just one of them yeah that's how i saw them sold look let's go to bonhams go to bonhams everyone can check out bonhams uh, natural natural color apricot pearl it's not purple it's a bit of a weird shape anyway but okay yeah cool five thousand six hundred twenty-five dollars sold before Pearl Mania, can I just point out? So what would that be now? Before Pearl Mania, I don't, I generally don't know. I generally don't know. You know, that, that, that photograph of those purple pearls that I showed, I think it's just before this, Ross, yeah. That photograph was taken in Tucson in 2021. I was stood next to Dave at the time and I was like, that's a really good price, really good price. And I was talking wholesale, it was 1,200 and something, wasn't it? 250 so that's fantastic i actually thought the orange are charging then wholesale that would probably be about i don't know what do you reckon tens of thousands yeah. of pounds now that is the dem that is the impact that the chinese market has had on pearls do you want to know how many we have left out of the 37 we started with <laughs> nine this is a, these are once in a lifetime pearls. they are and you you know what they are you say that 199 pounds each put a peg on that put it on a chain and yes 199 pounds you could sell it easily and i know people say well i don't know whether my customers would pay that much have the confidence because that's how much they're worth yeah we don't to put it on a toad 100 percent. and also what you're going to remember you might be thinking that's a lot of money yeah but they they are a lot of money yeah. though that's the reality you try how much it would cost you to replace don't use our pricing as a as a guide because we're all manners are wrong on our pricing right now so low look 
how much would it cost you to replace one of those yeah. pearls? It would cost you, if you were to go to a gem fair, if you were to go to Tucson, never mind the flight and all that, yeah. but if you were to go there, it would cost you more. In fact, you won't be able to get it. It's irreplaceable because the pearl traders, harvests, have said it's already sold. Yeah, we'll be there. Yeah. And we can have a conversation, but you're not going to be able to buy any pearls. And if you if you educate your customers the way we receive about it, yeah. education from you guys in jewelry maker, if you educate your customers and tell them about the worth, tell them about the value, tell them about things Absolutely. that are happening, they will pay that 100%. kind of money. 100%. But you know what? It's more than that. For me, I would think more about just owning them. Same, same here. I couldn't part with these. They're not the kind of pearls that I could personally part with. I totally agree because they're, they're hypnotically yeah, beautiful, aren't they? Are. they? They're, they're just the array of colours that you see across them. I totally, totally agree with you. It's not. There are some things, yeah, okay, look, it's about making money, yeah. especially if you are a jeweler, uh, jewellery maker to, that has a business. But there are some, it's just a case of, wow, that's something I couldn't part yeah. with. They're so incredibly beautiful. I've got just four of these left within the vault. And the fact that you can get them home for £49.75, and pence, it's insane. And, mm -hmm. and, and, and again, you know, we saw the price of diamonds skyrocket. Do you remember when the price of gold went through the roof and silver went through the roof? You can manipulate that. You know, we can work with that. They're not running out of gold. They're not running out of silver. They're not running out of diamonds even. You can still access them is the point if, you, if you've got the budget for it. However, regardless of your budget, we can't get the pearls. No. Like Charlie Barron, we all know Charlie, don't we? He is a sixth generational pearl farmer. And I'm gonna say it as it is, lovely chap, very wealthy. Yeah. Very successful, very wealthy family, yeah? He, sixth generation pearl farmer. This is heartbreaking though. He's no longer no. doing pearls. He's had to diversify because of everything that's gone on. He's now, if you go onto his Instagram page, it's diamonds, it's emeralds, it's rubies. Yeah. It's those gemstones, it's not pearls because he can't get them. We'd have had Charlie on our show with open arms, wouldn't we? He hasn't got, the, he hasn't got them. The final two opportunities at £199, Buckinghamshire, Virginia. I've got one left. Who's going to get that last one? I will if you don't, 100%. That's incredible. Truly, truly incredible. Um, stay where you are on those phone lines, everybody. I've got that one metre long length strand of Amazonite. night. Um, but before I do, hello, Gloria. Um, hi, Elle. I have lots of pearls from you, including this strand. Well done. Um, I've had some fabulous valuations on them. Love every strand. Well done, Gloria. Uh, yeah, well done. And this is the thing, Gloria. I've said this sentence about many a different gemstone out there. And I, I, I wouldn't say if I truly, truly, on, hand on heart, didn't believe it. We are never going to regret those purchases, aren't we? No. Never. Let's be honest. I've got, I've got clothes in my wardrobe that never seen the light of day. I regret buying them. I've got a pair. I of, will never regret. I've got a pair of running shoes that I bought a few weeks ago that cost the same price as those. Yeah. They'll last me six months. Yeah, exactly. You'll get enjoyment out of them. Yeah, not but as there's much as a, I get out of those for my whole life. Yeah, absolutely. I totally agree. I don't. I never think we're going to regret purchases no. like this, especially with everything that's going. It's it's the fact that we can do it. That's yeah. the real. That's what's. Do you know? Take this as I mean, but. I don't really care how, how, how we're about influencers. I don't really care. What I do care about is being able to buy those beautiful gemstones and buy some, buy them affordably. Yeah. So amazing. Well done, everybody. Congratulations to each and every single one of you. Truly, truly, truly beautiful. Now, oh, back to another heartbeat gemstone here at Jewelry Maker, and that is your. Um, I know. How many of us are having that? Oh no, it's Sunday evening. Gotta go to bed. That generation, do you remember? Yeah. Heartbeat used to be that signal that you need. Off yeah. you go. Up to bed now. School in the morning. <laughs> yeah. No, but it is a heartbeat gemstone, isn't it, for us here at Jewelry Maker? Amazonite. But it's a metre long length strand. Yeah. So. <laughs> Adam singing away. I love that. Um, he does a lot of do, 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 and shoe ops, does our Adam. <laughs> now, <laughs> if you think about many gemstone diamonds, sapphires, um, mm, jaspers, 
Beryls, for example, like uh, um, aquamarine, you get different shades of that. I mean, I could go on. Anyway, my point is there's different palettes of many different gemstones. And, you know, when we describe Amazonite, most of us would go, like, like the parcel that we had earlier on, it's that tropical blue colour. But actually, Amazonite comes in a few different shades, and they're all equally as beautiful. Um, so, let me just get my white piece of paper. This meter long length strand which is brand new includes the warm sunshine tones it includes those beautiful tropical bluey greens it includes some of the soft almost nude colors within and it includes as well colorless amazonite remember it's a member of the feldspar family but amazonite is not just your sort of more traditional turquoisey blue that gemstone, the Bridge of Hope. Now, we have been saying over, uh, well, many weeks actually, probably even months, we think Amma's Night is going to be the next big gem. Uh, Ross is saying, I've done a little bit of research to back up this statement. Have you? I'm, I'm intrigued, Ross. Have you been doing this whilst, uh, whilst I've been talking pearls? He says, oh, I'm always working <laughs> me. Okay, amazing. So he's done a little bit of research on this. It's all very new to me. I'm finding it out with you. He said, look what I found. Yeah, look what we've got right now. And now he says, look at this. Oh, in Harrods. Ooh. For £290, a few jump rings in there. I see, look, Nikki. I like it. It's called Amma's Night Tucson Bracelet. It's sold at Harrods for 290 pounds with silver mm. do you reckon harrods know something that we don't the, the look at the colors they've got though they've got the turquoise blues the sunshine yellows the nude tones as well the warmer more chocolatey like colors it is exactly the same palette roscoe look at you and their tiny little heshies and also, let's not forget, that'll be probably, what do you reckon, six inches? Probably less than that, five inches maybe, because you've got spacer beads, oh sorry, jump rings, and you've got the Solomon's bar, haven't you? So I reckon there's probably about five inches, would you reckon, Nikki? Yeah, about that. I've got a full meter. So you can make a version of that bracelet multiple times over. Easy. Okay, maybe Harrods do know something that we don't, Roscoe. You might be on to something. And by the way, on the Harrods website, <laughs> somewhere that, you know, how many of us frequent on the Harrods website? I'm never off it. <laughs> <laughs> multi buying galore on Harrods website. Oh, they didn't have the blue that we had earlier on. No, I no. agree. I totally agree. I don't know who would. <sighs> We've got a hundred of this meeting <clears throat> on length strand. That's the only Amazonite Night piece of jewelry that we could find at Harrods. I love the fact that you were looking on Harrods yeah, website. I do. To be honest, Roscoe. Doing your weekly shop, is it? Lovely. Getting it delivered. Very nice. <laughs> um, Isn't this natural. Mark Smith's favourite gemstone? I'm sure it I was is. Not. It is, it yeah. is, yeah. Oh, and actually, speaking of lovely, Mark, wouldn't this be amazing to kiss cross? Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, and a me too could do a Marla straight away. Yeah. Straight away. Now. 270 carats, totally natural. So the full palette of your uh, beautiful uh, um, Amazonite. And again, it brings, you know, we think about the more frequently seen tropical color, you know, what we picture Amazonite to be. And I'm not talking about the parcel we just had earlier because that was exemplary. Um, but when we talk, think about the usual, these kind of colors that we see with your, with your Amazonite, little did we know that it actually still comes in your sunshine yellows and it looks a lot more soft on your tv screens right now mm -hmm. it's actually quite a, an intense color oh there we go yeah, there we go it's it. being modeled at harrods there it is oh it is tiny the color is comparable though well hang on a minute that looks like a chap doesn't it is it a lady beg your pardon very sorry um <laughs> I don't know, it doesn't really matter. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Right. That's five wraparounds, but you've got to remember that's full wraparounds yeah. as opposed to being what the five inches, five inches yeah. we estimate. But you can see the colours. 
Now, the lowest price that we did, different mine, different locations, but again, Monica Veneda touched on that earlier on, didn't she? She said it can be sourced in different locations. Um, but again, it's the pallets that you get. Different locations, bigger quantity. And this is the thing. If you can get bigger quantity, we have that leeway. We discussed this, didn't we? Got that little uh, little bit of sway. Okay, well, listen, if we buy this much, how much? And, and you saw it with the pearl examples there. If you buy the whole box, it's this price. If you buy one, it's this price. And there was a big difference, wasn't there? So we pass on those savings to you. A full metre long length strand, six millimetres in their size. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Ross, that's way lower than I was expecting. Mm, me too. I agree. I do think 2024 stroke 2025 is going to be big years for Amazonite. Well, you know, we were saying before about this sort of wilderness, which is huge. Yes. It's everywhere at the moment. And this kind of boho thing. That is the exact palette. That right there. Yeah. That strand. And if ever there was a palette that would cover all sort of gender identities yeah there it is there yeah totally yeah. i totally wholeheartedly agree yeah it complements everybody doesn't absolutely. it absolutely absolutely yeah. everybody minute clock on your screens we've got quantity and this is the thing we're often i'm often asked the question i'm often asked the question we're not stopping here how do it go oh, you've got that 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 uh, um, devil's advocate almost on your on your shoulder and I get it all the time as well but you, know, you kind of think oh it's too good to be true so usually no that's that can't be right that can't be right here at jewelry maker it is right it is. I promise you and let me explain how and this is how we always say we don't buy the same as your as that wh whoever uh, mayor is it mayor um, we don't buy in the same way they do we don't buy in the same way that Tiffany's do or or, or Monica Veneda we will buy big quantities and bigger you might be thinking no surely not bigger quantities than Monica Veneda yeah we do the Bennett's are, are one of the biggest gemstone buyers in the world in the world you're buying a meter right now whereas Monica Veneda each piece has got one cabochon so do you see the difference so we can negotiate on your price and if we get a great price you get a great price we also don't listen to what goes on in the market. Those pearls, prime example. We could have held those at thousands of pounds. We could have done. We, we'll, we'll talk about it, of course. But we don't, we don't elevate our prices just because so-and-so um, in the USA or so-and-so in China. We don't do that. We bring them to you as, as great deals because that has always been, you know, the ethos of the company. £14.99 only. It's not just a 38 centimetre strand. Um, it's a full metre. A full metre. So it's crying out for, now you've said it, Nikki, I've got that in my head, that boho chic, beautiful, is. you know, vibe. Oh, I love them. And do you know what? I'm looking at it as well. You could, if you wanted to, take the strand apart. You could make so many matched pairs out of that. Yeah. You've got... I can't even begin to imagine how many pairs of earrings you could make out of it, but you could fill a market store. Yeah. And you could, if you multi-bought this, and already at the price, it's, it's ridiculous. If you <laughs> multi-bought this strand and you got a few of them, you would fill a market store and you would sell it all because yeah. it's gorgeous and it's so now. That, that palette is so now. Well, you said earlier on, didn't you, you know some of your fastest sellers are Amazonite. Absolutely, they are because it's the it's that kind of colour scheme that appeals yeah. to everybody. It's universal. Yeah, it's brilliant. And I understand why. I, I do. I, I love totally it. Totally understand why. You know, everybody. It, it, it is one of those beautiful palettes. It's comforting, yeah. I think, in many many ways. Fourteen ninety nine. Not a thirty eight centimetre strand jewelry makers a full metre, so you can make masses. As Nikki was just saying, Rachel, Anne, Jennifer, Tina, Susan. Hello to you, Merseyside, Nancy, Rita, Tracy, uh, Patricia. New customers: Bedford, Susan, Frida, Linda, Yorkshire, Valerie, Barbara. Hello to you, Sheila and Torvine. Hello to you, Linda, Mary and Jerry, Marion, Cheryl, Maker in Kent. Make sure you're checking out your baskets, everyone. We had 100, but there's a load of you still in the process of actually going through your confirmations. Yeah, well, we shall see, won't we? I mean, I'm, we haven't got a crystal ball. Not even Ross has got a crystal ball. Um, however, <coughs> he is, he says he is very wise. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, but no, it, it makes sense though, doesn't it? That this is gonna be the gemstone uh, of <coughs> 2024, 2023, yeah. uh, 2025. 
not going back in time. <laughs> uh, it does make sense because it's yeah. beautiful. It's gorgeous. I would wear it. I, I do wear it. I love it. I love pastels. Yeah. I love pastel colours. I just think they're absolutely, you know, pastels, I would love my whole house to be in yeah. a pastel colour. They're so soothing, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, it is. It, it always reminds me of like a like a spa or a sanctuary yeah. or something like that. Yeah. Just really relaxing colours. Because yeah. there's nothing too demanding on your senses. Yeah. Everything's just calm. Oh, that's a lovely way of putting it. it. You know. Yeah. Those, I'm, I'm just looking at them. I'm, they just give me summer maxi dress, big sunglasses totally. vibes. Round, round the totally. neck. Totally. Gorgeous. Oh, we're going to be there soon enough, yep. aren't we? We'll be there soon enough. Lots of you getting involved. Look at this amazing 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 now i'll leave it with you we had a hundred and as you can see they're flying out the door so congratulations congratulations also on those amazing pearls they're incredible um yeah i love that do you know who is a barrage on the senses ross um <laughs> Wayne definitely, <laughs> definitely, <laughs> definitely Wayne. There's, there, he couldn't even deny that, <laughs> could he? He couldn't even argue it. Bless. Coming up after the break, jewelry makers. We love him though. We still love him. Um, your amazing creations in the Wall of Fame, of course. Wonderful Nikki and her beautiful projects. I can't wait to show you the jewelry because these are stunning, Nikki. And I feel like they're a little bit of you as well. They are very much. Very, bit, very you. Yeah. So I'm excited. Don't go anywhere. We'll be back after this. <laughs> Hi, it's Debbie Kershaw. I'm back with you on Friday the 23rd of February for a really, really exciting show. I'm going to be launching Delft Clay Casting. Now Delft Clay is a form, a refined form of sand casting and it's really, really exciting. So we're going to be using things like this, these and this to create things like this. So I hope you can join me on Friday the 23rd of February at Jewelry Maker. from a very, very wet and windy Whitney. It's horrible out there, so I'm glad we're in, in the warm, making jewellery. So I'm here today to tell you all about my next show, which is going to be this Sunday, the 25th of February. I'm going to be joining Carol, Tom and the crew, and in front of me, I've just got three little things to show you. So do you remember those of you who watched my birthday show last week? I was given as a gift from Elle and team what is now going to be this Sunday's early bird, most amazing two-tier plastic caddy for all of your tools. So by Sunday, I'm gonna be fully organized and everything will be nice and neat in this. So this is this is eight o'clock, this is the early bird in the eight o'clock hour. Then at nine o'clock, I've got agate, most beautiful, beautiful agate. And the tutorial piece that you'll get the free PDF download for will be this beautiful necklace here, all made out of Pico stations. So this is going to be your PDF tutorial in the nine o'clock hour. We've got some beautiful, beautiful, colourful kits on. I think we needed in this very miserable weather we're having. And then in the 12 o'clock hour, we've managed, I can't believe how we've done it, but we've managed to get more of the six millimetre rainbow selenite. So it's obviously going to all be about Kiss Cross. This is in the 12 o'clock, absolutely beautiful. And the tutorial, the PDF tutorial, is how to make, and we show you how to make all three different kinds, these beautiful crossover bracelets. And these are using the individual colours of the selenite. We've got green, blue, and this beautiful morganite pink. So this is in the 12 o'clock hour. This is the free tutorial via PDF. So that's going to be a jam-packed show. So that's this Sunday, 25th of February, early bird toolbox, nine o'clock, we've got the most beautiful, beautiful agates, and at 12 o'clock, incredible selenite and I'm not going to tell you anything about the deal of the day it's going to be a surprise so I'll see you all Sunday
Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Welcome back, everybody. I can't believe where's time gone today. Noah. I completely lost track. It's the gemstones. It's all those gemstones, honestly. Yeah. I've had a spellbound. Oh, and I tell you what, I can't wait to show everybody your jewellery as well. Nikki, this is stunning. Oh. Absolutely stunning. Do you know what the thing is about this, though? Is that everything wow. that I've made, a beginner could make. You know, they could literally pick up some pliers today and start making them and have them finished by the end of the day. It's beautiful. But often, though, some of the most commercial head-turning jewellery is actually relatively simple techniques, yeah. but just executed well. Yeah, and I like to kind of demystify jewellery making because I think sometimes it can feel a bit intimidating. Yeah, totally, yeah. Um, and you look and you think, oh, I'm never going to be able to make all these complicated things. Mm. Well... Every single thing that I made here was, well, I mean, the thing that I'm going to show you is made using one skill. Wow, okay. Just one. Just repetition then. Yeah. But uh, on that, what you just said then, I mean, I come from a jewellery background, obviously, but even the transition from jewellery retail to jewellery maker, yeah. it's like another language. Yes. Because I remember starting here back in, what, 2011, I started here at Jewellery Maker, and I've you know, I'd worked in jewellery and gemstones for many years, but I did not know what a gizmo was. <laughs> I did not know what a wrap loop was. Yeah. I didn't know what, what, what the term for jump rings, I didn't know what a wire yeah. guardian was. It is very much a new is, language that you have to learn. So I agree with you. It can be quite intimidating, but demystifying is perfect. Yeah. Anyway, now you've got one, two, three, four, five amazing kits. Are they available on pre-order, Roscoe? Have a little look on the website. Um, shop ahead because they're absolutely stunning. They are. But first, speaking of stunning, do you want to start us off? I'd love with to. the Wall of Fame. <gasps> look at well, this. Well, how, how appropriate. How incredibly appropriate. This, oh, I love this incredible Marla. And it is from Elizabeth Sellers, number 807. Wow. And she says, hi, everyone at JM. Hope you are all well. Here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's a Marla necklace made from a kit from JM I bought a while ago. I bought one of them too. Actually, Elizabeth haven't made it yet, but I will. I just added the seed beads of spacers and bead caps and Buddha heads all from JM. Hope you like it. It's fabulous, isn't it? Good luck to everyone. Fingers crossed for a win. Sending love and big hugs to everyone. Elizabeth. Oh, Aww, that's absolutely you, Elizabeth. beautiful, Elizabeth. Gorgeous. Um, again, I've got amazing creation here from uh, Sue Thursfield. Hello, Sue. This is beautiful. And Sue says, um, hi, all. Here is my entry to the Wall of Fame. Um, it's a set made from white Baroque cultured pearls, metallic grey drops uh, from a kit and hematite spaces, all from Jewelry Maker, of course, and over a period of time. I hope you like them. The drops have been in my stash for a while, as I forgot the design uh, on the lovely demo. So, like many others, I'm sure, I'm pleased to see the instructions uh, now available to download. Many thanks and good luck to all. Well, Sue, that's pretty much why we started doing them actually yeah. apparently it was feedback to uh, <clears throat> to the jewelry maker team that especially newer customers once they got the kit back people forgot what they were doing with mm -hmm. them so um, it's like a little reminder of course yeah. you can watch us back on YouTube as well but um, yeah if you don't if you don't go on to YouTube and places like that so I do get it but it's yeah. fantastic isn't it yeah and I think also is some people and I'm one of those people I like to do something with something in front of me yeah instead of just watching someone I like some step-by-step -step instructions yeah I'm a same. bit of a B&Q girl a bit of an Ikea girl yeah I like a set of instructions a bit of a screwdriver and then off I go yeah it's, it, if it's too much if it's if you have to work 
out finding it. If I have to go to, right, what date was it? If I need yeah. to, okay, what time was that? Yeah, I see yeah, what you mean. I'm lost. So, yeah, same, I probably disconnected my brain. So <laughs> I, I do hear where you're coming from. So number 809, this is Lisa Anderson. And Lisa said, oh, wow. hi, here is my entry to the Wall of Fame. It's a demo I stumbled across from a few years ago by Alison. It's a crawl star with a mm -hmm. beveled rivoli, all components from JM over the years. Love the outcome. Yeah, it's fabulous, isn't it? And we'll be making more. Thanks for all you do and good luck, everyone. Oh, thank you, Lisa. Yeah, that's absolutely beautiful, Lisa. Incredible. Loving that. Um, oh, some lovely earrings oh, wow. here. And this is coming from Alan Hopkins. Hello to you, Alan. Uh, you're number 810. Hi, please fi find my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. I got the 925 Sterling Silver Snap Set earrings from you and I've set a pair of Imperial Garnets, wow, wow. and Groschula Garnets I got when Jake used to do his gem guides. Please, can we have him back again? Good luck, everybody. Great shows and demos. Alan, I would love that. I would absolutely love that. I know he's a very 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 busy person is our jakes yeah. of course he's now managing gemporia next door so you, but i i will sow that seed because i definitely be game for that as well yeah. he did one show not so long ago didn't he ross do you remember um we were in the old studio though weren't we was he in here no i think it was the old studio with a pearl wasn't it he launched the faster but i can't remember anyway but i would love that so I, I, i'll we'll mention it shall we that'd be good wouldn't it um over to you so number 811 I'm trying to work this out I'm kim hopkins hi please find my entry to this week's waff i bought several packs of wow. the trays you had on recently which i've used to dress my jewelry drawer I had to cut some to make the best use of them but i'm pleased with the result it's so luxurious how clever Good luck to everyone entering. Loving the shows and project instructions. Stay safe, everyone. Wow. Oh. Kim, that's amazing. I love that. That's brilliant. So what have you customised? I've got to see. I bought oh. these as well, actually, but I, I wouldn't have thought in a million years to sort of customise them. That's see, so I have a jewellery drawer like that as well, but look how mine's nowhere near as organised as yours, Kim. That's amazing. Fabulous. Ah, incredible. Loving that. Well, well done, everybody. Keep those entries coming in. You've got, um, yeah, all, every day we will show your designs. Drop us a message. The only stipulation, of course, is that they are jewellery maker products. Now on to Nikki's amazing masterclass. Simply stunning. I mean, this is incredible. Absolutely mm -hmm. incredible. And do you know what I love, Nikki, is I can imagine you wearing each and every single one of yeah, these pieces. Yeah, I would too. I would. They are all a bit of me. I, I really, when I got them, I was so pleased um, because they're very, very much like the kind of thing wow. that I would wear. And you get masses in them too. Yep. Now, um, if you look at the website, you can choose uh, Shop Ahead if you're uh, selecting your gemstones. But just to give you a heads up, it's basically the gemstone choice. So you've got Carnelian, Amethyst, Amazonite, Rose Quartz and Labradorite. So shall we start with a gem that we rarely ever see, Carnelian? Yes, which I love. Me too. There's Absolutely just a warmth love. to it, isn't it? Yeah. Um, now we've got 50 available. And I was asked earlier on, what's the length of the strands? So let's figure oh, yeah. this out. Let's figure this out. Bye. Because uh, they are generous. Yeah, Very they are. Very Oh, hang on. This is a good job that this is a studio sample because I've just taken one of the beads off there. So 30. Wow. You've got about 60 centimetres. Six, they're yeah. 60, yeah, 60 centimetres um, on each of those strands. Uh-oh. They're certainly <laughs> enough. I, I'll say the one that I used nearly all, apart from the arms and I, was the oh, rose beautiful. Quartz, and that is actually... Can I show that? Yeah, Because you, you also get these amazing connectors. Now, that's in the rose quartz there, but look, the gemstone connect, that's amazing, Nikki. Yeah. It's so simple, and just with some eight O's in between, that's all. Yeah, but that's beautiful, isn't it? Oh, it's fab It's a fabulous piece of jewellery. It really is. So you get the two connectors, which are triple drilled. Does that make sense? Yeah, tri triple drill drilled. <laughs> that's not it's like a mouthful, isn't it? Yeah. And they're made out of the gemstone that the corresponding beads are. So they are so beautiful. And I wanted to show lots of different ways of using them. Obviously, the classic way would be to use them as a spacer bar. I 
think they'd look amazing with pearls. Yeah, absolutely. Oh yeah, beautiful. Now, 60 centimeters. Sorry, what was that, Russ? You get your cord. Yes. Complementing colors. Yes. You get your multi-row clasp. You, you get the two connectors. You do. Or multi-row gems. Yep. Um, what did you say? We've got quantity. 50 available. First price crash. Oh. First. That's amazing. I thought they'd be way more than that. I genuinely thought they'd be way more than that. Yeah, I was thinking at least 35. So that, that's a pair of earrings I made out of them. Yeah. They're the carnelian ones. Well, they're beautiful. So you Absolutely can see beautiful. you can use them for lots of other things. They're, they're not just space bars. You can use them in so many ways. But I, I just wanted to create a massive pair of earrings. Yeah, they're fabulous. Carnelian. Red carpet yeah, earrings, absolutely are. fabulous. Yeah. Um, those gemstone triple row connectors, I mean, there's lots of different ways you can describe those, yeah. aren't they? But they're, yeah. they're epic. And you get the multi-row class there as well. 60 centimetre strand and, of course, your cord. Don't forget that. Um, sorry, I just thought it's I was right. stepping on something. You'll also that, get the instruction kit, which I made yes. the... Um, connect the necklace with which is the one with all of the gemstones in it that you'll use on your strands so you'll you'll have this beautiful dangly gemstone necklace if you want but i will be putting tutorials as well on my uh, jm guest designer page for all Aww. the other things i've made oh aren't you fabulous 19.99 you get this with your free with your purchase of any of the projects whichever the gem you choose wow that's amazing 14 pounds and 99 pence only to get buy hold of this them. buy them yeah i would pay that for just those Honestly. two yeah for the i'd pay that for the two carnelian bars yeah. effectively i'd pay 14.99 for that box class yep you know i'd pay 14.99 for the 60 centimeter strand oh uh, i mean and so carnelian you don't see very often and it is gorgeous carnelian as well yeah this is not you know nasty sort of gritty bits of carnelian this is beautiful yeah glossy, it's got a really deep glowing. red color yeah. isn't it it's that's gorgeous. the thing it's it's one of those gemstones you just feel comforted by it's like a cuddle yeah. and anybody it? who's into um crystal healing and gemstone energy carnelian is a hugely important gemstone it's great for comforting it's mm -hmm. great for anybody who's experienced loss if you believe in yeah. crystal healing and absolute energy but it has even if you don't believe in all that it, it just has a lovely tactile feel to it anyway it's a beautiful gemstone and it's lovely to have mm -hmm. it is we, we had we did a relaunch nikki on uh with carnelian um how long ago was that maybe ross six months maybe um yeah within the last six months because we hadn't seen it no, we, uh, we hadn't seen it in absolutely ages um and funny enough we spoke about that the metaphysical side of carnelian and, and the history of yeah, it it huge. dates way back doesn't yeah. it um 14.99 these are absolutely flying everybody lots oh. the love of this gemstone and you know what you might be thinking i i don't necessarily have a seasonal jewelry do you know what i mean yeah. i don't necessarily go all oh, right okay my amazonite is for summer and my carnelian's for winter i would wear that red all year round regardless yeah, all year round because it's warmth then isn't yeah, it absolutely it's like the heat of the sun amazing we had 50 well done geraldine hello to you nottinghamshire multi-buying i've got anne gail claire susan georgina it's actually on the verge of selling out this one i would um, encourage you if you've never made jewelry before buy one or all if you can of these kits yeah absolutely incredible so much with them absolutely well done uh, we had 50 of them and I think we've got the same quantities across all of them or there are there about so um, shop ahead on the others do shop ahead on the other ones um, your masterclass demonstration is coming your way jewelry makers so um, and any questions that you have for lovely Nikki then do feel free um, do feel free to text in sorry um that comes with the box glass the two gemstone connectors the cord as well and of course that 60 centimeter strand so amazing 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 um i'm back she's back in the room um now that kit was the only kit what treated okay which we should really expect from yep. carnelian so the rest i've got four more projects all of which are natural that rose quartz is natural. Honestly. Labradorite natural, amazonite natural, amethyst natural. And it's tip top as well. It really is. But 
price pledge. Natural, 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 natural. Mm -hmm. Price pledge, all under £20. <laughs> so you can shop ahead. I'm going to bring you the rose quartz now, which can I just show this yeah. bracelet? That's absolutely beautiful. I would wear this. I, I would. I love this bracelet. That's stunning. Rose quartz, unconditional love, friendship. Yep. Love all those things. And it was so easy to make. It was honestly, it was just threading on some. I use, um, we've got it on the JM page, uh, Ilonga yeah. thread I used for that. Just just sit there threading it on. They've got lovely big drill holes in them. I used eight hose in between. Little Pretty. knot, little dab of glue. That Pretty. It. That's all it takes. It's beautiful. It's such a strong. That's why I was surprised by the fact that these are natural because the strength of the colour is absolutely amazing, yeah. isn't it? I tell you what's gorgeous as well is this sort of tiger tail that comes with. Yeah. Them. It's with the rose quartz. It's a really bright pink. Yeah. Um, and I'm, I didn't use it because I made the bracelet. But I'm at home. I'm in the middle of making a hairband. Yeah. With the rest of the rose quartz and this um, tiger tail bead and thread. So when I'm finished. I'll put it on my page and you can see, but at the moment it's making a beautiful hairband. Well, look at the quality of the colour, even on the longer. So it's not like the cord yep. is enhancing the rose quartz. Nope. You can see that perfect like Japanese blossom yes. pink, can't you? Yeah. Amazing. Full 60 centimetre strand, once again, jewellery makers, so as not to confuse. So 60 centimetres, plus you've got those two um, triple row gemstone bars. You've got the box class and you've got that reel. It's a big strand, it's natural. That's, pr that's gorgeous. You know, if you ever to ask me like, Elle, what's textbook rose quartz? Uh, that. Yeah. That's it, yeah, basically textbook. It's like Japanese blossom, basically. I kept looking to see if it had been treated or if it was something other than rose quartz that you were just sort of calling it rose quartz style because it's so pink. Because quite often you'll get rose quartz, not from JM, I should yeah. say. But if you get rose quartz from anywhere else and you get it home and it's, it's washed out it's often yeah. because it's on pink thread yeah and then it the color yeah, itself yeah. is washed out not this not the case here under 20 pounds jewelry makers again i pay that for the box clasp i pay that for the gem uh, uh, the multi-row gem connectors i yeah. think they're absolutely amazing i pay that for the 60 centimeter strand incredible totally and utterly natural and always one of those gemstones that whenever it's brought to wear everyone loves it oh, don't it's they it's beautiful because it's just so soft and romantic and gorgeous isn't it yeah it is it is romantic's a nice description yeah. feminine beautiful yeah. it, it, it is like that quintessential english rose isn't it, it? Is. that lovely pink yeah it is it's, it's gorgeous and it's lovely to work with it feels lovely to yeah. work with honestly. amazing well done everybody 19 pounds and 99 pence again lots we got 50 of this one as well did you say 50 of this one nottinghamshire brenda susan maker in london jackie mavis devon and Ma uh, mary uh, ali lorraine mary and jerry bernadette and judith adri kate so many of you getting involved and they'd work together as well i'm just thinking the rose quartz would be lovely with the amazonite absolutely and i was just thinking then i was thinking because i made the necklace in the amazonite because it had lots of different colors in it but i was just thinking then how gorgeous it would be in the rose quartz and then i thought oh, it'd be lovely in the amethyst as well the necklace really does show them all off um, and that's the one that you get the instructions And it with. comes with the instructions, yeah. yeah. And it's so easy. It's so, in fact, you know, we must never lose sight of the fact these are a lot of work. You know, uh, they do, they, it's, it's a lot of work for our designers and, you know, just little things like the photographs and, and, yeah. and right, you need this, you need this, you need this. So, I mean, that in itself, I think it's, is, 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 is worth worth a price tag yeah. for sure it's free with your project jewelry makers amazing now we have price pledged each and every single one of those pl uh, of these projects nikki's projects under 20 pounds but we don't like all look under 20 can mean 19.99 sometimes we might squeeze those boundaries just a little bit we're gonna do it wow let's go even lower no clock, we're strapped for time, so we're just going to go down. Natural. Glowing. Glowing. 14 .99. I can get the two kits for £30 today. Yeah. And they are 60 centimetre They're strands, huge. not 38. And there's so much you can do with them. I mean, I made a pair of earrings out of these. Oh, yeah. You know. The, the oh, so I easy. love that. You see it with the um, uh, with the labradorite just there. Yep. Here we go. That's so cool. No skills involved other than being yes, able there to is. have a hammer. There's a huge <laughs> skill in there. Actually, having you know, visualising it. 
I guess so. But, you know, I just, I want to make jewellery. So you'll see on my um, instructions, I want to make jewellery that a beginner can do. Or that somebody just thinks, oh, you know what, I don't feel like doing anything that demands a load of energy and stress. I just want to do something easy. Yeah. It's going to be nice. At the end of the day, jewellery making should be enjoyable, yes. shouldn't it? So, should. yeah, it should be. So isn't that ultimately why? So they take why? 10 minutes. Oh, there you go. That's why most of us actually start making jewellery is, is because, yes, we want to wear the jewellery, but also it, it, it's, a, it, it's an escape, isn't it? Absolutely. Um, amazing. Right. Uh, Nikki, what are you going to show us? That literally the skill that you need to make the necklace with. And it is basically a wrap loop. Now, a wrap loop is the cornerstone of most jewelry. Um, and certainly with the necklace that I've made, it's the one and only skill that you will need. And I'll show you why. It's because in between nearly all of the gemstones, there's what looks like, I think Elle and I were mentioning it before, what looks like a little charm, mm. looks like a little bell. It is, Ah. let me push this out of the way, it is that. Lovely. It's basically a spacer bead on top of a little ball head pin, and then all you're gonna do is a wrap loop, okay? Just put that over there. You don't even need to be tidy with it. Wrap your loop. There you go. Round we go. And that's your charm. You're just going to snip it off with some slight cutters. And then you'll have time to tidy the ends. Mm -hmm. You need either a pair of chain nose or bent nose pliers. And there's your little charm. Lovely. Okay. In between all the gemstones that are on the necklace, they're rosary linked. So rosary linking, again, it's the same skill. It's a wrap loop. You'll see me <coughs> using, because I'm a bit more used to it, you'll see me <coughs> using my round Excuse nose. Me. You can change over to your flat nose pliers. Are you okay, Al? You can change over to your flat nose pliers if you find it easier to hold, but I've just used the round nose because I'm used to it. So then you thread on your gemstone. In this case, I'm using these absolutely gorgeous amazonite look at that color yeah it's That's lovely beautiful. isn't it okay i've left that tail there just snip it off when you're ready there we go and then we're going to do another wrap loop at this end and honestly i feel a fraud with these because it is so easy to make and i'm just basically <laughs> showing you how the entire necklace is made up of wrap loops. And that's how I wanted it to be. I wanted it to be simple. I wanted it to be something that a beginner could look at and say, it looks complicated, but it's not. It's really easy. So there's your first part of your rosary link. And then all you're gonna do with your wire, and this is point, point 0.6 wire. I wouldn't use anything bigger than 0.6 wire. Okay, so you make your loop there and then you thread your little one that you've already made onto here. Okay, so you can see that hanging down there and then you're just gonna wrap your loop again. Okay, you don't need to be especially tidy, you don't need any special skills to do it just a little bit of time a little bit of patience you could put the telly on and make this necklace i like that i like to make jewelry with tv on in the background yeah just so i said something <coughs> that's not involving any skills mm -hmm. you know it's great if you've got loads of different skills you know i i said i'm a silversmith i love getting me hammers out getting me saws out all of that but I also love just sitting down and relaxing. There we go. So that's your rosary linking, okay? So you've got your charms that go in between, you've got your rosary linking, it's still wrap loop. Mm. The only other thing I did on this necklace was I made a three strand into a one strand. 
and it was a very simple process. I took these, I think these are seven mil jump rings. And all you do is you just put three of them on. Mm -hmm. Bear with me. And then once the three of them are on, you can loop them together onto one jump ring and that will help you connect the entire necklace then. Get that in there. I said, as you can see, it's like zero skill involved. It's just nice and chill. Don't say that. There is No, skill. no, I mean in the, in the, in the very got, nicest you've, way. You've got to be able to visualise it. Yeah. And I think that's, you know, as much of a challenge. How many times we all talk about sort of not having the mojo? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. And that's what, you know, I really like about these is that if you've lost your mojo a bit, <coughs> these yeah. kits, there's so much you can do with these kits. I mean, in one of the necklaces, I actually used this as a focal point because I think they're really pretty and you don't need to oh, hide yeah, them. Oh, yeah, there. Yep. Oh, I've only just noticed. Oh, yes. So when you've got all three there and you've put jump rings on them, you can actually, she says put jump rings on, but I haven't attached them. But all you do is you just attach the three jump rings to one and it just converts it then to a one. And then you can put your chain there. And probably a really nice secure one too. Yeah, if I could show you, I don't know whether you can see the back of this necklace, if I yeah. can bring it into. Oh, we did pivot that round actually. We've just shown that, but we can do it again. Yeah, I don't know whether you can see the back of that anywhere. But you can Perfect. see, yeah, that's where the three is made into one. But yeah, you can see the little charm there. All they are is just little wrap loops. Very, very nice. I was just showing the back of this one as well, using that connector. So this is the amethyst necklace that yeah. uh, Nikki's created as well. But I love that, just actually having the tiger tail almost exposed. Yeah, it's nice, because I think it's really pretty. Um, and it, it, you know, it deserves to be seen, doesn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Again, if you see on that necklace as well, it's like I was talking about before, the use of jump rings and spacer beads. So yeah. there's a jump ring in between all of the different amethysts Love there. That. And then the little spacer beads. It's like I planned it, but I genuinely didn't know <coughs> that all the spacer beads and jump, jump rings were going to be on No, today. no, that's it's, true. You know, that is true. Lucky. It just happened purely by chance. Yeah. So that is all that that necklace involves is the wrap loop. The, on the instruction sheet, I just give you some measurements on how to arrange chain. And then everything is just a wrap loop onto the chain and then you've got a beautiful necklace wow absolutely loving that nikki that's beautiful Thank it is absolutely so beautiful and again i can see your inspiration loving the movement of everything oh, and, and I, to me i've always said this I, it doesn't matter whether it's the most advanced or the most basic technique you know it, it, it's a beautiful piece of jewelry yeah amazing now <laughs> i love what you've done there well, it's like we've been talking about that's the quality of Amazonite, and yeah. I was like, I've got a big boulder of Amazonite sat behind me. That's fabulous. Why have I not reached for it? But it does show the yeah. quality that you get in your strand, yeah. doesn't it? It does. It really does show. This is what we were referencing, what we were trying to reach for, yeah. when we were saying, you know, much more opaque, much more um, textured i suppose in the terms of the crystal uh, structure itself you can see that kind of feathering it's still lovely to yeah. have that patterning within almost like the amazonite fingerprint is what i reference it but you you don't want it too much does that make sense yeah. um so that it, vo it, it sort of uh, um hinders the glow of the gemstone hinders the, uh, you know you want a level of translucency um like, like you said like a little light bulbs in the center yeah. of the gem now so you get 60 centimeter strand you get the spool of your uh, of thread, you get the clasp, and you get the two Amazonite connectors just there. Should have been. Actually, we should have been more, sorry. Pro uh, yeah, we should have, yeah. But then you price pledged it under 20. Well, look at those, I, beautiful. I can't believe these prices. Mm. I really can't, because we don't get told how much these are going to go for. And, and I had a figure in my head what I was thought. it 19.99 not even close ah not even close it was double that well i mean and i don't think you're wrong then nikki because look what harrods are doing well i mean if you look at that necklace i would sell that amazonite necklace for around about 90 pounds yeah amazing that's an incredible and that's price silver plated 
Yeah. That's fine. If that was made with sterling silver, I would sell that necklace for around about 150 to 200 pounds. Yeah, that makes sense. I think yeah. it would be worth every penny because that would yeah. have a big gram weight. It's Absolutely. natural amazonite of quality as yeah. well. And plus the time that yes. it takes for you to create that as yeah. also. Yeah. But with I very simple, straightforward skills, the gemstones are so beautiful. They do all the hard work for yeah, you. Yeah, 100%. Um, well, we've spoken about at length today the popularity of Amazonite, um, not just in the tropical sort of bluey greens, but also in these <coughs> multicolors, you know, where you can see there's your classic Amazonite color, isn't it? There's your classic, but it also comes, look, bi colors. You can get sort of soft nude tones, you can get warm, almost like golden yellows. Very similar, actually, to palettes that you sometimes see um, within other gemstones, like your jadeites. 14.99 total knee-jerk reaction that was we should have been we should have been above 19.99 did yeah. you say 24 was well yeah we should have been at 24.99 that was our set price but knee jolt reaction basically it makes me a little uncomfortable sometimes because yeah. i think i and I, i've said this before i hope you don't look at the prices and think that that reflects the quality no. of the gemstones yeah because they are incredible No, quality. I mean, I've said that so, for so many years, it's no reflection of the true value worth. No. Just because we get a great deal, yeah. that's not what this, anywhere else in the world, that's why we show price comparisons. Yeah. Because they're not wrong. No. Harrods isn't wrong. These are like wholesale prices yeah. and less again. 100%. Monica Veneta is not wrong. No. It's us that's wrong at 14.99. Granted, you're buying strands here or projects if you like. You've got to make the piece of jewelry and yeah. that's obviously got to impact the price as well. But the sourcing of the gemstones. Um, 14.99, how many do we have them? 80 or the bigger quantity, which is good because this is a gemstone which is uh, so popular at the moment. Well, it, we'll see, won't we? Should we, have the, should we revisit this conversation in, tw you know, at the end of this Look year and 2025? Yeah, beautiful. Look at them. I mean, that's a little pair of earrings. Look at them. They're gorgeous. <gasps> Those earring findings we had this morning. Perfect. With the little the little topaz. Yeah. They'd be lovely, wouldn't they? They're just sitting there waiting to be made into gorgeous things. Yeah. They are beautiful. I love that. Do your do certain gems speak to you in certain ways? Yeah, definitely. And I do love, and I'm not just saying it, I do love Amazon. Yeah, me too. I do. Uh, I don't know many people that don't. Me neither. It as I said it has that universal yeah. appeal. It's gorgeous. I think it's because it's got such a mixed palette, but I think it is also that thing that it is like the sea. Yeah. And I think everybody loves anything to do with the sea. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I'm scared of the sea. Oh, yeah. I am. I, I, I am really scared of the sea. You need to come to our But beach. I also think it's beautiful. Come do you know what I mean? I couldn't, I would go on the beach and I would yeah. paddle around, but I would never swim. No. At, I'm terrified of the sea. Yeah. Um, but it is beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, And, and, it and I can see why so much of it is such a source of inspiration yeah. for creative people as well. It's yeah. stunningly beautiful. The colours, the sheer colours that you see. Yeah, I mean, if anybody goes on my social <coughs> media, they don't, mm. all they will see pictures of the beach because yeah. that's all I ever put on because I just love it I just love yeah, the changing it scenery and but I love gemstones that remind me of it because sometimes it's structurally the necklace or the bracelet might not be mm -hmm. um, immediately sea inspired but the gemstones themselves might be yeah but I think even I said the pinks and the purples yeah. and the reds they're all part of that nature palette, and I love that. Yeah, I love it, it, so it probably it might even happen subconsciously, I guess, if yeah. you love the sea. Uh, and, and I agree. I don't want you to think that I don't love going to the seaside because I definitely mm -hmm. do. No, I get what uh, you're saying. I, I would. It be should. We should be much. scared of it to a certain yeah. degree. Yeah. It's quite. Yeah, it's, you know, it's a powerful force, yeah. isn't it? Um, anyway, look at this. The labradorite. Wow. And it is flashy labradorite as well. Flashy labradorite. Yeah. I like that. It is. I like that. It certainly is. Oh my goodness me. Yeah, yeah. you're right. Um, some incredible flashes of blue um, from the labradorescent. So I don't know. For such a long strand, there's a lot of flash in it. It's hard to catch. I know it's hard to catch in here. It always is on our screen, yeah. on our cameras. It always, took, always is. It took a great photo of the earrings that I made <coughs> using the bars. Wow. And, and it's got a flash of gold right the way through it. Yeah. Stunning. And, and that's labradorescence, a beautiful phenomena effect that happens totally naturally. 14 99 purely because 
we took the other projects lower and again you get the same you get the instructions as, again you get that um, with uh, Nicola's project as well so just because Nicola's it's in the photograph is actually the Amazonite doesn't mean you can't make it with the Labradorite oh absolutely there and you it go. would look amazing with the Labradorite it'd look amazing with any of them and as I said if you like the look of any of the other things that I've made I will be putting little tutorials on the JM guest designer page as well so you can have a look unbelievable unbelievable there we are can you see that sorry i think it's really important to sit show the quad here you go just because just holding the gem that's the joy the thing is with labradorite it's one of those gemstones that you know can you see here yeah. there you go when you hold it just flat on your on the back of your hand you don't see the you know that phenomenal effect amazing well done everybody congratulations okay the last of your projects beautiful amethyst and it's rich it's regal it's, it's a wonderful intensity of color and a stunning piece of jewelry nikki Thank you. now this has been the most popular on pre-order lots of you have shopped ahead on this one i'm not surprised again same components effectively so you get the three multi-way bar times do you know what two. i love about these in the amethyst is that the bars have different shade variations <coughs> in them yeah and i just think they are beautiful yeah it's more like a, a chevron or a dog tooth yeah. at amethyst it's isn't it gorgeous i don't know about you nikki but we rarely see amethyst nope. very rarely see it on our live tv shows i'd love to do a, um, a showcase yeah. Oh, yes. Ah, really? Really? Mm. Okay. Bam. I didn't know that. It is 20% off, yeah. Feb 20 is the discount code. Look at that color. That's, that's insane. That's ludicrous. And it's natural. So wait, you get three pound off that price tag. That's ludicrous. So that's a 12 pound project. I'm telling you now, and, and please trust me on this, that is not a £12 strand. No. No way. Definitely near. don't. It's, a th it's 60 centimetres, yeah. firstly. That's the first thing. Secondly, look at the colour. It's textbook. We well, have to look yeah. at the images on our web. Yeah. I actually think the one, the one I have here in the studio is a better colour than the amethyst we've used yeah. on that photograph. Do you agree? Do you agree? So, sorry to our to our marketing team but it is it's a better color um this is more like the graphics feb 20 isn't it look at that yeah. chocolate box purple 12 pounds yep. and i will show you how to make the necklace i made which again is very straightforward to make you don't need any special equipment nothing like that it's very very straightforward and easy to make and wow i mean it, it, that's it's gorgeous. blowing my mind <laughs> yeah it's absolutely gorgeous and i like the fact there's movement in between yes. the beads too um amazing how many did we have then roscoe sorry 80 available however the phone lines have lit up it's the most popular kit by far um again if there's really if there's a, if there's a queue on the phone lines you can always shop with us on the web and the app as well sorry all of a sudden my shoe just fell off um <laughs> so there's Happens. never any cues there use feb 20 as well on your discount um on your discount and then you get a further three pounds off i mean it's amazing at 14.99 you will love you love working with them mm. it's such fun to work with so so lovely to have they're just lovely to have in your hands it's one of those gemstones you know like historically it was a gem that was worn to show like power and status yeah. I can see that. I can. It has that sort of rich regal look about it, doesn't yeah. it? It always remember. It reminds me of something like really luxurious and you know, like velvet or yeah. something like that. Yeah. It's got that sumptuous yeah. beauty. Amazing, amazing. And if you've loved Nikki's projects, then I do also have some Jadak versions. Oh, hello. Yeah, I know. The most gorgeous combination. Um, um, do you know what? We are going to start with. Thank you, Lauren. She could see, she, you, could, you could foresee the issue that was coming my way, couldn't you? Oh my goodness me. So oh. if I slide that to you, lovely. <coughs> oh my goodness. Good Lord. Uh, what, tell me what these are going to. Less than 20 of each. So, uh, what, 10 o'clock today I said, you know those strands that we oh. used to get of pearls, you know? Look. Oh. 
Oh, they're limited. Very, very, very I limited. I want that um, kit. Me too. Right, okay. I'm going to show you all three together. These are extremely limited. Not only because of the jadeite either. It's not just the jadeite is making them scarce. Which, of which, by the way, look. Oh, can That's you the one I want. Can you see? You've got what? How many drill holes there? Sorry. One sec. Four, I think. Is that four? It's hard to see, isn't it? If I put, put a white piece of paper behind, does that help? Five? Five. Five, yeah. And remember, you don't have to use all five. No. You can use as little or as many as you like. Times Cause... three, four. Oh. You get four of them. And they're not small either. Sorry, this I'm displaying this dreadfully. Uh, they're beautiful. So limited, and there's loads of you there. You get a meter of pearls too. It's not just the jadeite which is getting making this limited. It's also the pearls. Yeah, I would mix them with the other kits. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah, all day long, amazing. For maybe one of those jadeite pieces, it's type A. It's natural yeah. black jadeite. Remember what we were, we were discussing? Yeah. Not jade loosely. No. Described type A jadeite. We're at £499, extremely limited. Ignore that though, says Roscoe. And those pearls, that shape. Lovely, aren't they? It's a metre. I can't believe we're bringing a metre to it. What? Who launched this? I've never seen these. Wayne did. He should know better, absolutely. No, because it was Wayne, if anything, that, that was like, can't buy the pearls for that price. Never mind the jade eye. He talks about the pearls. Can't buy them at that price. That for me, I'd use. I'm pinching these off you. Yeah. Two earrings. Yeah. One on a necklace. Yeah. One on a bracelet. Perfect. Amazing. Amazing. $69.99. Well, you know you've Black got to. Jade eye. Seriously. I know, it's jet black, isn't it, as well? Um, you know you've got, they've gone too low because you've got split pay. Yeah. You know, this should, in my head, if you just said pay. 149, that would have been amazing. At 149, incredible price tag. Um, the fact that you've got, look, solid bars of type A jadeite times four. You can see it there now, can't you? Yeah. And the pearls as well by the meter. That's and if you beautiful. love this, keep on dialing through because... I don't have to do too much here. In fact, I will because there's. Not quite. Slight difference. Wow. But again, can we just for a second realise that that's a whole metre of genuine <laughs> culture pearls? Not faux, not simulant, genuine pearls. And the shape and the size as well, which is so versatile. Yeah. Ready? Oh, they're beautiful, aren't they? So glossy. I'm going to put this one that way so you can see that solid bar. You do get, obviously, four of them. Ah, oh, amazing. Type A Imperial White Jadeite. This is actually madness. Because look, look, yeah, it is very lavender and it's really yes. translucent. It's got a lovely high water content to this as well. So not coarse jadeite. Again, look, just half that price. Basically, thinking about this way, it's £35 for your type A jade, which is utterly ridiculous. Um, and then you're getting £35 for your pearls. Absolute ridiculous. craziness. Um, how many do you have of those, Roscoe? Less than 20. Um, let's bring you the green because we're running out of time. The green is incredible too. They're all amazing. This is film star jewellery. Isn't it just? It is. And it's the perfect combination as well. Jade item and pearls. Yeah. I love that combination. I do too unbelievable oh look at that i can't choose to be honest i love them i know all. well every one that you've brought out i've thought i want that one but this the the pearls just make the green pop yeah they even work more. don't they they work beautifully so again you get the four look at that color look at the look at the quality of translucency remember in jade you're talking about color but actually crystal structure translucency is what is that sorry i've just looked up 49.99 10 pound per component ross is just saying look that's not me that's all wayne but again you talk about translucency the water content how 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 it should look like a melting ice cube remember top yeah. quality there's only 12 left within the vault that's ridiculous 
I've just looked up and saw that price tag, goodness me. And even the graphics, again, and I know I keep saying this, but they are not fully transmitting how beautiful that yeah, gemstone is. Yeah, it's a really, really beautiful green, isn't it? It is. You know, it is. It's, it, it's translucent. It looks wet. That's what Does it should look like. Glossy. Jade, top, top quality jade should look wet like an ice cube. Um, and you can see that intensity of colour. Amazing. Plus, the pearls on their own should be more, more than that. Yeah. Shouldn't they? Those pearls are really hard come by. Yeah, especially now. Okay, right, I'm gonna squeeze one finale deal for you as well. And Nikki did reference these earlier on. So here we go. You get <coughs> all five. I've got 50 available. Five designs. How about 10 pound each, sterling silver? That'd be incredible, Fabulous. wouldn't it? Are they five different? Oh yeah, five different designs, yep. one of each. How about that? Ten pound each. They are sterling silver, mind. If you see me without a slider bracelet on, there's something wrong. I did notice your slider bracelet Always earlier on. It's lovely. A slider bracelet. So ten pound each for per slider bracelet. That's amazing. Easy. Forget that, says Ross. It's our finale deal. Wow. <laughs> Is that? Buy three, get two for free. Buy three, yeah. get two for free. Yep. That's crazy. It's unbelievable. We've got 50 though. 50 available opportunities. Your classic slider bracelets. That's probably one of the, uh, yeah, I agree. Ross has just said that's the best slider deal we've, we've done. And I agree. They're nicer than the usual sliders as well because they've got this lovely sparkle on Yeah, on how these close sliders. can you get in there? Because they are all different in their designs. They're gorgeous. That's like little dots on it, isn't it, that one? But they're very sparkly. Yeah, beautiful. So you got detailing. That's what, six pounds each? Well, just... Wow. Amazing. We're running out of time. Make sure you're checking out your baskets. Nikki, it's been lovely to be with I you today, my to darling. Here today. Thank you Bless so you. Much. When are you back? Joy. I'm back, I think, on the 12th of March. Oh, not too long. Not too long. We look forward to that. As well. That's, is that with us? It is with you. Yeah, yeah, amazing. Have a lovely afternoon, Joy Makers. I'm back with you Saturday morning. I'm going to be joining the lovely Rachel. Enjoy the rest of your day, everyone, and we'll see you very, very soon.